Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gifts? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? Here at Hobby Maker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Hello, good afternoon. How are you all? Hope you are all well. Welcome to Hobby Maker. My name is Ruth Lynette. I'm going to be taking you through today until five o'clock. Then we've got gorgeous Rosie taking over, leading you right through for the rest of the show. Very excited to see Rosie again. Also very excited because we've got the lovely Natalie from Hunky Dory back with us today. And you're also going to meet Sarah, joining us, brand new guest, joining us from Hetty's Crafty Creations. If you love your cross stitch and plenty more, there's loads to choose in for. Uh, choose in for, oh, it's happened already. Loads to tune in for, there you go. And of course, I'm very delighted today. Don't laugh at me already, Adam. He's been trouble in my ear already. I'm gonna blame that on Adam. In fact, let's go to them in the gallery. You've got the lovely Laura, you've got Adam in there as well. Yeah, you get running, Adam, out you trot. He's trouble. He's hiding in the shadows. Two right as well. Uh, Dan the man on camera two. We've got Blue Eye Dan floating around behind the scenes. We've got Ellie off the telly, who is literally off the telly right now. And last, but certainly not least, I am very excited to be joined by this gorgeous lady because I haven't seen her forever. We've got the gorgeous Corinne joining us again from Crafters. Thank you. Yay. Thank you. That's a nice welcome. Well, I'll come back lovely. again if you're going to give me that sort of welcome. Always will do. It's Thank so you. nice to see you. It's been forever. It's been, it has. It has been so long, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, too long. But this is really exciting today. Absolutely. Big yeah. showcase today we for are. ourselves at Crafters because those of you that love every Everything that Crafters Companion stands for are going to absolutely dive on this because not only do we have a fantastic deal on this beautiful magazine we've also got the opportunity to get yourself a little bit of a bundle as well so we are going to dive straight into this because this should. is I mean, it's jam pack full, and it's a. We need. I feel like we even need a little brand drum new roll. magazine or a song. Yes. Even more than a drum roll, a drum roll and a song. Oh, that's perfect. You do the singing, I'll do the drum no, roll. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, so. Your crafters, crafters inspiration, absolutely fantastic. Uh, it's a, it's a phenomenal magazine filled with so much inspiration. So if people haven't met your magazine yes. before, what 
do they expect right it? so this is our our new look magazine yeah. we relaunched it with our first one in february so this is a, a issue two as it says on here mm -hmm. so this is now more of a project based magazine so what we have done is we've obviously given you the magazine and yeah. we are going to look at it and i hope i'm not going to ruin it for anybody because we're going to have a really good yeah, look we at are. this but we're not going to go you're still going to get lots because you're going to be able to when you get it look at all the step by steps and everything Super. but a the majority of the projects are made using this little kit. Now, it's amazing that we're launching this today because I think our full Bohemian collection launches today up at oh. Raptors TV. And this is like an exclusive add-on to oh, that fabulous. Bohemian. This isn't bits from there. So don't think, oh, if you've if you've already got that, yeah. it's too late. Or maybe it's tomorrow. It's very soon. It's, it's very, very soon. Very soon. Yeah. I know it's here I think we have tomorrow. it tomorrow. Right, OK. Right. That's what's possibly getting me confused. Yeah, that's all right. Um, so this is extra bits, not mm -hmm. bits taken out. It's yeah. extra bits that will go with that collection. But will also work completely exclusively on their own. So I'm going to do you four pro uh, demos today because I've got yep. a couple of shows. And then there are so many inside the magazine, yep. all just using this. We don't call on the full kit, we mm -hmm. do this. But then as well as that, we and I'm going to show you this in a minute, we're going to then go back to some of others I can see are... Um, what do you do? Colour your world range. The words went there. Um, there's lots of different ones as well. So if you have bought things recently, yeah. you're going to have some inspiration sure on how to use those. Oh my and gosh, of papers. course, the papers that are oh. in the centre of oh, the. Oh, there you go. And little bits to be cut in at toppers to be cut in out. Look at these papers. Oh my goodness. Aren't they? And just like Crafter's Companion, as you'd expect, double sided paper. So we'll look Fabulous. at those properly in detail as well. Glitter pastes, yeah. yeah, you've seen our glitter paste recently. Lots, lots it's more go full detail. And instantly, you know that this is your magazine because instantly, just, just focusing on the quality of those papers, you feel that quality instantly. The prints are iconic when yeah. we're talking about crafters. This is one that Corinne's been chopping around and using. You'll see that in a second. Uh, but you instantly know that this is crafters. And when you feel it and when you touch it, you know exactly. Yes. Even if you had your eyes shut, you would take a real stab yeah. in the dark and know exactly. So when you when you're looking at the magazine, you've obviously yeah. got magazine paper. Yeah. But the minute you turn to changes. the papers, yeah. it changes and it's full quality. It's Fabulous. you know it's what you'd expect. It's not card. No. It is papers because that's yeah. what they are. Yeah. I would say possibly. 120, 150 GSM, something like that. So it's a yeah. nice quality for doing all your bits and papers. Fabulous. So you're getting the papers, you're yeah. getting those dies. You're getting the dies. Um, you're also getting those stamps in there as well. I mean, this is just such a massive yeah. collection, but we're also going to throw you in a little freebie. Now, I am loving this. Um, and I've not seen it actually in use yet. Yes, but that's our Midas ink pads. They're absolutely the gorgeous. They are a pigment-based ink pad. <gasps> so you can see, but they're a metallic pigment ink pad. Oh, my gosh. They are really, really juicy, and they shimmer. So you can blend with these. They're pigment okay. inks, so the inks last longer. Larger molecules, so you, you right. know, last much longer. But they're also brilliant for heat embossing. Oh, really? Yeah, it's a pigment ink pad. <gasps> Of course. So heat embossed with this pigment silver. Mm. Oh, now, if you were to buy this elsewhere, yeah. I know this will be available on some magazine stands, in mm -hmm. shops, and obviously on Crafters TV. You might see it. You wouldn't get it with that, mag that no. metallic ink pad. That is no. the deal for here. Yeah, that's an exclusive deal for you today here at Hobby Maker. But there is so much in here in the magazine. We are going to go through this in detail in a second, but you aren't waiting for me. You want your deal price. I yeah. know that. You know that. There's loads of people there. And I love the selection of stamps. The embossing folder is stunning. It's so pretty, isn't oh it? Oh, my goodness. I mean, you're going to be able really to use it with stuff. all sorts of things, aren't I'm, you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. £14.99. Can we yeah. just have a quick scooter? You're getting the magazine. Okay. You're getting that fantastic mm -hmm. metallic ink. You're getting that incredible dye. You've got that fabulous embossing folder. Then you've got all of the stamps. If, if you were to sort of split this down, even if you wanted to go for five elements, your magazine, 
one of the stamps, the embossing folder, the dye, the pigment ink, that's five elements. Yeah. Five elements into £15. It's not, well, it, it's, it doesn't affect. Let's, let's be generous and say that's 9 99 for the dyes, which you're looking at me as if to say, yeah, and the rest. <laughs> but let's just, let's just say 9 let's 99 just let's, yeah, absolutely. And then the ink pad, all our ink pads are 5 99 There you go. So I've already got to £16. Yeah. Before I've done my embossing folder, which is probably another fiver, before no, I've nice. done my stamps, which is probably let's go 8.99 something yep. like that so you know you've got another what do we say five um we've got 14 pounds there yep. and then you've got the magazine with all of that inspiration pages in there yeah. not including the back cover but 60 and all those pages. papers yeah all your papers which papers. you normally pay for i mean yeah. it's a stunning stunning deal whenever yeah. we get them like this obviously uh, literally 10 percent of the stock gone straight away we have a good quality stock on these quantity stock sorry mm -hmm. on these but it is about the quality of what you're getting and don't forget the inspiration the projects what you're seeing in here are phenomenal and this is different isn't it a, a slightly different focus to perhaps the the additions that, that the issues yes. that we've and we'll have before. a look at some of those so we've got some of our previous ones yes we, our issues three and four before where they came in yes. a wallet now those to me they were brilliant, absolutely yeah. jam-packed. And you still got things, you've got dyes and you've got all sorts of bits and pieces in there. But they were often a, um, a lot more technique-y based. Mm -hmm. So it depends what you like, you know what I mean? This, yeah. you are going to find, it is so project-led. So you're going to get all of those projects. You, it's absolutely jam-packed full of your projects. And we're going to give you the step-by-step. -step. Should we have a look? We're talking Why a not? lot about it. So Why not? There we have go. Gander. Right, so, I mean, mine's in my box. It, co yeah, it comes in this box. little box. It all comes in your little box. But, I mean, whether you want to keep that, it's to you. It's a nice way to store yeah, it. Then. But I think you'll probably find you'll take it out of there. When you open it out, in there is your magazine. Absolutely gorgeous. So it looks lovely and crisp. And you'll also find, there will be in little packets, but obviously, as you can imagine, mine are out of my packet. You'll find your dies. So this, if you look at this, imagine this. So you've got this one. I love this shape. It, now... Our Laura states a mandala, but if I, but if I put that there, and then oh, well, I wanted that one, I then can put. I've got the hanging element, mm -hmm. and then I can start. Can you see straight away? I'm building ah. my own little dream catcher. Oh, that's so cute. Can you imagine just keep putting some more on like that? You mean you could even put the larger feather on, but you possibly yep. wouldn't. You know, you can even come up at the top as your hanging element, and then How put cute. it. Can you that's see? Beautiful. So whilst that's a lovely mandala, these are beautiful feathers. These are the smaller mm. two of the feathers because you've got a large one. You've yeah. got a moon and a st and stars, yeah. but you've also got your dream catcher. Mm -hmm. So whilst you might think if, if we'd have given it you as a dream catcher, you'd have looked at that and gone, it's a dream catcher. Yeah, totally. But what we've done is we've broken it down so you can now turn it in, use it in all of its component yeah. elements as well, which I yeah. think is a lovely way to do it. Look at the stamps. I'm going to just pop this. Aren't they? So look at the moon crescent with all the bits in it. You're amazing. Radiate positive vibes. I'm going to oh. show you something lovely to do with that stamp in a bit. And then we've got this one here. And then again, we've got our embossing folder. 2D embossing folder, really, really easy to use, just with your top and your bottom plate. It's lovely. Isn't and it's it? a way to go. Do it on your metallic card, because yep. I know we've got some bun card bundles on there. Yep. Do it on your black with your um, gilding waxes, because I know we've got the gilding waxes on the on show today. today. We're going to do it on white, and then we're going to go in with our inks. You can use whichever inks you want. You know, mm. so many different ways to use it. Yeah. You know, I think... I've always said, I think embossing folders are probably one of the most underrated tools yeah, I'd in agree crafting. With that, yeah. We forget about, you just think, oh, it's a bit of plastic, but actually yeah. what you can do so with much. an embossing a folder, don't forget you can letter press with it. There is so many techniques. Yeah with an embossing folder. Yeah, and you are loving this. I've got to say already, Kate, yeah. Marilyn, oh, wow. Sheila, Sandra. <laughs> um, I, I've got beyond a full screen. Uh, yeah. Maureen, Julie, Helen, Kathleen, Tracy, Diane, Carol, Sandra, Pauline, Beryl. I can't read all your names out because you've disappeared off the bottom already. I've uh, got a lot of these in baskets as well and people on the phone lines. And I don't blame you. I mean, look at all of these fantastic sample cards that you're seeing here. And don't forget, they don't have to be cards. These could be no. home demo projects. These home decor, boxes, gift bags, Dialing, all diaries. 
Yeah. Bookmarks as well. That would look lovely on oh, a bookmark. Beautiful. Yeah. Capture. Cover the front of a decorative notebook. Yeah. Would look. Stunning. You know. You know. All those positive vibes. You know. Yeah. If you if you've got somebody starting a new job. Yeah. Um, or a new career, mm -hmm. or a, a new self-employed, or something like that. New journey. Decorate a box. Put um. You know that positive vibes stamp on the front. Gorgeous. And the dream catcher. You know how beautiful would that they be? Fab, aren't they? We're going to do those. something along the lines of that, and almost give what you've got in your hand now. That's mm -hmm. one of the examples from the magazine of give um like a faux emboss background it's lovely that is it is isn't it yeah most so simple design but so but much you can do really them. effective yeah really really fab uh, so keep checking out on that let's have a little look in that magazine then, shall shall we? We? We said, there's shall lots and lots of different projects within here you've got your papers in there as well mm. and of course you will feel that quality from the paper uh, instantly when it flips between the magazine and the paper it's it absolutely okay. fabulous i've got this here and i'll open this one so obviously it's got our sarah on the front yeah and we as it says on the front we've got a lovely um interview with leanne because we we know you oh. all love getting your inspiration so there you go so the editor of this because we now have them um um done elsewhere mm -hmm. we've got the editor put in on here you know the um the adverts that you see will be quite um relevant to our crafters yes, and things on here and then you get a nice little overview oh, nice. i love this look you can come from what i'd call your shabby chic or your grungy to your really yeah. clean look and it's quite nice to have that sort of um thumbprint flick yeah, through like on these. there so really lovely now straight away oh there we go so what's in the box talk to you what's in the box what's mm -hmm. in the papers everything and a few little examples so sort of wet your you're getting i love the fact again you get that all of down this. the side yes. and it gives you an overview an overview very much like actually your your 12 by 12 yeah. or the 8 by so you've 8 you've got 14 sheets of a4 wow. and your two topper Amazing. sheets as well so there's a lot in there now the first sort of ones you you've got oh. in here are from our once upon a time now that if that did you see that collection oh, really about three two oh i lose track time has i, I don't know, know. i live it, i live in it. a strange world that has no living in a bubble i do yeah i have no concept of time whatsoever so anyway quite recent um, so you've got a couple of inspiration but what you're seeing there you know we're doing it with an embossing folder you know take the inspiration and change it up it's yeah. brilliant then we're sort of coming on to the 20th of March oh um, there we go one. so it wasn't that long ago positive um, positivity projects so some lovely Great. ones on here but everyone so you get a little overview and then you're going to get what you need everything that you need and then your step by steps and where it's relevant we're also going to give you um top tips because this one is embossing um acetate okay had you thought about no. embossing acetate before and actually and then popping it in a shaker card yeah it's really different doesn't it yeah looks lovely i love this resist technique that's one of my favorite techniques to do nice. masking you yeah. know there are so many different ways and then as you said it's not all about just regular cards bringing in bits that you've got from your crafty stash that little tiny bulldog clip on there and i've never thought about that it's stamping on the back of your die so using your die as a stamp at the bottom left of that that page so you've got that there can you see that on there so you literally yep on page 14 using those inks uh, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. The die. yeah. That's really, I mean, Lovely, why not? Isn't it? Yeah, why not? Idea. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you're going to get a that. different look because you're doing it on the back. So you're getting yeah. quite flat. But what they've done is they've then laid the die cut over the top. Yeah to really highlight that clever. detail. Really yeah. There are some clever people out there using your stamps to create backgrounds. And again, on here, very different looking backgrounds. And I love this sort of the grungy dog. So now cool. this one here, look, just using one of the toppers, they yep. are for you to trim out, but it's mm -hmm. lovely when you do trim them out and do that. I mentioned embossing on um, metallic, um, mirror card you know craft oh, metal wow. yeah, that looks, looks really lovely but how about mixing both of these do mixing your toppers with your um dies or your stamps yeah really right. lovely techniques and then we're sort of telling you a bit about our um shimmer ink pads because these are something that have come in stock quite recently and i think we've yeah, had them here those. again oh have you not seen no. them they're right behind i mean you. they are behind they me are behind i'm gonna you. dive and have a look in a minute yeah <laughs> they are lovely they're a pigment ink pad and wow. they are what i would call what we we all call as liquid centura pearl card Ooh. so you know your centura pearl card mm -hmm. you sort of smooch them over your card it's as yeah. intense as that but in an ink pad 
So you wow. can match them up. Absolutely well, people brilliant. People falling over themselves to get that already by the sound. I know. You might be on there. <laughs> <laughs> Probably Jimmy. And then, you know, we just keep in going. Now, another one. I love this. So this is our glitter pastes. So we brought through some glitter paste quite recently. Yeah. And we're giving you a few. But what I love is we're also mixing and matching it showing you well actually if i look at that one that actually isn't done with this collection but everything i'm seeing here in this card here mm. i could actually create with bits from here yeah definitely so i could almost i've got if i've got the, the, the stencil but i could also make my own stencil using the um the dies mm -hmm. and then i could stamp out some yep. of the stamps that you got so take that inspiration and just make it a little bit different. Own. Oh, you've got that yeah, one Yeah, that's there, the card. So, so you can see there, but you can obviously adapt it ever so slightly. I mean, it's giving it kind of a peacock effect there, but obviously if you're using that die, if I grab hold of it from there, everything will crash. Uh, but if you use that particular die there, very similar effect. You can easily imagine that kind of looping around and yes. cascading around that design, but absolutely fab. These are brilliant. They are brilliant, aren't they? So we then, so what I love about this magazine is the, the breadth of the designers that we've got in here. Really and nice. I come on here and I know Debbie, I think she's back tomorrow or the day after. You just had Michelle this week. Yeah. Craig will be here, so is our Jan. And we all bring something different. Yeah, exactly. And that's what you want from a magazine as well. It would be all, it would be no good if we just brought you one designer and then mm. one designer filled the magazine because it doesn't matter how much you try. As a designer, you have a, you have a style. Yeah, and that, that style will show through. Even if you try to do a different yeah. style, you'll see that person. But the fact that we've got, so we've got Vicky, Vicky here is now going to bring in some more. And obviously, I can see there's a lot of textiles in her. So she's got, um, she's got the um, oh, Hessian nice. on the background. And again, on this one, she's got the twine down here. Yeah. Again, if you don't have those, maybe you've got a Hessian style embossing folder. If you don't have any Hessian, yep. you can do that. I always like to... Do you know, even if I was to start with one of these, I bet it wouldn't finish like this because no. I would still interact, interject my take on it. Yeah, We've got on some from Jen here, which she's all about, obviously all about the papers. Oh, so lovely. I can see she's done some weaving on here. Yeah. She's done some folding down here. And then she's sort of made Never. like little cylindrical shapes mm -hmm. on here. She's saying use a pencil to shape the straws. You know, so lots of different, so different looks. Um, Sarah Jackman Reed on here. So she's... Um, Oh, how would I describe that? Really she really obviously nice. likes to do her stamping on there. Mm -hmm. Some really vibrant colours on here, aren't they? And you're looking, everyone is different. Now, and these, these are all projects for every level as well, yes. aren't they? Whether you're more advanced as a crafter, maybe this is the first time you've been flicking through thinking, I, I really want to get involved. And maybe you're thinking of, uh, of starting. We uh, all starting have days this. where, whether we're an experienced crafter or we're brand new, where we just need that little bit of a hand help or... Yeah. We just need somebody to, you're going, I've lost my mojo. I just yeah. need somebody to kickstart me. Because like I said, even if I was to make one of these, I bet you it would be different by the time I finish. I because I would just go, oh, well, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do it this little bit. But it would get me started. Yeah. Just, yeah, exactly. Yeah, and that's all you that's need. All we need sometimes, yeah, absolutely. Really absolutely. Right, now, and I'm then, at the bit of my papers. Love things. Now, the first two pages. So you've got some backgrounds. If you really don't want to use the toppers, you've got the backgrounds. But what we've also got is we've got these beautiful images. And what I love around these is you've got the white... I say white, it's cream space mm. around each one. So you can cut it on the edge or you can cut it within there. So you've got a really nice, easy to follow cutting line Fab. on those. And then I would just get my trimmer out on those yeah. ones. Gorgeous colour tones. And look at uh, this colour tone is beautiful, isn't mm. it? This sort of, it's got an autumnal -y feel it has, to it. it. Yeah. Beautiful. Look at the dream catcher. So you can see where Glorious. we were saying, you know, you've got the, L I know they're totally different, but you can see how, giving you that inspiration yeah. of how to build up your own dream catcher totally. and again we've put pattern papers on the back but not our best pattern papers a more simpler pattern paper so you Still don't gorgeous. feel like you're yeah. sacrificing <laughs> one of your best papers to cut no, those out no. now the great thing is you will see if you've seen any of our paper pads in the past you will know the quality of our designers and of our paper designs they are absolutely brilliant now look at this see first of all first time i looked at that i'm going Dog rose, wild rose, you know, a little bit of daisy in there. And then I looked and went, oh, but there's a dream catcher just in there. I spotted that. You, know, you, you just, don't see it at you first, don't, do you? you? But, 
you know, I've That's got these I've bits got. on the top, then I've got another layer, then yeah. I've got that misty layer, then I've got my orange and pink background. Gorgeous. There are, oh look, and I'm seeing here, and perhaps I didn't see before, almost like um, what looks like it could have been stenciled through, yeah. the little white yeah. layers as well. So even now when I'm looking at this, I am on. still seeing different bits. Mm. But if you want something a little bit simpler, you'd maybe go up to that corner. If you wanted something a little bit busier, you'd maybe come down yeah. to that corner. You yeah. can pick the bit you want. But then, look at that. Gorgeous. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? So yeah. you can see it's all worked so perfectly. If you want a project where you turn the corner, you're going to have that. If you want to make flowers out of this, you know they're going to be double-sided. And isn't this pretty? Look at that. Look at the lights. Wonderful. Like festoon lighting. There. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. And then all that beautiful florals and then it's sort of a version of that mm. so we've still got look at dream that lovely catcher dream again. catcher and again oh, and all the time you've got those beautiful flowers on the back these are lovely aren't they what are those mm. flowers i'm trying to think what are those i don't know what those are but they're very pretty aren't they they're almost yeah. like trumpeted flowers aren't they we need i'm not always oh, yes. very good with my flowers no but and we then, can appreciate them yeah i can appreciate them <laughs> i love this that was match mix and a match look at that peacock feather in there and the tassels hanging down yeah. aren't they beautiful and then we've got some more more toppers more, more toppers more and then boy. so it's like a repeat now so there we go so you're going to get the repeat oh no it's different colors there isn't it or did i miss that one out but look at that i love that color beautiful they are amazing gorgeous I remember and as we said can you can you hear yeah they are much different thicker than the um than the papers you get for your magazine yeah you can tell straight away and that's only halfway through the magazine yeah. there is so much more we have in a look here. at the other half so in a minute? many so many projects in there mm. and all of this don't forget not just your magazine at 14.99 you are going to get all of your freebies in there as well your non-consumables so you're going to get those fantastic fantastic uh dies you've got the beautiful dies you can see there that fabulous embossing folder the stamps which are utterly utterly stunning and don't forget exclusive to hobby maker i really want i'm very tempted to open that up uh, you have this incredible metallic and it's just superb metallic silver who doesn't want that in their life and that's that i'm going to say that's free of charge because it's brand new um it, it's it, well as in it's exclusive to us in hobby maker as a bundle like this you won't get that anywhere with this bundle uh, it's amazing i'm going to say that's free of charge because when you start to equate all of this down in price point of 14.99 I, I think you, you can look at that straight away and go, that'd be a freebie, that'd be a freebie, that'd be a freebie. Even crafting magazines, they're not cheap. You know, you get so much within mm. them. I don't expect to pay the same price I would like, my, you know, your, your, your fashion magazines, no. your, you know, your, your news, your, your all of that celeb yeah. stuff. Um, you expect to pay a little bit less for those. A crafting magazine, you expect to pay a little You're bit paying less. for the inspiration. Of course you are. I mean, it, yeah. you know, you would not, it would take a lot of classes to go to for this amount of Projects. Yeah. And you think about going to a, a, a workshop with, with, with Corinne, she's very expensive. Uh, if you go to her, <laughs> because you're paying for her talent, you're paying for the years of experience that you have. There are so many different designers in here jam pack full for that price point and don't forget to gift this as well you might be buying this for yourself you might be thinking oh my friend would love this my nan would love this my Perfect, sister a little box is wonderful a gift, wouldn't it yeah absolutely for a gift. I'd, I'd, I'd love Perfect. it absolutely yeah. love it and um, we're going to do a demo we're going to come back to this and see the second half of the magazine in a second because not only do you get this jam pack full of inspiration corin's going to give you mm. even more because you're going to do something different i'm going to do you? something now it would have been really easy for me to have gone oh i'm going to pick all right i'm going to do that demo but i'm not i'm going to do yeah. something something hopefully a little bit different cool. so all i've done piece of white multi-purpose card this would actually work really well with your watercolor card as well because we're going to sort of get inky so whichever one you've got yep. now 2d embossing folder so these are the traditional embossing folders so anybody that's used a gemini before will know that a 2d embossing folder straightforward we just use our top and our bottom clear plate right really really easy if you haven't used one before and you're new to a gemini it's in your mag in your in instruction booklet exactly how you use it so if i open this now don't think to yourself just because these are um you know part of the magazine they're going to be any lesser quality now look at that look at how well that has embossed just lovely on the white really isn't it <laughs> isn't that gorgeous oh, oh laura's getting a bit crafty today she said she I think that should be in centura pearl that would 
Listen to that. Oh, she's been here a year. You can beautiful. <laughs> so you, you know, you let her press it. When I say let her press, what we do is we put the ink on the folder and we close it and then it embeds it into oh, okay. it. Okay. That's what letter pressing Fab. is. You know, different ways. So different right. ways of doing it. Now I have got three of my ink pads here. So quite um a range of colours. So I've got my grasshopper green, I've got my pink tulip. And I've got my orange. Now I'm doing this exactly the same as I would for um, I would do uh, I, for any other project, just because mm -hmm. it's my magazine. What I did first was I picked my paper that I want to use, and this is the paper that I want to use on this one. So it goes that way if you look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. So that was my colour inspiration. So you can obviously see the green, mm -hmm. the green and the orange, and then I picked out the pink as nice. well. I That's always go papers then my backing papers and then my inks okay it's much much easier right don't pick a collection of inks and go somewhere i'm gonna have a paper that matches this because that's the way madness lies you will never okay, you will never it. be able to match it up properly in the right. same way yeah go for your paper first then go for your solid color yeah but you can find one to go yeah. with it then go for your um go for your inks okay because tip I, that, I mean everyone has a different way but that personally is what i found yeah by far and away the easiest. Right, so you can see I've got my three inks. The pink never shows up so well. So I'm just going to pick it up with my blending tool, blend it onto your door. But now I know we've got quite a lot of tools on the show today of yes. which the um, we've got a blending tool um, oh, collection. Yeah. So there you go. So every time I do this, it will be different. I'll never get to the same. Mm -hmm. Pink tulip's gorgeous. And then gr this grasshopper is probably I love this one and pine oh, tree are my nice. favourite greens, but aren't they beautiful? Yeah, that's lovely. You can see on there. And again, would you have thought of going pink, green and orange? You probably wouldn't. Maybe not. But the papers work, if yeah. you know what I mean. So I the, tell you that those colours are going to work. They do. They? So then you can go back over where you've been. I don't want any harsh lines, so I'm just going to blend those colours one into the other so that you know there's no sort of start with one yeah. and finish of the other and then I'm just going to go back round I won't get them all in I think I, when I did this one at home I sort of got five strips in mm -hmm. across there and then we can come across here let's get a bit more I pink it's very cute it is it's it subtle like you said it's yeah the pink is definitely the most subtle of the colours that I'm using so if you need to just add a little bit of your fuchsia in there just mm -hmm. to Pop, pop it up pop a bit, it. but it's, I think it's working. I, I'm seeing it. Yeah. And then I'm going to go in with my green. And then once I've got laid it down, I go back in with my pink to blend it over because okay. it's the paler colour. I would blend it in with the paler colour rather than the darker. Right. So once I've got there, that's as much as I need to do. Now, you could come in there and you could um, spray, mist it with a little bit of water to sort of get some of that ink off. But what I'm actually going to do is and it's not something i do very often i'm going to pop that on there and then i've got my colored sparkle pens this isn't one of my clear sparkle pens right. so i went into my crafty stash and i thought oh i like this so i've just got one of my colored ones now this is the black sparkle pen so all i'm going to do is get plenty of ink on the end so now i don't know if we've got these we we're going to have a to. look we're going to have a look and see but then just splatter oh, nice. that all over there. Now, if you've not got that, a black ink pad will do that. But I just thought that was the quickest way to do it. Yeah. Oh, there I we don't go. think we've got any stock at the minute, but we'll definitely try and but, get But, you know, you, there are lots of different ways to do that. But how quick was really that as well. to really pop, make that yeah. pop? I just thought, you know, I'm always looking around at what I've got and that I haven't used mm. for a while. Yeah. And thinking, oh, could I bring that into my project? Let me just grab a little bit of a, a damp cloth here just to make just to get rid of some of the bits yeah at home and I didn't bring it with me is I have um one of those a4 stacking boxes right it's full of kitchen roll and I always and then I put what, the, the lid at the back yeah and then I splatter into that and it just contains it quite it. quite well <laughs> right now once I've got that all you want to do is let that dry you can give it a blast with your heat gun and then I'm just going to cut it into three and then stick it down. Look, just not dropping everything. So just to speed it up, I can show you this is exactly what I have done. Oh, so nice. can you see, I've just taken, taken 
you know this now you can see that doesn't match these paper colors don't match up to that Every, you know I'd, I'd got okay. two oranges one green and one mm -hmm. pink Two orange, yeah, two greens and one pink. So it's different every time, which is, which again is really lovely. So that's just literally getting your your trimmer, trimming it down. Yeah. I found it easier to stick it onto my black and then I trim my black afterwards. Right. It just made it a little bit yep. easier. So the next thing I want to do is I'm going to now all these dies will go through your small die cutting machines as well. Okay. Um, but we're just going to use my um, junior my Gemini because I've got it with my junior mm -hmm. plates on so I'm just going to get this lovely um, feather and we're going to pop that onto here now this is Centura Pearl cardstock and you know this is going to cut through Centura Pearl without any problem whatsoever and again just like that die cut that that embossing folder is not of any suit, um, inferior quality because it's come in your magazine these dies Oh, Natalie, she wants to make do you know what I mean? She? she always likes the focus on her, doesn't yeah. she? Natalie, everything for... She was like that. Oh, oh. Oh, she's actually got the hoover. Oh, that's all right. If she wants the hoover, she can do a quick quick hoover up while she's there. Oh, you weren't here when they let off the, um, the ca confetti cannon. No, yeah, no. It went everywhere. It went everywhere. Oh, somebody <laughs> let off an air horn when I was on air once and I nearly said something I shouldn't have done. I'm like, please warn me next time. <laughs> but look oh, at wow, that. that cuts out beautifully. That look beautiful. There we go. Oh, the Centura Pearl's amazing with it that. It is, isn't it? isn't it? Now, what I've done is I've also cut it out of black. Nice. So I thought that looks really nice too. Yeah. Then I also cut it out of black and I just put, before I took it out of the die, mm. I just put some of my low tack tape on the back to hold okay. the pieces in. Oh, okay. And I'll show you why. I'll show you why. Really easy to use. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get one of my orange ones. I'm going to just pop over that with my tape pen just to pop that over. Easiest way to do it. And then I'm going to glue that one on top of the other wet glue will work equally as well but now you see look doesn't that look beautiful really really different so it's it's almost created the matte layer for yeah. me which i think is stunning beautiful so then we can come in i'm going to use um one orange one black and one that's a joint colour. So right. Really lovely. Let's bring all these in. So as I've already given you a sneak peek, I've already done a little bit of the mats and layers of my cardstock. So we've popped that onto there. And then this is our pumpkin centura pearl. Nice. It's definitely, it's definitely one of my fav yeah. favourites. I really, really do like that. There we are. And don't forget, if you are checking out on your magazine, there's a lot in baskets. 100 went like that. Uh, for £14.99, you've got that fantastic magazine, 64 pages, all of those incredible projects. You've got your die, your embossing folder. You've got that fantastic set of stamps. And free of charge, don't forget, which is absolutely exclusive to us with this collection today. You have this amazing, amazing metallic silver Oh my gosh, look at that ink pad, incredible. Uh, so for £14.99, you can see just how much you're getting from this entire collection. You can. You Loads. Can. Right, so I have just put that onto a card base and then this matte layer that we just created, I popped that onto a matte layer again. So we're mm -hmm. just gonna pop those onto it. I've just put some liquid pearls on top. And so yeah. diagonal, again, it's all about the balance. I'm just yeah. trying to keep that balance. And then I've got some foam pads on the back of here. There we go. And then that, it's just moving with the wet glue, is going to go into the center of my card. So that looks lovely. Then I'm just going to get my feathers. So I thought what I would do is I would go black one first, yeah. then the orange one, and then I'd put my solid one on next. So okay. I just thought it all just sort of flowed yeah. and then can do that really easy. So if I oh, want those like that, I can just put a little bit of glue, put that glue on the back of there because it's going to hide everything. And then we can pop that from one corner. And then from the stamp set that you're going to get, I have got your amazing. Now, if you're looking at it, you think, oh, she's not matte and laid that properly. Well, I was concentrating on that end because what I'm going to do, made matte and layering so much easier, is I'm going to pop that under there just like that so you can't see. Tuck it in. You can't see that. So I just concentrated on that. Yeah. And that is 
my first take, really which nice is part. hopefully something completely different yep. to anything you're going to find in the magazine. So just because you've got all of those dozens and dozens of magazines. Oh, I'm sliding on there. I need to put that back. That <laughs> slipped. Perhaps I... Do you know what? I never got round to sticking that. I've just... Oh, that'll be why. That'll be why. There's nothing <laughs> on that. I'll stick it on. Um, you've got dozens and dozens in the magazine, but we're still, I can still give you even more ways to yeah. use them. It's just literally jam-packed full. So all of those incredible projects uh, for you to get inspired by. But don't forget, you are going to get those amazing, amazing papers in there featuring those beautiful toppers, gorgeous sentiments. You've got little tags in there as well. Some really lovely colourways, as you can see. Uh, one that's been chopped into. Uh, and <laughs> I swapped with Corinne. We did she a used swap, this one and then I've ended we? up showing it anyway. But look at the papers. I mean, they are signature crafters papers, they are, aren't, aren't they? they? As soon as you see but them, again, so it's much like, on you know, there. When I did this topper, with using this yeah. you think oh that's quite strange but as soon as you put it next to the papers in there it just works doesn't it yeah totally and remember all of this is £14.99 it comes in that lovely box so it's gift box to go you've got that fantastic set of stamps you've got the gorgeous embossing folder I think you're going to use that a lot wonderful dies and of course that exclusive to this bundle with us today that metallic silver ink which I know you're going to be dying to get your hands on because I am anything like that metallic I love uh, we do have some metallic pen and uh, some paint marks we're going to come to actually yes, in a second. Yes, because those would do that splatting technique. That, in fact, let's do those now whilst The splatting there. technique that I've just done, you'd be able to do with either of those. Love it. A splatting technique. Yeah. It just sounds, it's like, <laughs> it sounds like it's going to be something, something fabulous, like a tech splatting technique. Yeah. Love it. Uh, <laughs> with these gorgeous, gorgeous pens. So these are now, metallic paint marks, Yeah, they aren't? are. So they're, um, they are absolutely brilliant and they will go on so many surfaces i think i don't know if i've still got it here oh it must be the one that ran out i actually wrote on my tape pen with it the other day just to show that you can go on plastics you can go on glass you can go on your card you could go on stone you could go on wood with oh, them amazing. absolutely so versatile and you've got three nibs in each one you've got a really fine um nib almost like a fine liner yeah you've got a bullet and you've got a chisel Okay, for each one so each pack is the same color they're not mixed colors no. silver gold and bronze brilliant or copper is maybe is the proper name for yeah. it in there but you've got the three nibs in each one so it doesn't matter what you're doing whether you're trying to do calligraphy with them or fine yeah. line detail adding in those little dots and spots you're going mm -hmm. to find the right nib for that's them so there. clever give them a really good shake yeah shake up the um mica mm -hmm. and then um you're away to go so you could do that. Is that have a wine bottle on the back? Yeah, it will That's be. That's a great idea. Look at yeah. me, spot the wine bottle. <laughs> uh, but how fab is that? So if you want to personalise a gift, you bought somebody a bottle, you're going to a dinner party, you could write the name on, it could be happy anniversary or fun. Oh, you, you could get a wine bottle, still with wine, soak the label off yeah. and then draw your own design, design on the front. I like that idea. Or when it's, when it's gone, it. I mean, we could help with that. Yes. Uh, when the wine's gone, uh, obviously you could dry it out, fill it with little lights and just draw your own design. Yep. So much you can do with those. Uh, we are going to do them on a very special price it is a deal for all three of these so remember for nine pens they should be 10 pounds each instead it's like it's on a three for two so under 20 pounds for all three today is a sensational deal you are going to love those i need those in my life and the fact that you can write on so many different things as corinne said whether it's plastic or wood or stone or your glass phenomenal opportunity to really get crafty with those i think they're amazing actually and of course three different nib sizes in each set of those pens you've got the silver the gold and that fantastic kind of coppery bronze which is always really 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 exciting to have uh, so 1998 add those to your basket i'm sure you're going to use those a heck of a lot actually uh, so very well done if you are adding those in and remember of course it's only one set of postage and packaging as ever here at hobby maker so you can add one item or 101 it's up to you and it's still only three pound 95 uh, I will just say, obviously, we've got bank holidays, big weekend bank holiday. Uh, so it might be the things come to you, you know, projects and, and uh, bits and bobs come to you slightly later because of the bank holiday. So bear with us on that. But if you love these magazines, it might be that you're thinking, oh, I'd like some more of these, Ruth. I'd love issue three and issue four. Well, do you know what? We've got those for you as well. But we're also going to give you a freebie on these ones as well so why not these are fantastic again so your crafters inspiration you've got both volumes or issues i should say issue three and issue four but you're also going to get 
a really, really handy die here. This is a gorgeous one uh, from the Country Lane Sarah Signature Collection. Is it Sarah Signature Collection Country Lane? Yes. It is, isn't it? Yeah. I just doubted myself then. I thought I'd check with the expert. Uh, but you've got this wonderful kind of vintage frame. It's a lace frame. So usable. So incredibly, incredibly usable. And we're going to do you an amazing, amazing price point on these. So what are we going to expect from so, these two issues? Because these are slightly different. They're the slightly different. Seen. They're wallet based. Yeah. You're still going to get your um, freebies. So you've got a stencil and template. I'm looking at issue four now. You've got um, a stencil and template in there. You've got, what's this one? It's your, your star um, die. So you've got mm -hmm. your there and with the words. And you've also got a stamp set here. So you've got these on there. So some lovely fun oh, ones lovely there. Stamps. Now you've also got your papers in here. They're separate with some toppers on. And then you've got your magazine. So what you've, how this to me when I look at this how it's different is at the beginning of this magazine there are um, some projects so Helen has given you how many one two three four five six projects using those free elements or those included elements yeah now the rest of the magazine the re the other 55 pages are basically using existing collections Gorgeous. so that's lovely if you need a little bit of inspiration you yeah. bought one and you're thinking how do i use mm -hmm. those so this one almost flips what the new one is so in the yes. new one you might you've got one set of projects mm -hmm. using existing ones and everything else is from the the elements included right. in the bundle whereas this one flips you've got a few using the elements in the bundle yeah. and then lots of bits from collections that you might already have including that country lane that you're getting um yep, for your die you're getting the die set for not particularly for that one but you know if you've got some bits of country lane you'd lost that one then, i had then you? yes you totally lost that one all right, Corinne, no one had seen that. <laughs> <laughs> Pull me out. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's sort of flipped on the other direction. So it depends how you like your magazines. Do you want a general one and hopefully you've got a couple, if not all of those mm. collections, or do you want one where it's focusing more of the projects on what we're giving yeah. you? Yes, just, that makes sense. Yeah. I hope I'm explaining yeah. that well. <laughs> but regardless, there might be projects in there that you haven't got the dies for that you think, oh, I've got a different die. I've got a different die. But the actual exactly. placement or the idea, you're thinking, oh, yeah, I could use Colour that. Colourways, colour combinations, shapes, yeah. concepts. We're always looking for new concept Excellent. ideas, aren't yeah. we? And, and again, that's not your price, by the way. We haven't done yeah. the price yet. You are going to get both of these issues. Yeah. Uh, so you're going to get... So this one, you've got a stamp set. Lovely. You've got... And this um, is amazing, by the way. You've got a, a butterfly set. Oh, I love this butterfly set. So let me quickly show you this, because this is so pretty. This, to me, would go so brilliantly with your Colour Your World oh, collection. Very nice. Isn't that lovely? You can just use it. Or if you're doing a big um, scrapbooking page, that mm. would look lovely on 12 by 12. And a really lovely long border die set multi-layered die set isn't that That's really gorgeous. really pretty and so you're going to get all of these in here yeah <gasps> they... best wishes happy birthday you've got a little birdhouse look at those if i hold a little bit of card behind that just so you can see it how cute are all of they? They're really, really useful. They're lovely, aren't they? Aren't they gorgeous? Yeah. You've got that beautiful foliage at the bottom. Your little bird family in there as well. You've got a little bee. We love a bee. I, yeah, I think for me, for me, it's Both. that the board, the bottom border. Yeah. That flower border. I just so can see so many. Just make my own inky background and nice. then stamp that in black over the top as a, like a silhouette stamp. Yeah. That's why I'd be using that. Yeah. These are flying, which I'm not surprised, but we're going to do still so much more on that in terms of your price. Oh, look at those as well. Oh, aren't they cute? They're gorgeous, aren't they? Oh, look at the little ducks in there. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm not even listening to you, Laura, because I'm just, I'm just engrossed. <laughs> I shan't lie. Uh, it's just the little bunnies in there, the little geese as well. And of course, you've got, I mean, they literally just pop, pop out. out. So that's brilliant. And then you look at the papers that are here to match. You've got bunnies, you've got chicks. Uh, I'm just pulling all of these out because again, oh, that's nice, isn't it? With all the panelling in mm. there as well. That's lovely, isn't Very it? Very country cottage. Aren't they lovely? And of course, this is before I even show you the magazine, uh, which is amazing. And again, so much in there. You've got 72 tips and techniques 
in the magazine, which is quite phenomenal. Uh, we are going to do an amazing, amazing price point on this one for you as well. Uh, I won't even try and put that back. <laughs> and then, of course, your gorgeous magazine in there as well. Here we are. We've got a lot to do still. Full, absolutely jam-packed full in terms of all of your inspiration, those beautiful techniques and projects that you can see again using that lovely die uh, that Corinne just showed to you. Amazing, amazing opportunity here. Remember, you are getting both of these incredible issues and you're getting a free die, which is fab. And let's just say at the moment, even at this price, you're looking at just over £14 per magazine with the die, which isn't bad going, quite frankly. But 60 seconds on the clock and then we are going to drop on your price this deal price I have to tell you I even questioned I thought this was ludicrous and you know even if there's projects in here which you're thinking I mean that could be for a new baby very easily but if you're thinking maybe that's more uh, eastery it's not going to go off by next year these are projects you're always going to have in your armory but that's using the stencil from our Easter box but the other um, issue because that's issue three issue four we're giving you a banner stencil so how about taking that inspiration from book three and using the tools that were given you from box four yeah that genius. was a really good one to stop on and okay. to, to have no idea uh, but <laughs> that's the thing it's just yeah, totally. so you know brilliant that you can mix and match things around yeah wonderful projects in there and not just obviously card making lots more different sort of inspiration uh, in terms of your different medias in there but there are so so many of you there uh, we are bringing to you both of these inspiration magazines you've also got that useful free i'm going to say die that wonderful lace I mean, come on, £24.99. Just buy these. Get these home for yourself, if anything. Honestly, I think they are so lovely. Um, it's almost like you're getting one of those for free. Well, it is. £24.99 because you've got that sensational Country Lane lace um, uh, uh, frame. It's a spectacular deal. There is so much in here. You are going to be kept busy for a long time with all of this. So many different projects in there. You've got over 63 tips and techniques in that one. Oh, 63 or 68? 68, Ruth. Can't read upside down. Uh, and I think you've got over 72 in the other one. But absolutely jam-packed full. You've got so many freebies in there as well. Of course, with your dies, your stamps, you've got all of those images you can pop out. The amazing papers. I just This is like Christmas come early, this is receiving these i don't know i mean i used to love getting a magazine through the post when i was younger you used to race down the stairs when you had your magazine subscription you heard the postman you're like oh, it's here it's the same thing only you have a lot more in here because when you start to get those freebies those dies all of that incredible uh, uh um, um ad additional elements whether it's your papers whether it's the stamps in there this goes a long way doesn't it 24 pounds and 99 pence don't forget whilst you're there, if you do want to add the, ba uh, the brand new magazine to your order as well, go for it. It's only one set of post and packaging. You can absolutely do that and get these home to you because they are quite fab. Um, a little message coming in. Okie doke, please have a little look at this one uh, from Fiona. Hello, Fiona. She said, hi, ladies. Can I get, can I read that on there? Can I get the issues separately? I already have number three. I need, you need four. Yes, yes, you can. We, yeah, we don't we have can. many of them separately, but we do no. have a few. Yeah, so you have to be really, really quickly. You can tell I didn't know the answer. So there we go. So you can. So there you go. That's issue four. So Fiona, issue four is £12.99 for you. Uh, absolutely not a problem. And then we'll pop the other one on for you as well. So if you want the other issue uh, three, you can as well. Now, right, where is this? Right, the cleaning. Here we go. Cleaning station. I've not seen this before. Yes. Right. right, so this is your cleaning station, which we all need, really. If we've got stamps, can we I, need to look Can I borrow it and I'll show you? So you, got the, you, you haven't got the solution. I don't I think, think I brought so. mine with me. Right, so your solution comes in a little um, bottle. So what you would do, so this is your cleaning station. And what you've got in here is you've got um, two different pads. So get it the right way around. This one will pop out. You know it's this one that's going to pop out because you've got the little corner taken out. So this is your clean, this is your dry. Imagine this is one of your stamps that you've just yeah. used. Spritz it with the spray. I you spritz. do get the solution. You do get the solution. It comes in a little bottle, spritz it on there. Then take it to your clean and just rub it. Now, it doesn't have to be on a platform. I've done it a few... Oh, no, I'm making yours a bit okay. I've done it Sorry. before, and you can just rub it across there using your hands. Once you've rubbed it on there, because obviously there's still a bit of solution on there, mm -hmm. you then take it on to your drying one, and then you yeah. just dry it clean. So it's a really good solution that's going to get all of... 
obviously if you've used something like our quick dry inks that stain mm. it won't take the stain out but it no. won't take the excess ink okay. out so if you've still got little bits of ink and perhaps you're like i i might want to do some waterproof ink with it and then i might want to go to my aqua pen so i obviously need to know i've got it clean between yeah. and then that's just the quickest way to do it really but it's not only going to um, clean it but it's going to dry it and this one does lift out so that because this is the cleaning one you can take it to the sink and just dry it off and just leave it overnight and then it'll be good to go the next day it will have marks on it it yeah, will fancy. it will color up with the inks mm -hmm. but it it effectively becomes clean and will yeah. absorb even more how clever is that and then we sell extra bottles of the solution as right. well so you will only ever need one of these one palette but you, you will get solution. lots of solution and yeah. you do get the solution we just you don't do. have it in the studio but that's a great little mm. idea isn't it um fabulous 14 pounds 99 we've all got stamps we all need to look after them we all need to clean them and let's do it in the quickest and easiest and most effective way possible Ooh, because you don't want to not this. use your stamps look here at that we she's go. Here don't, we go. don't tell her she's very good is rm this is the solution like i say it comes in a little bottle just like that you can just see it's got a tight, slight blue tinge to yep. it. There you go. And you just take it off, spray it onto the stamp. I do onto the stamp. Now, some people possibly spray onto the pad, mm -hmm. but I find you use less if yep. you spray it onto the stamp because you're only using what that stamp needs rather than stamp, spraying it onto a bigger area. So there we yep. go. That's my tip is spray Brilliant. your stamp, not your pad. Great. And £14.99, an amazing little price on that. I think that's quite a nice little mm. gift Ooh. as well, actually. Uh, time is running out, my goodness. It me. is. Um, but what I have to have a little look at, now we are very limited at these. Uh, we have less than, thank you, less than 50 chances. <gasps> the Shimmer Spectrum Noir inks. Now, First of all, the first thing we notice is the shape's a little bit different. It is. Uh, this is, is the shape great. our ink pads are all moving to. Oh, is it? Because okay. our duet ink pads launched yep. soon and they're in the sink shape. So these are a pigment in ink pad, but they have a lot of shimmer in them. Okay. So when you take the lid off, look at that. Look how juicy are. So if you want to show the colours and then pass a couple over here, yeah. I'm going to do a couple of little swatches with these. Okay, so that thanks. one was peach rose. Oh, they're really lovely colours, aren't they? they I'll, are. I'll show you a few of these just while Corinne's getting sort of sorted. That'll be fine because you've got the green. I'll just show them to you. Oh, well, let's have a little look at that. That's going to be vibrant, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I mean, it's exactly what you're getting on the tin, so to speak, even though it's not a tin. Uh, but some beautiful, beautiful colours in here. What's that raspberry? Oh, that's you see, that's my kind of yeah. colour. That is really, really lovely. Then you've got this gorgeous, gorgeous, look at that ocean Ooh, breeze. Pass, can I borrow that Ooh, one? Oh, you can indeed. Thank you. Then we've got the purple, that amethyst. That's lovely as well. I might help you the amethyst. Okay. And last but not least, oh, got a sugar plum in there as well. Aren't they gorgeous? They are beautiful, aren't they? So these are pearlescent pigment then? They are pearlescent pigment. So what you've wow. got is pigment and a pigment ink pad has larger molecules. So that means it stays wet for longer. So these are, let gorgeous. me show you, there we go. Look at that. Can you see how Oh, you can see how the shimmer now. Can yeah. you see? Look at those colours. Now you can blend them together. You can stamp with them. I could put them onto my craft table and then oh, I can pick them up with a water brush and I can then look at that. I'm painting with them. I could put them onto a stamp and I could stamp with them. But look at this. I think for me, these pop when you go onto black. Them, I love them on yeah. black. Put them through a stencil and then heat emboss it with your oh, clear embossing powder. Lovely. Looks beautiful. I just saw you. You went, ooh, I just saw you there. I but yes, very, very versatile. I like these a lot. Now, what should these be each? £5.99 each. Yeah, yes. so £5.99 and you've got 10 of them, so £59.99. Ten of that, we could do that um, last, couldn't we? That was that, that was, was it. That I could was... cope with that, Corinne. I felt confident we're going for that. <laughs> um, would you like them instead? for £4.50 each. But bearing in mind, these aren't your normal ink pads. These are going to give you that incredible metallic effect. They are stunning. These need to be seen to be believed. And honestly, I saw them in the little pads. Isn't I thought these are gorgeous, but <gasps> they, I'm going to pass you that as well. You pass you that? They're all utterly, utterly fabulous. But yeah, like Corinne said, yeah, on black, they're going to look amazing as well, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, even on white, we saw just how you're getting that incredible shimmer effect. Ruth, in Worcester Shim, my namesake's back in. People keep thinking I've got my mobile under here because that's how <laughs> I come up on the screen, Ruth in Worcestershire. I promise, but I would like these. Uh, oh, yeah, you see, that lime like that. Green. That lime's that amazing, lime green, isn't it? Lovely. Black or white, you see. Yeah. Equally as fabulous. Yeah. 
gorgeous. But that and you'd think it wouldn't show amazing. up as much on the black, but it really does. Mm. It almost adds a depth to it, doesn't yeah. it? Because you're giving it something yeah. behind. But yeah, it doesn't matter which colour you're going to pick. Look incredible. They are beautiful. I've done two craft alongs on Crafters TV with these. Yeah. So if ever you want to go and have a look at how to use them, go onto YouTube and have a look at my craft alongs. Very, very different ways of they using are amazing. them. They are beautiful. Goodness me. Get hold of those. A lot of you have. Uh, Rennie's there. Ali's there. Another crafter girl. Julie Trees. Get checking out on those. They're going to take your craft to a completely different level uh, but don't forget brand new magazine today whilst you are checking out this is your phenomenal crafters inspiration 138 essential skill boosting ideas in there but remember it's not just the magazine you're getting you're also going to get and I'm going to say free of charge because it is really uh, those fantastic stamps this amazing embossing folder glorious set of dies and which you're not going to get anywhere else with this collection you are going to get that amazing silver so if you've got those fantastic pens you're just taking home your inks in there as well just go for it adding that metallic pigment silver because that is going to look delicious lots of different inspired projects within there and of course don't forget it's not just about the inspiration it is of course those fabulous papers that you're going to get mm. right in the heart of that magazine as well just glorious do you want to quickly flick us through yeah. Should we go I mean, through we've the got second like a minute? Okay, so, so we'll do properly... a quick flick through. But you will see lots of different ones. I love this one, Vanessa, she, girl from my own heart. Lots of inky techniques. So going through with embossing folders, stamping, you know, all of those. Absolutely gorgeous. Stamping and then bringing out your colours. So, so many different ways. I've got Anne-Marie here. Oh, this is a very different take on it. Absolutely gorgeous, but mixing oh, and matching. Wow. Another one with the resist technique, bringing in some of your other ones here by Katie. So there's, you know, cutting out those toppers. Yeah, so much you know, in there. So, just that little pop of colour, loads of different ways. Then you've got something by our Leanne. And then the final one, I love this one. This one's on the counter by Tracy. Yes, that was the card it that we is just here. beautiful. That's a honestly... gorgeous card. And again, lots of, Ashley's done lots of inky ones. And then Monica at the end has used some of the toppers and done. And then Good here we've got card. our... Um, Colour your world. There you go. Amazing. And loads, loads more, of course, within mm. there. So keep taking that home. Add it to your basket and check it out. Thank you so much, my darling. Thank You're back with us at... Five and five seven. Of, five and five seven. Five with us, yes. There we go. It's been lovely. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Keep going on that. Lots more coming up with Corinne at five o'clock. But do not go anywhere. We know she's back in the house because you heard her. Uh, <laughs> but we have the fantastic Natalie. She's I doing at the minute. Uh, coming up with Hunky Dory. Of course, this amazing hour of duo design paper pads. It's going to be a big one. <laughs> Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one P&P. Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. My name is Anne-Marie and I am the creative manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier papercraft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our papercraft goodies back at home in Preston. We do lots of papercraft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, water brush pens and we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations which we just know the audience love.
Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobbymaker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Hello, warm welcome back to Hobbymaker. I am, of course, joined by the gorgeous Natalie from Hunky Dory. Hello. How are you? I'm really good. It's very nice to see your faces Thank out today. You. Thank you. It's, it's, I know, I, the whole team today I've not seen in so Forever. long. Forever. It's been ages. Yes, Adam, I can spell my name now. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> I hope so. Took a while. I hope so. Took um, a while. You're with us for a few different hours today. We've got three hours today. Fabulous. Two brand new launches. Yep. Uh, we've got paper craft, we've got um, brand new masks as well. So we're, we're going to be doing some inking mm -hmm. and then we're going to have a look at our brand new decollage collection. Very at, nice. Um, and that is so busy yeah. at six o'clock. So yeah. that's going to be fun. Yeah, loads to do. But we are going to kick off today with a brand new launch, a brand new launch for you with our so duo exciting. design. I will say with our duo design paper with pads. With ours, yeah. Collectively, ours, they collectively. are ours now. I'm part of Funky Jewelry right now. Um, these are stunning though. Now, anybody that doesn't know your duo design papers, yes. what are they going to expect from these? So our duo design paper pads basically give you really incredible background papers. You can, but what we did, what we wanted to do was we wanted to give you like um, one side that you could use as sort of like the main focus mm. point and then on the reverse have coordinating designs that would just mm. match so perfectly yeah. together. So that's where duo design papers come from. So you'll notice that on one side you've got really vibrant designs mm. on the other you've got more um muted designs in some yeah. ways um but they they work so well together yeah. this these three though is our 11th sort of multi-buy that we've done of these um and they are probably my favorite ones i mean the lovely ladies is just for anyone yeah. who loves sort of like shabby chic vintage mm. crafting you're going to be just adding three of those in your basket yeah. because they are awesome they are um, great they're just <gasps> delightful for so many different reasons but yeah. they're amazing to craft with yeah. i've had so much fun putting these together yeah well let's have a little look at these because you can see you're getting a set of three here three and you can see straight away the good news on that because you're gonna get three for the price of two which is exciting and that's not your price 
size, which is fabulous. So you've got three here. You've got um, floral flare and subtle shimmer. Love that. Celestial skies and starry eyed and lovely ladies and handwritten letters. They're all absolutely Phenomenal. beautiful. I'm going to start with floral flare and subtle shimmer. Um, I, I, I knew I'd absolutely... I don't know what I said. Celestial skies, not I think you spy. Said, I think you said skies. I thought I said skies. Yeah. Should we just ignore them in yeah, there? Just, yeah, just, just send ignore them. them. Yeah. Them <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I'm going to show you the front of the pad, then I'm going to flip it around because you'll yes. get an idea of how this duo pad really works. So on the front there, uh, you can, well, front or back, take your pick. Uh, so you've got the floral flare and you've got a little indication of some of the patterns you're going to see. And then if I, you can see at the bottom there, to be fair, if I flip it around, you've got this amazing, amazing subtle shimmer. I really shimmer. love that we have all the different designs in there, though, because Clever. It's, it means that we don't have to flick through all of those yeah. pads. We can just look at the designs on one side, yeah. on the other side, and we know exactly what's inside these pads. It's basically two pads in one, yeah. um, which is absolutely incredible. They're gorgeous. And if we go in, I mean, what stunning prints. I mean, these are perfect for the summer as well right now. They're amazing i think the colorways that we've got in here yeah. are phenomenal we print these onto our 150 um satin gsm paper Gorgeous. which means you get that real nice shim shimmery shine that professional finish to your papers but these are beautiful i mean we can be fussy cutting some of these flowers oh, up, absolutely layering them on um or we could be using them as beautiful backgrounds we can be coordinating them with Love the reverse i mean look how well that yeah. the reverse of that goes with this and that shimmer it's almost like it, it, it's almost like water yeah almost look like looks yeah. like it's moving they're, they're incredibly well that thought out sort of like frosted feel to mm. it as well doesn't it but oh, that incredible colorways with this these are utterly utterly glorious and you're getting this selection of eight by eight papers uh, there's 48 sheets 150 GSM, oh, I like that one. Just when you think you found your favourite, yeah. you turn the page and you go, oh, no, I like that one. There's a, I like that one. There's a great mix because I think they're all really um, versatile. Like, there's so many different flowers that we've included yeah. within this one. But I think sometimes some of the way that the colours have been added, they're quite tropical as well. Mm. So, like you say, really, really beautiful for summer crafting. I love this one that's as well. What, they're very so different, delicate. aren't they, in this pad? Yeah. That's what's really nice as well. So many different things in gorgeous? here. Aren't they gorgeous? But like you say, four of, four of each four, design. Four, 12 designs, oh, so four of well. each, 48 papers all together, double-sided as well. They are absolutely great. I've got another one to go, look. There we go, back into the tropics. That one's really nice. Aren't they all fantastic? I have a Hawaiian holiday. And we could put that on a shirt for Adam. He could. He'd like that. And then obviously at the other side, you've got a little bit of an idea. You've got all of those beautiful kind of subtle sort of um, shimmered, was it the shimmer direct? Subtle shimmer. If I flick through those, you can see. So 12 different designs, four of each, but they all match absolutely perfectly. I probably should have just done that in the <laughs> beginning, to be fair. But I'd, forgo I'd forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> there we are. That's amazing. That's part one. That's only one of them. So that's your floral flare and subtle shimmer. Yes. Uh, I'll show you a few examples of that actually the whilst team we have are done there. Some incredible these are lovely. jobs with these cards. I mean, you can really tell that they loved working with these by the, the models yeah. that we've got here. Such gorgeous designs. I mean, oh, matting and layering these with your adorable scorable. Bringing in your um, maybe coloured mirror that we've got as well would work really nice real. with this. Or some shimmer card too. That's going to yeah. look absolutely lovely. This one's beautiful. That's cute, isn't um, it? Our lovely cat made this one. Gorgeous. Emma and Hannah made some of those as well. I've got this one by Rachel. One. They're all beautiful and great to have that inspiration as well. And that's just yes. on the paper pads, but incredibly, incredibly versatile. So you've got those florals, you've got those beautiful, subtle shimmers. Yes. And then, compel I told you I'd kick them I in. I know you did. Uh, and then... <laughs> Didn't take long, <laughs> no. 11 minutes. The legs are very long, I do apologise. <laughs> uh, and then, celestial skies and starry-eyed, totally... Everyone's going to totally love Totally different. Yeah, it let me give you a quick, a quick preview. An incredible feel to it. It's a kind of astrology and the stars, which is amazing. So let's have a little flick of these, shall we? Absolutely beautiful. So you'll see there again how they really, really complement So you've each got other. sort of like that star pattern, which um, is the same throughout this Ooh. pad, but in the different colorways. And then on the reverse, we have that sort of like um, star sign imagery. Um, so you're gonna be able to see sort of like um, the beautiful images that have been used. Um, it's absolutely phenomenal. I love the fact that it has this really nice, luxurious, sort of like velvety feel in the yeah, background does, as well. It? And how different is this to the first pad that we've just so seen? So different. 
and they're going to work really nicely with things like your nice. um just to say um paper pads yep. we can use those with these we're going to be able to use these with our trim the insert pads and use those inserts as sentiments oh, maybe wow. you've got our brand new combos dies these this is what i'm That's talking about gorgeous. how incredible is that oh, so it's got the, some of the star signs and things on there as well they're amazing oh i love 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 that really it's intriguing so aren't they clever. But I you're mean, going to be able to make such um, incredible cards with this, unlike any cards that you're yeah, going to be able to see out there. Completely. And how different to the first pad that we showed to you, which means there's something for all your friends, all of your family, different personalities, mm -hmm. different ages, different interests, different colours. Really gorgeous. That's your second pad in there. We're trickling that price down for you. Uh, down to 19 98 Remember, you are, in effect, getting one absolutely free of charge so essentially you've got your celestial uh, um, skies and starry yeah. eyed you've got the, lo the lovely ladies and the handwritten letters coming up and of course you've got your floral flare and subtle shimmer a lot of words in here now loads of words um, <laughs> now completely different again oh i've not shown you some samples let me do that first of oh all. yes because there's some good ones on here some really nice ones. oh wow this is really lots of acetate clever. On there. that's clever um making the whole card from acetate bringing in our sticker balls yes. so you can't see any of that working on the back either really clever just to add little subtle touches um, with these again that's clever. using your nesting dies um, to create wow. some really fun images these the, are amazing there's some cards phenomenal card makes in here wow. i love all the different designs all of the different layouts people have as ch have chosen because they work so well with the, the themes that we have here that one yeah. looks really good with those nested so stars emma stephen trudy trudy truda uh, they're glorious very very well done uh, amazing sample cards on those again and then completely different the lovely ladies and handwritten letters this is gorgeous absolutely gorgeous i mean the beauty of this is that we don't even have to cut into this if we don't want to no the artwork that you have been given within this paper pad is so stunning that we can simply cut it down to our chosen card model size and create gorgeous images you've got that phenomenal fabulous. um handwritten letters yeah, on the back which that? are all sort of compiled on top of each other Perfect one for fussy cutting, layering up. This is one where you're going to be, want to get your sort of sanding blocks out and sort of sand those edges away. If you're someone who loves traditional decoupage, you could maybe pop these papers onto sort of um, wooden elements like yeah. ch chests or um, maybe some craft storage that you've got. Really nice. It's absolutely beautiful oh, the way gorgeous. that this has all been put together with the florals with the lace with the the beautiful well. ladies Can you see what that says that says life brings simple pleasures to us every day it's up to us to make them wonderful moments how lovely is that there's Gorgeous. your sentiment that you're going to cut out straight away from that just beautiful isn't that lovely so many different adventures and moments to celebrate with these and completely different every single one of those totally totally different i just love it it's so beautiful They're fabulous i'd find these hard to use because i just and, want to well sit and i them, really to be fair. struggled but we're gonna try <laughs> we're gonna try our best That's with great. that great yeah and you might it might be it might be that you actually want to take a few more of these because you're gonna yes. think exactly the same oh wow totally different again the oh, these are, are stunning. Look beautiful, at all aren't they? I mean, all the different sort of um, vintage colours we've mm. used here. We've gone for... They're, they're, you would think maybe we've just used sort of like browns and sort of orange tones, maybe tan colours in here, which we have. But we've also brought in all of those other colours. So you've still got your greens, you've still got your yellows, yeah. you've still got pink in here, but it all works so well together. Aren't they just fantastic it's music glorious. notes in there? Love that. Really it's popular. So, so nice. Yeah, well done. So nice. Everyone checking out Margaret, Jacqueline, Caroline, Jade, Susan, Sylvia, Carolyn, Sandra. We've got lots in baskets. Heather, Margaret. Um, yes. Keep checking out on those. Remember, you are in effect getting one free of charge. Some beautiful sample cards on these as well. Uh, great with craft paper, obviously. Uh, oh, yes. So, perfect. Nine, look at that. Absolute perfect match with this one. I mean, your fancy folds are going to be great for this one as well. Yeah. So if and you've got any of our um, fancy fold card blanks, you're going to be able to utilise that with any of these papers. Oh, Bringing wow. in sort of like twines Ooh. that you've got. Um, a cat's done this one, I can tell. It's one of yeah. her phenomenal <laughs> techniques of sort of scoring that paper to give it that, re get that white coming through. One give it that Anna really again, rustic feel. 
So clever that acetate. one with the acetate on. And then really nice to see using kind of the same the page. The same thing but completely totally different. different. So what Emma's done compared to Hannah, equally as fabulous, but completely, Gorgeous. completely different cards. And then the last two, but not least, Ooh, obviously you've got to have some embellishments you in do, there. You do, don't you? Bring out your pearls, bring out your twine, Definitely. bring out your lace. Superb. And one last one in there as well. Pretty much using the whole image, which why not which if you've got the, the chance? It's the easiest way you're going to be able to use this paper mm. pad. It's been designed so well that we can just do this and look at how that memories has just been trimmed out as well from that sheet gorgeous really really clever so in effect you're paying what six pounds 66 there you go easy math six pounds 66 per paper which is pad. crazy there's a 46 48 sheets 48 yep. isn't it yeah 48 sheets for that price incredible value keep wow. checking out on those and let's have a little look at these which one should we look at first at? oh my which goodness me go with i think should we go, should we go with, with the finish? Ladies? yeah why not it is very very like nice these. isn't it so this one is really fun because there's just so much going on that i just couldn't I just didn't know which sort of bits and pieces that I wanted yeah. to use. So we're going to use this page. I'm also going to bring in this one as well. Um, I feel like I've got that one too because um, mm -hmm. we're going to use a little bit of that script. But also, let me just flip to it. I think we're going to take, um, where is she? This beautiful lady. Yeah. I love this vintage feel. Um, and I'm also going to, there's a beautiful sort of like old pocket watch on one of these that we're going to use as well. I think it might be at the very, very back. Is it there? Where is it? Who knows? But then, it's gone back but then you look and then you see things like that back piece there. I want yeah. to use that as well. Oh, so we're going to literally use as much as we possibly can from hmm. this. We're going to start off with our base, which is going to be, um, we're actually going to make an eight by six card here because it's going to be easy for us to put together. And I've brought some craft card in because Have to. an absolute match. Yeah. We're going to start off by layering up this image on here. Um, but what I wanted to do was I wanted to give it a nice sort of like torn edge. So I'm going to, um, I know that if I put this back about um, one, let's just take it to there. And then I can use my trimmer as like a guide and I can tear oh, this clever. edge on here, but it's going to give me a straight tear instead of like um, more of like a all over the place tear. It will have yeah. a little bit of wibbly wobbling because that's what we want, but yeah. it's going to keep it quite straight. Um, so let's do that on the bottom as well. Um, and then I'm going to bring, oh, turn this around that. it on That's the a really top. good idea. It's such a clever way of doing it. And because yeah. we've got that nice shabby feel to it as well, it's going to give you that white edge on your paper. So mm. now what we need to do is just bring this across. Let me just mark it, actually. That's going to be my easiest way to do this, isn't it? If we just mark that cardstock yeah. with where we want to tear it. So let's just pop a little line on there. I can just about see that, I think. There we go. And then again, we're just gonna bring that in. I think, I think I might, yeah, no, we'll, we'll, cause we are gonna lay something over that. So it's not a problem. And then look how beautiful that is. You could be using that as like a, a layer on a card or Lovely. something else. So let's pop this on here. And now I'm gonna do something else, which is absolutely ludicrous. And you're all gonna think, oh my goodness, what is she doing? Okay. But I'm actually just gonna scrunch it up. Oh my goodness, See? what are you doing? See her face. Because when you pull it out now, yeah. it's going to give you that really nice um, sort of old style look and you're going to get the mm, creases yeah, in the paper and you can do it as much as you want to bring that yeah. out. Or if you've got sort of like a, um, a sanding block, you can sand back some of the, yeah. the image on the white. So let's pop this down. Could you add ink on that as well? To really you can't add the... ink because this is um, our um, satin, satin finish. However, you could use our alcohol markers. They can right. work quite nicely. If you use your alcohol markers with like a uh, one of our neutral colours and then use your um, colourless blender to go over the top, that will give it that sort of really nice vintage look. Yeah. So I'm going to pop this on here. And I'm going to do it at kind of like a little bit of a, an angle so it doesn't look straight. And because it's like um, a little bit torn up, if you want to sort of move that paper while you're sticking it down, it can yeah. give you a nice little effect there. So we've got that on there. Then we're going to bring in, um, I've fussy cut around one of those papers and I've just sort of turned the edges on some of those little elements. Love so that. they're like little elements. And we are going to cover this woman up, but don't oh. worry about it. I know. You're like, what? Because we're going to bring in this lovely lady. Oh. 
How does she feel about that? Well, <laughs> she's got no choice. You have to ask her later, won't you? <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to tuck her sort of underneath here. So we've got that nice. Um, mix of sort of scripts. We've got all the little bits and pieces. So now we've got that in place. Let's pop this on with some foam pads. Give it a little bit of height. Yeah. And again, and these are really, really good because you can literally sort of maneuver them around. I'm going to sort of like the outside edge of this one because I do want the space to sort of tuck my lovely lady in. Yeah. So let's see if we can do that before we sort of stick her down because I can then place a little bit of tape. And those foam pad strips just are under here. on your screen. They're £9.99 and you're getting 12 sheets, 3 mil and 5 mil in width as well. But they're, they're essentials. You need to have loads Absolutely. and loads of foam pads. There's, you always, always, always need foam pads. So yeah. I'm just going to tuck that under there and just fold that over because I don't then my foam pad's going to have space. And let's bring in some other foam pads as well. Now we've got her in place. So she's at the same height these are your large as pads. that nice border that we're going to add in. Yep. You might as well get everything. So your, your large foam pads are there as well. Again, 12 sheets, 24 mil and 19 by 38. So again, great price. So I'm going to place this over here. And that's going to sit and give us another gorgeous wonderful texture mm -hmm. on this piece we've got um some more flowers and i've also fussy cut out this panel here which i think we might place again underneath here with that butterfly just yeah. sort of like lifting off because we can lift those wings up mm -hmm. on there um so let's i think we're going to place it i think we're going to use foam pads again just because i want that height yeah and this Behind is what's so there. nice about these duo design pads Perfect. because you get so many, you're not afraid to keep layering and layering Absolutely and layering. Not. Absolutely and that's when they not. really work. The, the gorgeousness that we've got in here. I've got yeah. these flowers as well. I don't know where I could put these so much flowers. Stuff. There's literally <laughs> loads. I'm like, can I tuck it in there? Is it going to fit in there? I think I'm going to leave that because um, I'm going to put this on and then we're going to fussy cut out those beautiful um, love letters that we've yeah. got on that piece and use that as like our sentiment. Mm -hmm. So let's sit, stick this on here. But this is... This is a this is a paper pad where more is absolutely more. There's going to be no problem with the amount of sort of layering up that we can create oh, with this one. Nice. I mean, a beautiful sort of pearl necklace created from your um, gemstone pearl rolls Gorgeous. would look absolutely yeah. beautiful. Um, oh, let's let's remove let's remove that lace as well, and we can use that on here. Um, but all of these other extras elements that we've got and bits and pieces that we haven't used, we can be sort of um, ripping these up. We can be creating tags using our mm -hmm. tag punches, adding them onto the to our cards as well. So we've got that Absolutely. lace that we're going to use. And then we're going to use this as our sentiment. So just trimming that out of here. She looks like she should have been a famous... Sort of it's like a movie a star, isn't it? Yeah, it's absolutely. so old, old cool Hollywood. from one of those amazing like black and white mm. almost sort of like um was when they first started to have a little bit of yeah color. it looked almost a little bit sepia or the color wasn't quite there it definitely yeah. has that real romantic um sort yeah. of 1940s age as absolutely to this paper pad it's beautiful um so let's just trim around that you could have used your knife if you wanted to do with this but mm -hmm. it's quite nice um thickness on the elements here so let's trim that out there. And then if we take that just straight to the top, we can put that paper back to one side. Yeah, there's some really lovely shapes where you, you've made it actually very easy to do. It's so easy. It's so, so easy. And you've got beautiful pieces on here and there's just so much going on I mean yeah. we've seen some of those models and how beautiful they look sort of um, mm -hmm. cut down a little bit and then laid on top of this hand handwritten um, pages yeah. paper as well and that's so good but the way that you can cut this up and make yeah. so many incredible things with this we're going to pop using, that yeah. on top of there Cute. so again let's go in with our foam pads yeah and your hunky dory scissors all the way i did see charlene the other across. day and she was using did she? her hunky dory scissors oh well be it to trim her flowers i know water. I but um yeah she's like i know they're not meant to be used for this but she absolutely loves them she's like keep telling everyone i've bought well, one. I'm like there they are we'll let her off <laughs> 
Is she doing fabulously? She doesn't look like she's had so a baby much. as far as I'm concerned. She looked amazing. Of course she won't. Yeah, and I so that's going to fit so, on there. Yeah. And then I just want to tuck in this lovely bit of lace. Let's layer it up on this yeah. corner. Why not? It's so it beautiful for this. And I mean, yeah. you know, if you've got some of those bits and bobs, like maybe um, wooden buttons, yeah. ribbon, actu um, actual lace. Yeah. These are just going to look so stunning on these cards. So let's it. pop this onto our card blank now. So just popping these onto our, taking this off our back in. Yeah. I haven't got finger lift tape today. This is a bad, <laughs> bad, um, bad decision by myself. So let's just trim that off and then we're going to pop this onto our card blank. So just going to line that up on here. I said it was a six by eight, but I think it might be. Um, no, it is a six by eight. I thought yeah. for a second it was a little bit bigger, but it's not. But there you go. How lovely is that? Stunning, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. It's just such a fun paper pad to work with. So good. And create these amazing designs. And also, if you're doing scrapbooking, these and are oh my goodness. Incredible, incredible for scrapbooking. Incredible for scrapbooking. <gasps> they are, it is absolutely phenomenal. Really versatile. The different cards that we can going to be able to make with this one. Yeah, scrapbooking, doing your journals, if you want to cover these, as oh, Nat said. Oh, projects yeah, as well. really lovely. Covering so picture frames. Nice. Oh my gosh, there's so much, so much you can do with those. And of course, at £19.98, you are getting one for free, basically. They're on a three for two offer. You've got the lovely ladies in the handwritten letters. You've got the floral flare and subtle shimmer and completely different again, your celestial skies and starry-eyed. So three for fantastic fantastic duo design pads brand new today well done we've got lots in basket still ali kathleen julie karen amazing but the really good news is so ah, excited oh about that we, word. we could do this this time yeah moving on we've got to pick a mix for you yes but hunky dory have very kindly included these three brand new pads within the pick and mix it makes me Exciting. So happy. I mean, if you are if you are absolutely in love with that one we've just demoed, I mean, I can already see here two that I would be adding in with this one. Yeah. I mean, how beautiful is this floral scrapbooks and music paper is going to go? Because you have that vintage oh, yeah, feel show in this here. One. This is really nice. Actually. We have. Let's go. So just so you know, if you've not met the pick and mix before, yes. you can basically get any three that are in front of us here that are listed on the web for a collective price of £19.78. You just have to pop three in your basket or on the phone lines and check these this out. Is oh my gosh, this is, this is a lovely so you one. We have more of those gorgeous lace details. We've got that yeah. music script which matches up on the top, but this one and that one we've just crafted with are going to be perfect. So if that's the if that's the theme that you're into with your crafting, if that's that vintage style is something so that pretty. really um, catches your eye, then mixing and matching with these two. And I think if I was going to go with any other one, it would have to be my vintage maps and age paper. That's so nice. Those it's three really together well. are going to be phenomenal. But you've got so many incredible designs in that one. Um, so which one was that? So it was your floral that's your scrapbook yeah. and music paper. But we'll go to our web to show you how it works. So hobbymaker.co.uk, uh, literally pop three into your basket and you'll see them all come up on the side there with the basket summary and it will do the maths for you. So you don't have to worry about that. It will make sure that you only pay £19.78 for the three. But by all means, if you want six, if you want nine, you go in multiples yeah. of three basically to get the deal. And if there's any you can see on your screen that you like the look of that you want us to show, because we won't be able to get through all of them. So many. Let us know. Just send us your message. And uh, for instance, um, Spring Fling and Gorgeous Gingham. If you want to see that, let us know. That's actually Lovely one that of the one. most limited, to be fair. Uh, so let us know. We'll show you through a few, but let us know if there's specific ones that you're really interested in. I think this oh, one yeah. Perfect. is an absolute... It's just beautiful. Um, this one's been reprinted twice because people That's just it. love it. It's our vintage maps and aged papers. Um, so this good. one is coming to the end of time, so it's a little bit... Um, it's been well flicked, It has, one, hasn't, hasn't it? it? I'm trying to hold it without it all falling apart, but look at these designs. Yeah, they are gorgeous. Absolutely phenomenal. And then, you've, again, you've got that sort of really nice vintage paper on there as well. Um, That's absolutely lovely. beautiful. And so many different sort of parts of maps we've got certain um destinations mm -hmm. in here if you like creating sort of um home decor projects using sort of like your nesting dies and making bunting from this or popping it on sort of like a screen um like a in a 
popping it in a frame and then using sort of pins to sort yep. of pop on on destinations Jeez. that you've been to is a really good way of using it but it's really really fun one of my yeah. absolute favorites there and it might be that there's places in the world that you want to go to maybe you do like a, a manifestation board every couple of months or every year there's places you want to go to in your life cut them out pop them on see it all there and then maybe so when you go to those destinations pop a little photograph of you there yeah. i went around the world backpacking when i was turning 30 on my own off I trotted and all those different places yeah I did a map with all of the different photos I mean it was hard to Scrap choose to as well you'd be able to use Great that one for journaling. with again it's really perfect. lovely but there's some incredible ones on um that you can choose yeah. from on here as well what else should um, we dive in for there's I just really so many like this one's quite fun okay this one is our um, Color Kaleidoscope and Sensational Starburst. So this one has a really fun feel to it. Oh, I Again, like another one. one you could maybe mix and match with that brand new um, Celestial Skies mm -hmm. as well. So you have oh, wow. the, let's show you this way around. You can see it there, can't you? So you've got your Starburst on one side and then you have a really subtle sort of geometric pattern yeah. on the other. So we've got like sort of like- It's like a gemstone when you see all kind of the crystal yes, the facets in it. Yeah, gem. gorgeous colorways. Um, really, really bright as well. We've, look at that yellow. That's so lovely. So beautiful. Um, we've got the gorgeous pink as well. That blue. They're amazing. Not looking into a ruby. Gorgeous. Or a diamond. Literally so incredible. Um, but that starburst is so fun to yeah. use with sort of like big sentiments or for happy birthday cards. Or maybe we've got some like Superman stamps. You could use that yeah. to create backgrounds. They're just um, so different. Every, in fact, let me show you this one because it's completely this poles apart. Yeah. Yeah, this is great fun. Again, uh, these are very well loved. Very We're well. Kind of holding these together because the, they've odd, odd bits have been used and whipped and all the rest of it. So this is doodle dots and sketched. This is fun. Stripes. I like Very this. Very contemporary. This Brilliant, one. perhaps, for um, birthdays as well. I think well. the dots on um, the reverses here would make absolutely incredible dresses. Every oh, single yeah. one of them. Um, but and really fun different for dots as well, aren't they? Kids' cards um, using with sort of really fun stamps. So maybe you've got sort of animal stamps or um, maybe it's a birthday, like a, a third birthday. You could be using your moonstone dies, cutting all of those different patterns out of your letters and um, layering really them all nice. up. Oh, really, cute, really aren't they? fun um, selections that you've got in here. They're cute, aren't they? Remember, you are getting 48 individual pages 48 pages 12 different designs and you're getting four of each on 150 gsm but you can pick and mix on these ones so nine pounds ninety nine. if you just want one you think oh i'd like that one i'm going to grab that that's fine it'll be 9.99 job done if you want three i mean if you want two definitely pop your third in because in effect your yeah. third is free of charge and don't brand forget new brand new ones are never out. ever happened before with one of our <gasps> so pick and mixes lovely. you can pick and mix between the brand new three and another there they one are. We've got another one here that's going to work really nicely. Your Blossoming Blooms and yes. Lovely Lace. That will look go nice the, with all of Look at those. the lace on here. Look I at love this. the patterns as well. Absolutely gorgeous florals. We've got more sort of like that's subtle stunning. patterns within here, but then you've got sort of large corner pieces. So you yeah. could be um, maybe cutting apertures out of some Neat. of these, layering them straight onto your car blanks. Um, using these with some of our um, maybe pyramage toppers or decoupage toppers. Um, they're going to work really, really nicely. But if you are a lover fun. of papers and mm. having sort of so many different patterns at your fingertips, then this is a perfect pick and mix for you because we can be mixing and matching across all of those different styles, selecting our favourite oh, yes. ones. Maybe it's two of the brand new ones you want, but you want to stock up on one of your favourites, then we can be doing that as well. They're amazing. And some of those big prints, those big floral I prints, it's like looking at fabulous wallpaper. Maybe you've seen sort of like the William Morris wallpaper yes. or, you know, when you go into Liberties or Harrods and you've just got those incredible prints on fabrics and they're so expensive uh, but I mean I, I like to nip in just for a look round you know that's what you do when you're a tourist you go and just poke your nose just in have and a have a look, look. have just a dream see, just just but, see what you could potentially yeah. be having. Where, where do I win the lottery? <laughs> uh, but they are just phenomenal. I mean, that would work beautifully with your floral flare and subtle shimmer. Would work equally as well, perhaps with the lovely ladies in there. You've got a similar colour tones. Amazing. And um, should we see another one? Because actually, yes. remember, brand new. Those three today are brand new, including your celestial skies and starry eyes. So um, starry eyed. With the I next say. one, we're going to do a really fun. Um, fold with here. We're going to okay. do with our um, celestial skies and starry 
it's I nearly said Sorry. it really wrong then. Um, so I've got a five by really seven. Really wrong. Really, really wrong. Really wrong. And I've also then cut a card blank from, I think I cut it from a five by five, I did. So I've cut this down to three by five. So it's exactly sort of like um, an inch all the way around that we have here. And we're going to do a fancy fold with this one. So let's um, score this together. So I've got my um, five by seven. This is a tent fold card. And we're going to lay it out on here. And then I'm adding in an extra score onto this part here. Um, so that's going to create a little lip on our card. Um, and what we're going to end up doing is popping this one on the inside, like so, and then creating a little tab to hold this. So you've got a really nice, fun fold okay. for your card. Um, so let's put it together. We're going to start off with our papers. Now, I had to go with this one because I absolutely love yeah. this pattern. It's so... It has a little bit of a mystic Meg feel, do you think? Yeah, I'm with you on that. Little, a little um, out there feel, but I yeah. absolutely just love it. So I've cut out um, mats and layers for all of my panels here. So this one is five by seven. And we're also bringing in one of these beautiful Lovely. patterns as well, because I absolutely love it. So I've cut this to a quarter of an inch smaller. And then what we're going to do is cut this piece. So let me just measure it to make sure. So that is five, uh, four and three quarters. And then I think, what's this one? Let's do it at four, four and a quarter. So we've taken a half off there. So I want to do this one as well. It's six and a quarter. So we've got those okay. layered up there. I'm going to do exactly the same for our other panels. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to cut another piece. Um, and this one needs to be, um, it was three and a half. So it needs to be at one, two and two and three quarters. Let's try it. I hope you're not asking me. Oh, <laughs> let's try this. Let's see. And then I think the same size again. It's five. So that one needs to be four and a quarter. Let's see if this fits on here like so. Oh. Course it beautiful. Does. Of course it does. Beautiful. So they're going to be our mats and layers. And then what I've also done is I have got another piece um, which is going to fit on the inside. But I've actually switched over this design so that you're going to get a piece of, of this beautiful paper Lovely. in there as well. So let's um, use that. I think, have I done that right? I think I've done it right. I might not have done it right. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. find out. Um, so let's put all of these pieces together. We're going to stick this now onto our pink. And then um, those are going to fit. That's the wrong size. Where's that piece gone? Here it is. I haven't touched it yet. Not today. Not today. It was not today. It was me this time. I'm the one that's to blame. <laughs> um, so I'm going to pop. Let's get our tape off here. Yep. Just using our pokey tool to lift our poke tool, our craft knife, just to lift that up. And we're going to place that on here. And then I'm going to stick this onto our gold. Let me get my pokey tool because I'm trying to do this with this and it's just not working. That's all right. Our tool is the job for, there you go. Job for the tape. There we don't go. forget these are all these now. They're all on a three for two. If you want to grab hold of any of these, uh, including the brand new set of three, so you've got the collection together as a set of three. If you want to just take those, or they are a part of the big uh, pick and mix as well. So you've got all the different options. Just buy one if you want to. That's not a problem. And if you do want the card blanks, we've got those for you on the show uh, as well. So if you want to get your card blanks, they're always handy to have, aren't they? Anyway. Double check. Is this one? Going on here, that one's going on the inside. So what we want to do is put this on this panel here. So I'm going to pop, because I've done a panel which is exactly the same as this, but I've just made yes. it slightly smaller because it's going to sit in the inside. Okay. It's going to allow our fold to sit a bit nicer. Mm -hmm. um, so just sticking that now onto this panel here. That gold really sets it off as well, doesn't it? It does. It's this, the colours are just mm. so beautiful in here. So let's part, start to stick this together now. Um, so tape on all of these panels. This is going to sit in the back. So we'll pop that one in. And it's so easy with the double-sided tape as well. So, so easy. So this is going in the inside of our card. Yeah. 
let's just line that up nice and straight. And then which panel? This piece is going to go on the front. So I'm going to stick that on here like so. It is the 9mm. Okay, so we've got the 9mm tape for you then. We'll pop the details of that on your screen in a tick. I'm going to pop that one on there. And then yep. this one is going to sit in the inside because you are going to see this space when our card's made up. So popping that in place here just leaving that space so that we've got enough room for our card to sort of um, stand really nicely mm -hmm. and then this is our um, section for here so we've got this panel that's going to sit in here and then we've got another um, panel and I thought for my sentiment I wanted something that was really uplifting yeah. and worked really nicely so I went for this from our um, which one is it it is are trim me insert um, happy birthdays um, so it's These great because they're perfect and what I love about them is that I know that this is three by five and on the back I can follow the really handy guide Brilliant. to cut this down perfectly so I'm going to trim that down on here and then I'm going to follow the guide to five and then I'm going to bring it back up and we're going to follow that three by four mark and then I know that this is three by four, so this one has to be five. So we'll trim that on there, and then this will fit perfectly on our three by five mat and layer. Absolutely awesome. Yeah. So let's stick that on the front here. And your tape's on screen, it's $9.99. You're actually getting eight, eight rolls of your tape, reels, I should say, potentially. Uh, it's eight reels of your tape, nine millimeter double sided. So that'll take you a long time to use all of that. It will. It's good. So that's going to fit on the front. So let's stick that on there. This is going to fit on the inside because we are going to see this pattern. So we've got a nice little design. And then we're going to stick these two together. And we're going to use some of our gorgeous star elements. So sticking that on the inside. Then we can add some tape onto here. And then this is the important part. We just need to make sure we stick it nice and centrally okay. in the middle. So I'm going to fold that back now so it's like a, a proper card. Taking our element, we're going to stick this in the middle. May this day mark the beginning of a beautiful year mm. filled with wonderful moments. And then we're going to lift that up. So it's going to sit now like this. We just need a stopper to sort of stop that from moving. Yeah. So what I decided on was I cut out some of these gorgeous patterns from our images and we're just going to layer them up with foam pads. Okay. So I've got somewhere, let's move my trimmer out of the way. I've got some really nice square um, foam pads. These are our small square selections. Making a work today. So there we I'm go, they're on screen. These on so 999 for your small pads. So let's go with let's go with these two. And you do need this place variety of foam pads as well, because it makes your life easier, doesn't it? So much easier. I'm just gonna place this where we want it. So it sits quite nicely on here. And then I'm gonna place my foam pads so that that very edge. Let's just lift that up a tiny bit. The edge there sits and holds that oh, okay. sort of element in there. And then we'll add another one just by the side of it. So it's got two sort of pieces that are going to hold that really nicely together. So that's going to fit on there. My other two, I think I'm going to decorate up this top corner to bring in that pattern again. Um, let's put that one. Um, we'll go with that one overlapping a bit on here so we've got we can still read that sentiment yeah um, and then gold gemstones Ooh. have to be the one to finish this one yeah. off so i think i'm just going to add let's go for three and three we're going to go for three um on here let's just get my other tool get the shovel out i was telling everyone on um Hungry Dory tv the other day when we had this on that um you like to call it a yogurt spoon adam yogurt spoon yeah I was outing you. No one agreed that you could eat a yogurt with it. Especially not if you've <laughs> no seen, one else was that not crazy. Seen Adam. He needs a much bigger spoon. Than We're going to have to challenge you one day, though, to <laughs> eat a yogurt with this. <laughs> We're going to have to challenge you. So then let's pop this 
in place we can just tuck that element now underneath there and it's going to stand Cute. up like that and if we just turn it in the right way That's there you cool. go you can read that beautiful sentiment on there as well Isn't that lovely oh there we go that's really better. lovely. You can see that now. That's great. And of course, don't forget the card uh, or the paper, sorry, that uh, Natalie's used there is from the Celestial Skies and Starry Eyed. That's part of the brand new bundle that we've done for you today, which is basically a three for two. But the deal you've got on screen right now is, is for those three, isn't it? So that's for your duo design paper pads, three for £19. No, sorry, beg your pudding. Yeah, that was the pick and mix. There we go. That's the details if you just want those three together. The lovely ladies in handwritten letters, brand new, floral flare and subtle shimmer, brand new, and celestial skies and starry eyed. Uh, all brand new. So that's a deal together. You're getting basically one free of charge. However, we have put all of those together in the pick and mix. About 20% of the stock of those has gone. Wow. Uh, yeah, loads and loads of those in baskets as well. But they are included in the pick and mix. Even more of those in baskets right now. And you've got a huge collection to choose from. So if there's one that you particularly love and you've run out of, yes. maybe you're going to get those three and add another one of those in. Definitely add two more in because obviously, again, every time you do three, one of them's free of charge. So if you Definitely. pop three in, one's free of charge. Pop six in, two are free of charge. I will say we do have a few of you with 10 in. Maybe you're just waiting. Maybe just waiting to grab another two. Maybe that's what it is. And you're just thinking, oh, which, which ones, ones do I have? Which ones do I want to have? Which do I go for? Because yeah. uh, you want odd numbers. Three, six, nine, 12. Keep going. The world's your lobster on those. But there are so many different collections here so many, so many fabulous different looks and remember if there's any you specifically want to have a little look at please do let us know uh, we looked at the floral scrapbook and the music paper yeah uh, we saw the maps. maps we saw the doodle dots, doodle dots. the doodle dots uh, the lace we saw as well didn't we the blossoming blooms and the lace should we chuck another inch should we have a quick that one's really nice this is lovely this is your well, delightfully it's really nice with mas masculine theme cards mm. Delightfully distressed and colourful craft. I don't know why I felt the need to say it like that, but I did. Uh, so, yeah, a little bit grungy going on there as well. These are great. So if you, you have our Man's World dies, these ones are going to work perfectly because you have all those industrial, um, like, brick. We've got mm. um, uh, metal in here as well. Oh so cool. it works really nicely with them. our toolkit um, dies that we brought out to you. I want to go that way, actually. This, there we go. Oh, now I've... Confuse myself. There we are. There's no, there's no right or wrong. There's no right or wrong. You can, you can. I'm just doing it really awkwardly. Uh, but you, the more you look into these, again, I don't know if you can see. It's almost like you've got a background yeah, image. So much texture. Yeah, it really does. On. I mean, you've got florals in there that I don't know if you can actually see at home. But then you've got this overlay that makes it look really kind of grungy, which is fabulous. But so much kind of texture. That's lovely. I like that one as well. Again, that looks very plush, doesn't it? Mm. I feel like really, I should be really on a chaise as well with all the all the other um, images that we have in here. Look at that. Aren't they fabulous? Really so beautiful. So nice. So this is a part of your pick and mix. So you can grab that. They are lovely. And um, there's nearly a hundred in baskets, by the way. Wow. Nearly 100 in baskets. I know you're probably just watching and enjoying. Teresa's just got six. June's got three. So's Marilyn. Pauline's got six. Well done. And of course, if you are on the phone lines, please do bear with us on that. We are answering your calls pretty quickly. Have we got more behind us as well? We do. We've got oh like my goodness. One. Oh, we've also got the sea breeze as well. Oh, wow. This one's Grab really another nice. one of those Let's now. Should we just take them all? Yes, why not? Them why all. not? Oh, rainbow oh. honeycomb and candy floss clouds. That sounds like a song. It does, doesn't it? Definitely. This is, I haven't seen these ones. This, this one's really fun. Oh, that's funky, isn't it? Look at those. Lovely. They are gorgeous. You've got that wonderful honeycomb. So that's just changing your colour. Those gorgeous patterns, though, that and colourways that are so yeah. vibrant match so I many of that. the other pads that we've got um, <gasps> on the that show. Pink. Oh, my goodness me. I'll be ripping a page of that out before I go home. Aren't they fabulous? Oh, that's a really lovely one. Really, I'll skip really nice a few designs those. in there. So that was Rainbow Honeycomb and Candy Floss Clouds. And then this one is oh, our 
incredible sea breeze and rippling waves. So this one again has really nice designs on. So um, anyone who's sort of like going away or maybe this one's perfect for retirements, I think, or at home decor again, yeah. like bathroom images, sort Definitely. of like pop these into some frames. Look at that one. All those little Really anchors. nice nautical themes throughout this one. And um, we've got some sort of like old school maps in there as well. Yeah, that's They're cute. all over sort of pattern. This is a great background to be adding elements onto. Um, you've got the crabs and the seahorses on that one. Seahorses again with the beautiful starfish and that nice um, nautical stripe. Oh, and the really, coral. really beautiful that's one a on one. that one. Really like and that then one. Laura says that this one is crazy limited. Um, okay. And the reason as to why is Obvious. because it's beautiful. Yeah. Um, this one's crazy. Um, really those. gorgeous patterns within here. Super, super springy and floral. And then you've got those beautiful um, ginghams as well. Oh, look at the little docks. It's phenomenal, isn't it? And then we've got some different sort of designs in here with the, I think that was a swallow. Yes, yeah. Um, and then we've got the beautiful birds with the cherry blossom. How nice is the oh, cherry blossom at the moment? Oh, it's, it's, oh, it's, it's full it's on like everywhere, isn't it? And it's like falling down. It's gorgeous. I'm sneezing, beautiful. but loving it. It's gorgeous. Um, the forget-me-nots in there as well. The yeah, beautiful that's a fabulous pad, isn't it? Really, really like nice. It's been hand-drawn, that one. Definitely tell why this one's limited. Oh, I love you. this one as well. Again, a little, blue little wallpaper there as well. is so phenomenal. Um, but amazing. that's it, yeah, with your fantastic gingham. We have so many in baskets right so now. Many. Like, I've never seen such a reaction on the web. To those Crazy. of you that are collecting these, I know you're making your choices. I know you're a bit sport for choice. We'll try and squeeze in another quick yes. demo, actually, Natalie. Let's do you it. You are the queen of demos. So, do, I, I don't know, it takes a while to go through and decide. So, what's So, doing that? we've got um, these two papers that we're going to use. We're actually going to reverse this this one because I think the green oh, on the back of this looks really really yeah. nice with these images so we're going to cut this piece up first we're going to do a five by seven my favorite size of card cards so I'm just going to trim this to let's do it at four and a half okay and, and this then is we're going to sort of floral bring flare and subtle shimmer, this isn't it? back in as well so that's going to go on the inside this is going to go on the outside but we are going to do some die cutting here we're going to add our sentiment in with our um, amazing on the edge dies, which Anne Marie okay. brought to you. Now I'm adding a lot of tape in here. Yeah. It's all gonna become apparent when we die cut this because we want it to be um, quite well stuck in those areas. Okay. So I'm gonna take um, the tape off there now. We haven't added any to the top because it won't necessarily get to that point. Um, so let's stick this down onto here and then we're gonna take the reverse with this beautiful um, design on the opposite side. So we'll stick that in place. Um, and that's gonna go on here. Now, before we stick it, we are gonna die cut it. So I'm just gonna get my die and sort of measure up where I want this to be. Cause I do still wanna have some of that silver under there. Okay. I'm just gonna pop out. I've got some paper still stuck in here. So let's just pop that out. So we're definitely gonna get this cut beautifully first time. A well loved one. It is my favorite. Honestly, I've used these so much since they came out, and they only launched really um, on Tuesday. I've not seen them. We've yet. been using them for weeks, and we've been like, when can we? When can we use them on uh. the telly? Um, but yeah, they launched on Tuesday, and they they should be available on the website right now if you wanna have a look at those. So let's stick that in place. I'm gonna open out our card blank and run this through our machine. So let's just open. Um, those plates, stick that on there, and then we'll pop it through our Gemporia. Let's run that. Whiz it through. Through there. It cuts like an absolute dream. Forget how quiet this is. I know, I know, it's so good, isn't it? So let's take this out and hopefully that has all cut, cut beautifully. I knew it would have done. Um, so then we can remove our die from here now. Remove this piece. And I'm just going to, it doesn't matter if it comes away because we are going to trim that off. I'm just going to take my scissors because it's just going to be super easy to just trim along that cut line there. Just pull out that piece. Oh, that's really And then you've got nice. that beautiful on the edge sentiment. So let's just pop out those elements that we don't need. Yeah. 
like so. Oh, they've gone back in. I see why you're using Give that. A little bit of a. Isn't it so nice? Yeah, the fab. font on there is gorgeous. Yeah. Let's stick this in place. And I've got a little bit of beautiful ribbon that matches really nicely to um, bring in this join a little bit more. So stick in that gorgeous. on there. I'm going to bring in this other colour to pop on the inside of our card. So let's just take that tape across there. I'm going to use, I think, my skinny tape to stick my mm -hmm. my ribbon on. So let's place this on the inside, lining that up really nicely with that score line, placing this on top. And then you can That's use gorgeous. your score tool. Here it is just to score that down but let's open it out while we just add our ribbon in because so we're going to place this it's really quite a simple card as well isn't it, it is but it's so effective because Absolutely. of all of those amazing colors and patterns that work so well together and you're getting all of this in one paper pad yeah one paper pad to make this one so i'm just going to lie this across to bring in that color nice and sort of break up those elements and we can just then snip away our ribbon and turn this over and do the same on the other side. We can then add a bow if we wish to on here. But what I've done is I fussy cut a little bit of my florals and I'm just going to lie those on top. I might add a bow as well. Why not? Why not? Go for it. There's always, always it's a reason to add a bow, isn't there? So let's pop that on there. Add that down onto here. And then... Let's trim that. You do make the most beautiful bows now. Just tuck that bow in there. Trim off those edges so they're nice and even. And then our a match made in heaven for ribbon and adding bows on is our um, glue dots. Yep. So I'm just going to flip that in half, add that to my card there. And uh, there you go. And there you are. Super, super simple. But again, that's lovely. So much going on with that. That's beautiful. Really. And as Nat said, that's from one paper pad. One paper pad. She's really, really cool. So you could do that and take that inspiration and bring it into so many of the other different paper pads yep. as well. Um, we now currently have just a, just a, just just a, a small mere, amount. Just a mere 105 in baskets right now. Um, <laughs> so if you have yours in a basket, some of the other ones that are more limited, if all 100 and something of you want, let's say, the rainbow um, honeycomb and candy floss, there's only 56 of those. Yeah. So nearly half of you wouldn't get it. So this is your time now to go and check out, check out, check out, check out, and make sure you get the pads that you want. I know you like to stop and watch the demos. We all like yeah, to do but that. Some of, them, I get you. some of them we don't even have like 30s of. So no. if that's in your basket, um, and you are all checking out now and that goes, yeah. you need to you need to get it before Jump someone else does. Them. Absolutely. Well done, Jeannie Box. She's like, I'm having those. <laughs> uh, congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're back with us in? An hour. One hour's time. One hour. And we've got lots in an hour again, haven't we? Yeah, we? we're going to get exciting. messy with some new masks. Very exciting, very exciting. Uh, thank you, Nat. It's been lovely. Thank you. It's been a pleasure as ever. Uh, stay with us, though, because we have an incredible hour coming up for you now. We've got a brand new guest, a brand new supplier joining us. We're very excited. You're going to love her. Sarah is up with us uh, from Hetty's Crafty Creations. Honestly, stick with us. You're about to have the most fantastic hour. Uh, it's going to be so much fun. Stay with us. We'll see you in a minute. <laughs> Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. My name is Anne-Marie and I am the Creative Manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier papercraft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our papercraft goodies back at home in Preston. 
We do lots of papercraft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, water brush pens and we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations which we just know the audience love. Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobbymaker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gifts? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? On screen, but oh, we're, a, we're having a chat already. <laughs> uh, welcome back to Hobby Maker. Oh, it's going to be a lovely hour. It's going to be a very good hour. It absolutely is. We've got the lovely Sarah joining Hello. us today. Uh, Sarah is brand new to your screens. You are going to be seeing her uh, already again in June, but I'll, I won't, I'll, I'll be quiet about that. Uh, but Hetty's Crafty Creations, you're about to see the most wonderful hour for all ages, for all levels, for all of us that are out there right now, you are going to absolutely enjoy this. But before we start to have a little look at all of the different products we have for you today, um, big warm welcome, Sarah. Thank, Thank you for joining you. us. Thank you Lovely to have you on Hobby Maker. Lovely to be here. It's going to be just such a gorgeous hour. Before we dive in, tell us a little bit about you. Tell us about your sort of backstory and how this came to be. So, um, I've been a cross-stitcher for about 30 plus years, wow. um, just doing it as a hobby. Yep. So, various sizes from the big ones to the small ones. Um, back in 2019, I got diagnosed with fibromyalgia. Right. Um, so, it affects my hands and my immune system, mm. so I can't do a regular nine to five job anymore. Okay. So, I turned my hobby into a business and het is was born from there, so that's how I started. And why Hetty's? Where does Hetty come from? 
So who is, is Hetty? So who is Hetty? <laughs> I do answer to Hetty, so I have said to you that if you call yeah. me, Ruth does call me Hetty by mistake, it's not going to be it's a permitted. big issue. It is permitted. <laughs> um, so when I decided to turn into business, I obviously needed a name for my company, mm -hmm. and the lovely neighbour across the road from my mum's she taught me how to cross stitch and we called her Nettie oh. um, when I came up with the name where I'm from in Telford there's quite a few businesses called Nettie's so I just okay. changed the N to a H and that's where Hetty's oh. was created and it's I think a lovely it's quite name. a nice name quite, I do quite homely it feels very homely yeah and it's nice that you've got that little sort of yes. connection that that bit of sentiment in there which yes. is which is wonderful I'm a sentimental fool at times you're lovely we've had a good <laughs> chat beforehand and we got on very well we started reminiscing didn't we a we little did. bit about our cross uh, cross stitching journey we spoke about knitting lots of other things uh, which will no doubt come out as we start to talk about the hour but as you can see you are about to see some of the most beautiful beautiful designs here some gorgeous gorgeous cross uh, cross stitch designs the little sloth was up, was wasn't well not wasn't upside down he was standing up a moment ago so we flipped him around and Laura was very disappointed that we didn't <laughs> leave him uh, but we can't we can't leave him like that however before we dive into these one Wonderful different designs and when I say there's something for everybody we've got dinosaurs we've got bees we've got the gorgeous cows the frogs there's loads we've got something to kick off for all of you for every single crafter out there and in fact I've got it all wrapped up here but I'm going to show it to you on on Sarah's desk first of all because it's so cute anyone who's a crafter regardless of what you do you need this in your life because it's so cool uh, this is your fantastic crafty bag I'm going to call yes. it um, this is cool. I love everything that you're seeing on here as well. Uh, it says crafting makes everything better, even Mondays. Because well, Mondays are tough, aren't they? They are very, very tough. No one likes a Monday. No. And I like the colours. I like the design. It's handy. So if you are going around, if you're popping into your craft shop or if you go into any of the large exhibitions, just going on holiday, it's perfect just to pop right. anything that you're going to need. So whether or not it's yeah. cross stitch, it's card making, you can just nip, pop it in a little bag if you need to. So if you are going to the craft store, just pop yeah. it in your normal bag. And I think it just makes you smile. I do. The colours are really vibrant. It's just a really nice little sort of sentiment there. A little bit tongue in cheek, which we like. But it's very, very lightweight. And we're all obviously using, uh, or try not to use plastic bags anymore. I'd even have this just in my handbag. Yes. Wrapped up, because it's not heavy. It's a really, really lovely uh, sort of lightweight bag. But it's very, very strong at the same time. It is, stage. and it's perfect. It's a four size. So yep. you literally can put everything that you are possibly going to need in there. If you're like me, and you go around certain crafting stores and I have to stand there sometimes thinking do I want it or do I need it <laughs> if you're a little bit like me and always yes <laughs> or it's always yes um but that's just perfect so maybe you want mm. a little bit of self-control yeah um and it is exclusive to hobby maker as well so we haven't launched it anywhere else I see. so um so yes so currently you can only get it here, so which makes it even more exciting to bring something. It's lovely, and it's just, and that sentiment's on one side as well, so you yes. can have it. Obviously, you know, sort of when you carry it. And what's really nice, obviously, sort of, I mean, if I drop it down there, you're not going to see it. But it's because it's not so huge. If you are sort of ha having that sort of drop down, it's not going to be dangling on the floor. Equally, you can get your arm in there as well if you want to. Uh, but I'd, I'd even have my lunch in that. If I was going to yeah. a, a craft workshop, you could pop your bottle in there. You could pop your picnic in there. There's so many different ways to use that. You might have a couple of these at home perhaps full of your dyes or perhaps you pop in all your different cross stitch uh, sort of boxes in there and maybe you are thinking of gifting some of these fabulous cross stitch uh, projects you want to pop them in the little gift bag as well just to make it go that bit further it's only 4 99 obviously it's reusable and it is now am I right that I want to say eth that I'm going to get this right yeah, so it's ethically produced. There we go, which is also very important to know, isn't it? And they've used sublimation on there as well, so the colours won't run. So if you do put some water in there right. and you do have a little bit of a leak, then you're not going you to... Right. 
They're not going to all blur together. You're not going to all blur into one, one another. No, because you. I mean, th there's a time and a place to be be messy when you're crafting, but you don't want your bag to be like that, do you? Not many of those available, I have to say. So if you like the look of that, make sure you grab hold of it. It fits a fair a fair lot in there. I, I won't lie. It's look. It's really nice material as well. That is I gorgeous. Do like it. It's not rough. You know, you get the texture. Yes. You get the linen bags or you know the canvas bags sometimes a bit. Or like rough. the tote bags mm. where it's made out of sheet. And they it make is me go quite, a bit funny sometimes. Yeah. A bit like blackboard you yeah. know white when you have your scratchy chalkboards uh, but that's lovely uh, right let's dive in to the heart of this though now shall we uh, we're going to have to start I think with the sloth um, we've got a, one of our directors that works in the building Zoe is sloth crazy uh, she will be loving this and um, these are absolutely gorgeous every single one we've got a few different sizes for you from sort of three inch to seven inch on the different projects but how cute is he? I mean, you know straight away exactly what you're getting with your little sloth. Every single one of these projects, uh, projects comes beautifully boxed as well. I mean, imagine receiving that as a gift. I think that's so, so super lovely. It's really cute. In a little cardboard box, it's beautiful. And we'll unbox one of these to show you in a second. But you get everything that you need in there to give you uh, that incredible little design. But these particular projects, you wanted to do these for every level, obviously, for, yes. for, for all of us that are sort of maybe starting out on cross stitch, even if even if you're really very advanced, these are super to do as, as, a, as a mini make almost like a little project, yeah. a little project, a little cross stitch. Yeah. They're great because you know what it's like. I when I used to do the really big projects, there's nothing worse than when you're halfway through and you're sort of losing your patience with it. Yeah. And you just want something quick and easy mm. just to do in an evening. And these are perfect. Um, for projects like this so if we do go to the NEC and whatever then mm. you know we do have a lot of seasoned cross stitches yeah um and a lot of a lot of our seasoned cross stitches do buy it purely mm. because it's just a couple of hours yeah it's not complicated you're not going to want to throw it out of the window so if you are <laughs> just starting there's nothing worse when you're starting a new project and you just literally just want something quick and easy so it yeah. is it is great and they're, they're totally giftable as well and in terms of what you're actually getting in there i know we're going to open one up in a yes. moment what what would you expect to get within your sloth project so within your sloth project you will get the ada so the fabric to be able to do the cross stitch you will have the pattern um, and i'll show you the pattern on philippe so let me just move that a little bit out of the way so literally all our cross stitch ah, patterns perfect do um, come just in colours. There's nothing mm -hmm. worse. I decided when I was going to design my own cross stitch yeah. kit, what I wanted to take out was all the elements that I hated. Mm. So you don't need a degree all the crosses, the dots, the in symbols. hieroglyphics because <laughs> there's nothing worse when you've got four different types of blue and you're yeah. trying to decipher which blue means which colour. Mm. So literally, if it's a green on the pattern, then it's a green thread. Fabulous. So you get the needle in there, as I said, you get the pattern and then you also get the bamboo hoop as well. I so it literally hope. is a complete project. So wow. everything that you need is in there because, again, there's nothing worse if you're not a seasoned yeah. cross stitcher or you are a beginner. Just to have everything in the pack for me is fabulous totally. because... Yeah, it's just, all day, I'm going to worry. You haven't got to worry. Yeah. And if you are, as you said, if you are given it as mm -hmm. a nice gift, I purposely made sure that the boxes are the size that they are, so they will go through as a large letter. Brilliant. So you're not paying a lot for the cross stitch no. and then having to pay a hefty cost exactly. on top for yeah. postage as well. Yeah. And of course, as you know, here at Hobby Maker, it's one yes. set of postage and packaging all day. So you get the whole collection today, if you want to, for any one set of postage and packaging. And the, with that good, uh, this is Sally the Sloth, by the way. I didn't introduce yes. her correctly. I do apologise. Uh, so Sally the Sloth, uh, £8.99. What we love about these, they don't break the bank. If you want to give them a go, if you've never done any cross stitch before in your life, it's not that you're going to have to pay £50, £60. Pounds. It's just £8.99 to give Sally the Sloth a little bit of a go. Uh, we're going to move straight to the ladybird really sweet so so cute and uh, these take me back I don't know about the, you if you're watching as well now 
I mean, only seven pounds ninety nine. I wouldn't expect to, to to get the to get the ring for that either at all. I absolutely wouldn't. So you've got that beautiful material. You've got all the threads you need. You've got the pattern, which is really super super easy to follow. You've got the needle. You've got the ring in there as well, which you can either use to actually do your cross stitch. You can actually work from it, or if you don't like working that way, you can just use it to frame it, or yeah. not at all. Yeah. See, I purposely don't like using the frame more because yes. of because of my hands don't mm -hmm. like using the frame i've never been able to work using a frame um whereas i know quite a few people do like using yeah. the frame the beauty with the ladybird is as well is um yes. on the patterns and on the back of the box there is a qr code okay. so it does take you to a, a youtube link right um and that is the design that is on the youtube video not Thank made you. by me so Whenever you see our social media, yeah. I always go on as Mrs. Hetsy, the other half goes on as Mr. Hetsy. Yeah. And he actually did the Ladybird as his very first cross stitch to do the YouTube oh, wow. video. I did have to be out of the house when he did it. <laughs> Purely because I just spent my whole time standing there going, yeah, that's not, like not, that. that's not, not like that, not like that. <laughs> I did I did look at the completed video, but it's also broken down. So if there's a little bit that you are stuck at, you haven't Brilliant. got to watch the whole YouTube, you can just go back to that bit that you Excellent. stuck on. Or just um, our email address is on there. Yeah. So just drop us a line and I'm always happy to answer anyone's questions or okay. to go through if they are particularly stuck on one area. Great. She's gorgeous, £7.99 for your little ladybird. Beautiful. But I think we, it would be rude of us not to move to Philippe, uh, Philippe the frog. Uh, we're going to leap to Philippe. I'm leap not going to leap the frog over to you. Um, but £7.50. Now, this is your three-inch little Philippe frog. I love his little face. He's it's incredibly, incredibly cute. Oh, yes, he is. Thank you. He's over with me. See. See, um, he looks, he does look mischievous. Is that a little fly he's eyeing up as well? It is a little fly that is eyeing up. Dinner. Dinner. Eyeing up a bit of dinner. I love the fact that you've got different names for all of these as well. Uh, it's a little Philippe the Frog. We're going to have a little demo of Philippe. Uh, so you can, and a little unboxing actually. We'll have a little look yes. exactly at what you get when you're unboxing him. But he's, he's very, very cute. And in terms of people that, that maybe want to do these, if you're buying these perhaps for, you're thinking, oh my, I'd like to sit and do this with my grandson, yes. I'd like to do this with my niece. What are the age kind of limits on this? Because obviously you've got a needle in there. So because there's a needle in there, we do say um, not for under 12s okay. um, to do on their own. But really from about eight onwards with supervision, obviously yeah. it's down to the discretion of you. Of course. Um, and obviously you know the person that you'll be buying it for as to what their level is. Yeah. So what it's about what you're happy with. But really we say under 12s mm -hmm. do need to have supervision just yeah. to be careful and also it's quite nice to actually sit down and spend time together doing it, it because we're all so busy just to yeah. find the time to sit down and relax and do something together yeah. and it's those memories that you're creating i yes. know for me we were reminiscing about we this were. myself and my sister had cross stitches i mean the crosses the, they were huge when we first started but i remember sitting down doing that with my yes. mum and my nan and these are memories that you will absolutely treasure forever when you look at those cross stitches and of course you've got them in the rings here but set them in cards set them into the top of your boxes there's so many different ways to display these as well but let's let's have a look at philippe shall we sarah so this is the lovely philippe yeah so you can tell what sort of mood we're in mm -hmm. by whether or not they've got names and right. how crazy the names are so um, do I need to ask why Philippe I oh, know I don't no but leap leap for leap, for yeah. leap frog yeah um <laughs> normally when we're tired we just we do go with the do you know what let's just call it ladybird Right. sometimes they do just roll off so sally sloth does roll yeah. quite nicely hmm. whereas it's trying to find things for ladybirds and we try and incorporate the family in there but yeah okay. this is philippe frog so as you can see i've started um to do it now basically if you can count mm -hmm. you're fine with cross stitch so i only ever do counted cross stitch and all my cross stitches come with full crosses. So you haven't got to try and do a quarter cross. You haven't got to try and do a French knot. Okay. Because I can't do French knots. Although I've been doing it for this length of time, yep. I still can't do a French knot. So I will still just yeah. put black bits in. And your instructions, you can see the instructions obviously so, on yeah. the 
on the desk there. As you said, the actual uh, frog, Philippe, you can see on the left hand yeah. side. And then on the right hand side, you've got a mix of instructions with words and pictures. Yes. So it literally is just there for you. Step We've by kept step. step by step, kept very simply. And as you can see, there's just the YouTube link okay. on the instructions. So you can follow that. So I've already threaded my. Um, my embroidery thread so when mm -hmm. you get it you'll get it on a card just like this okay um so as you can see it does say philippe frog lovely there although i don't know it's upside down no, that's all good. um and then with each of the threads you break them up into six so you'll find six individual threads right with the cross stitch that i do i use two threads at a time yeah so i've literally just put them through the needle and then i've just done a little tiny not at the bottom that's okay. how i do it and it's quite interesting actually because i've had to relearn how to cross stitch because i've done okay. it for so long trying to think how i do it as a cross stitch and how someone would maybe do it yeah. as a beginner is completely different so i can't cross stitch my glasses on so they are going to have to come off that's allowed so <laughs> i don't know why i can't why i can't cross stitch my glasses on, on. yeah i know it's crazy <laughs> isn't it so just try and keep them and each keep the crosses in the same direction just because it'll look better on the completed okay. um, pattern. Now, how you do it mm -hmm. is completely up to you. It's about finding what is the comfortable way for you to do it. Right. So I will do it in complete crosses. So I will go up, so come up from top left, yeah. come on up, and go down, sorry if my head's in the way, and go down to bottom right. And then I will go up top right and come down bottom left. Okay. Um, but some people find it easier if they just do half stitches yeah. all the way across yeah. and then come back and do it that way. Yeah. It's whatever's easiest for you because ultimately, I want you to enjoy it yeah. and it is about finding out what's best for you. Yeah. So as you can see, we're just starting off just above um, the top left corner of his mm -hmm. mouth. So we will count all the way across. So you can count it individually, but with this one, you can see that it just goes straight across yeah. from the black one. So again, as I said, however's easiest for you, and what's so, the cross for on the frog? Is that just to mark out sort of where the centre so is? So that or? is to mark out where the centre is. Mm -hmm. So a little bit later, we can go through how to find the centre. Okay. Um, and how you can pop it in the frame if you do want to do it in the frame. As I said, right. I don't do it that way. So yeah, it's all so different. let's go. So again. And I have to say, this is very hard for you to do whilst we've got it an is. overhead camera and you can't get very close to it. It is, because so you can't get close because no, <laughs> no one wants to see the top of the head, do they? As lovely so, as it is. As lovely as it is. So again, top left, bottom right. I've got to remember my left and my right, haven't I, here as well. And then top right and bottom left. You almost need remember the mittens that used to have the L and the R on so you could yes. remember yeah. sometimes you feel like you need that like especially that. at this angle I hope it's all right everybody so again a very interesting just Jimmy go. who's uh, directing at the moment just said oh I don't know if I'd have, have the patience for cross stitch oh that's, Jimmy you would you would and this is why but that's why these projects yeah. are brilliant because you're not you haven't got a huge design to do no. this is a small project that doesn't take too much time and actually it's really satisfying because you start to see the image start uh, sort of appear really quickly and that is why people like it as yeah, a quick project sure. so well, if you are in the middle because you know you can do it sat quite comfortably yeah in front of the tv yeah. at night and it is that project that mm. because what i would say is if, you, if you've never done it before yeah um choose something quite blocky yeah it's the best way to describe it so yeah. fully a solid is solid solid sounds better doesn't it than blocky yeah it's a good word you can have it thank you I'm i don't gonna, charge much yeah <laughs> i'm going to use i'm going to use that for future you can have that. <laughs> go solid um just because then it is just so simple mm. and easy to do so you literally just go all the way across and you just carry on and carry on 
Um, and imagine having done that, if you think you're doing this yourself and then you pop that into a little card oh. to send that to your niece, your, your nephew, your, your granddaughter. Yes, I think we've got a useful. sunflower card Yeah, there, the little sunflower, look at this. It's really, really sweet. This is, Laura's just said, I want to do my cross stitch again. I'm thinking the same thing, because I'm, I'm having, a, I'm, I'm having a, a, an op on my hip in a, in a couple of weeks, so I'm going to be I'm, I'm literally on the sofa for about three, four so weeks So that's going to be perfect And I'm thinking, this is going to be absolutely, because little projects yeah. that you complete really quickly and really easily, or get a couple of these and start to build your own little scene. You've got so many gorgeous little animals. Isn't that lovely? Well, I've tried to bring the sets in that I think, you know, if you want to, you know, if you've got a baby being born in yeah. the family or it can go in the playroom. So just something fun and exciting and just the colours just really yeah. do pop yeah. and they are they are lovely and who doesn't love gnomes let's be honest Laura it's a gonk oh a gonk Appar sorry. How apparently very dare I. the way you tell the difference is and i got this i think when i saw debbie moore come on yeah one of hers the difference yeah. between the gonk and the gnomes if it's got eyes it's a gnome yeah if it's got no eyes it's a gong. Yeah, and then it's got no idea where it's looking or what's going on. Um, oh, I could use that as a name for a cross stitch, couldn't I? Absolutely. There you go. How are you? It's all coming out today. And um, the mushrooms in a jar look incredibly cute as well. Incredibly sweet. Look, we're going to bring a few more designs to you whilst we let you carry on with that, Sarah, so we can see Philippe, uh, maybe a, f a f full Philippe. I was trying to make that work. I can't make a, f a yeah. finished Philippe. A finished Don't know. Philippe. Um, Let's do, what did you say, sorry? A finished Philippe. A finished Philippe. Um, the little dino, he is Dippy Dino. Right, I can think of at least, I've got at least five little ins that would absolutely love this one right now, the little ins. Um, I'm coming out with some random words today, I'm not quite sure why. Um, how sweet is he? Your little dinosaur. Again, quite a, quite a blocky one. Yes. Quite a blocky, if you want to move up perhaps to, to, to the next stage on that one. Um, a lovely long neck, seven pounds and ninety nine pence, and again you can see on there beautifully designed. You've got that in the little box. Comes to you at seven pounds ninety nine. You've got everything you need in there. You've got your um, what do you call the material? The Ada. Ada. I see. I'm learning. Uh, so you've got your Ada. You've got the ring. You've got all the thread. You've got your needle in there as well. The pattern. Remember, super duper easy to follow. Everything in there for seven pound ninety nine, and it has been road tested oh, what by that my. Well, whenever I do some designs, yes. So I have two lovely little grandsons. Okay. And if they can tell me what the dinosaur is, then I know perfect that I've Tick. got it correct. Yeah, and that passed the test. And that passed the test. So even the two-year-old knew. Yeah. That it was a dinosaur. The four-year-old could name what dinosaur it was. So therefore, it was I'm it. going that it's. Yeah, you've got that one right. I've got that one right. Superb. I mean, yeah. They, class, they don't classic. lie to you, do no, they? No, children? exactly. Absolutely. Should we do the little sunflower gnome whilst he's here? So you've got it. You can see any of these will work on your cards. They'll work in the top of your little memory boxes. You might want to pop them into journals. You might want to pop them into your diaries. Have that on the front of a diary as well. Maybe yeah. it's your gardening journal, uh, which would be lovely. Um, I love this one. I love his little hat. Look, I mean, I love sunflowers anyway. They're incredibly, incredibly bright and beautiful but everything you need is in that particular kit and don't forget if you get a little bit you know a little bit more advanced with that then you can start to think even about personalization if you want to add yes. you know to start to add your personalization you might want to oops no uh, gonk him over. over is gonked um if you want to add in perhaps even a date on that maybe it's a special date to remember maybe it's Birth just a name lovely there's loads you can do with these, but such a great price again, eight pounds and 99 pence. That is your sunflower, uh, your sunflower uh, gnome, crotch, crotch, oh, I can't keep saying the wrong cross word, don't I? Stitch. How many times am I gonna say that today? <laughs> Definitely a cross Are you sure stitch. it's tea you've been drinking? <laughs> Do you know what? I've not had a sip. Oh, my word. I've really not had a sip of early tea yet. Wow. It looks like it's come fresh from the swamp. That does love her. Um, anyway, uh, moving on. Poor hope she, Ellie. hope she's not in here. We love Ellie. I did we beg do for love a cup Ellie. of tea and she's like, no, not doing it again. I'm like, come on, please. I love your tea. She definitely won't be doing it again. Then, she will won't. She? No. no. I'll grab some more milk. Um, <laughs> mushrooms. Let's have a little look at the mushrooms. These are so sweet. Little mushrooms or toadstools depending on how you want to look at them. Uh, little mushrooms in a jar. There's not mushroom left in there, is there? Oh, 
very... You did warn me that you were going to do I did warn some you pretty bad, bad jokes, didn't you? Yeah, are they on your husband's level? Yeah. Yeah, they are bad. Uh, so you're, I've not heard your husband's joke, by the way. Uh, yeah. So you've got your mushrooms in a jar. That's really sweet again, isn't it? It is. So sweet. many ages, so many different sort of reasons to perhaps send uh, that to somebody. And we've got a larger size, I do believe, on that one. So your little mushrooms in a jar. It's four inches. Four inches, there we go. Uh, and again, everything you need in that cross-stitch kit. It's all there for you. Uh, nice variety of colours. You've got the reds, greens, the kind of... Uh, the, the Blue. Teal. Teal. Keg blue. Keg blue. I oh, think. nice. And of course, you've got the pattern then, don't forget. Once you've used your threads and you've used all everything in there, you've still got the pattern. Yeah. Don't ever throw that away. I so you can so. just replenish yeah. your, your thread, your yeah. material. I mean, you could transfer that straight to a straight to a bag if you wanted yeah. to. There's lots of different things. Because Pillow you can just get the sort. dissolvable... Um, it's not Ada, but it's it's very similar to Ada. I can't remember what okay. the technical name is for I can't it. Help. But there is a technical name for it. Yeah. It's not very complicated. Um, but you can do that. And then when you put it in water, yeah. then that bit dissolves yeah. so perfectly going onto a bag. And then, you, then you've not got that bit. But there's nothing to say that you can't So. So this bit of Ada mm. onto a bag, you know, exactly. I mean, you know, we've got it in a card there, but you could also yeah. put it in a shadow box frame nice. as well. So yeah. if you are doing it as a birth sampler or you want to do it as a special gift for someone, Definitely. then you just, just will go for the word zhuzh. We'll exactly. zhuzh it up. Zhuzh it up. Why yes. not? Absolutely. And such a great variety of different projects, different designs that we're seeing here. So that one's £9.50, the mushroom in a job. A little bit more to that one, uh, potentially. Um, how's Philippe looking? Philippe's looking okay. Is he? Do you know what? I didn't realise I need to practice this when I come back in June. Oh, okay. As to how to cross stitch. From a slight distance. From a yeah, slight it distance. Is, it is hard. I tell you, that's what they say, every day's a school day, isn't exactly. it? Exactly. Because I know that would be very, I'd, yeah, I'd be bringing yeah. it up a bit closer. Yeah. I know, but I think um, I think our director might shout at me if I bring it up too close. Well, we wouldn't see him, would we? We wouldn't <laughs> see his little face. I know. But I haven't got my glasses on, so I couldn't see his little face, <laughs> even if I wanted to. You can see how easy these are to build, though. So, yeah. But obviously, the more time you've got to do yeah. it... The, easy, the easier it is, as I said. It's, um, yeah, I'm going to pra be practising this before I come back in June. Yeah, it's, well, he's, he's, you're doing very well. It's so, very yeah. lovely. You could have a whole whole pond of frogs, couldn't you, really? A you whole could. Pond of you could beliefs. call them different names, couldn't you, I suppose? Yeah, very much so. And yeah. I suppose you could, once you've got your patterns, if you want to start playing around with different colours or yeah. adding different uh, uh, bits and bobs, there might be something on one of the other designs that you want yeah. to actually put alongside your little mm. your little frog. Like the mushrooms yeah. would work really brilliantly alongside the little gnomes. So if you're getting those two, yeah. you could absolutely mix those together and on, a, on a second And there's nothing to project. say that if you wanted them to be looking at each other, mm. where you've got the black there okay. for him looking eyes. up that way yeah just switch it over to the other side oh cute oh, so, and then just and bit. then just move the fly move over because oh, otherwise the fly would look a little bit odd if, if philippe's not looking at the fly really would this he? is true yeah he'd look a little bit cross-eyed he would which he could be as well which he could he be if he hadn't got his glasses on and yeah. he's struggling uh but all of this that you get from the box. Should we have a little unbox, actually? Well, Shall we? This side of you very quickly. Let's we've do got, that. We've got quite a few more designs to share yeah. with you. Some so, as we say, this well. is Philippe when he is framed. Yeah. Um, you normally you do, obviously, as you can see on here, you do get quite a bit of excess. Mm -hmm. So I have cut it off around the back. So that's what he looks like on the back. Yep. So it has taken oh, okay. many years to get it looking as neat as it does right. on the back as the front. But as I said, just do it your way. Yeah. It's all about having fun, experimenting Absolutely. and finding what's right for you. Absolutely. So when you order it, you will get um, the box comes through the post. Mm -hmm. um, I think we're looking just after the weekend, aren't we? Because it yeah, we might have holiday. a bit of a delay because of bank um, So, which is a little bit inconvenient because I'm trying to remember what day it is after I last know. bank holiday. I know. Um, so you do get um, the stick on the front, so you can see exactly mm -hmm. what it is. As I said. You get a little bit on the back which tells you exactly what you do you get in the kit. Okay. And then you just need to just unslip it at the bottom. I haven't put anything else in there that doesn't need to be in there. So whatever is in there okay. is 
what you're going to need. So you've got your instructions. Yeah. So they will come folded up. They're just a nice little hello and welcome message from us. Just say thank you very much for buying the kit because we yeah. do appreciate it. Um, you will get your Philippe threads. So we have gone a bit posher. Nice. Um, as Great case. that they're all separated out. So I they? have separated them all out. There is plenty in there, mm. so you should have enough if you do get a little bit of a knot, because Ava and I still get a little bit of a knot sometimes halfway yeah. up. If you don't have enough, or you find um, that how you do it may be a little bit different to how I thought you may do it, just drop me a line, just say, I'm a little bit short on this colour and I'll just pop some in the post free of charge. Oh, okay. That's not oh, a problem. That's, that's not a problem. So is that an email they need to send? So that's or? just an email that they just send. And what's your email? <sighs> and you're going to ask me that. I've asked you. Is it in the box? Um, it is in the box. It's in the box. We'll w leave it there. www.hettiscraftycreations.com. It's even there on the there front. There we go. It's even You'll better. Find. Yeah. Oh, I passed that test. <laughs> you get your hoop frame, which will be the correct size for what you are going to need your project mm -hmm. as. So this will be a three inch. And then you get your aider uh, and you've got your needle just Super. at the top. So literally everything Great. is, all in, is there. in there and it's all in there without any problems. Lovely. Nice and easy. So that's Philippe the Frog. If you want Philippe to grab your Philippe's, make sure you leap for Philippe um, at £7.50. Um, on the telephone lines, 0800 001 I can't think of any frog jokes right now. Uh, to be perfectly <laughs> honest, I, I, sh I should have done some more homework, really. Um, let's do... Let's do... Hamish. Ooh. Hamish the Highland Cow. Yes. I love him. So we're going a little bit bigger with Hamish. Hamish is a five inch cross stitch. Just glorious. There we go. That's the stand gone. Yeah. I'm just going to hold that. He is absolutely fabulous. I, I mean, it's, you know exactly what variety of, of, of cow that is really, don't you? Yes. Just from the fact that you can't see his eyes. And again, although it's five inches, it's it is only three colours. And again, right. The outline is just the one colour. Then you've yes, got gosh. the cream in the middle for the nose and the horns, which again, it's all in one block. Yeah. And then you just fill the other one in. So although it is a slightly bigger project, there's nothing to say that as a beginner, if you are feeling a little bit confident, and especially if you do love Highland cows. Yeah, they're great. Then they, they are, are popular, they are, they they? are great. You see them on mugs and all sorts, don't yes. you? Artwork again. Yes. Something you'd just put in a little sort of really inexpensive box frame. He'd look absolutely gorgeous. So £13.50 for Hamish, the Highland cow. Named by the grandson. Oh, okay. Named there we go. Named so by the lovely Alby because we bought him a book in Scotland called Hamish, the Highland cow. Aww. But apparently if it was a girl cow, it's going to be called, he said it to be called Deborah. Oh, okay, so look out for Deborah. She might be with you in she might future, be with projects. <laughs> future projects. Future projects. <laughs> I, I think she'll have to be, really. Yeah. Deborah and Hamish. Deborah and uh, Hamish together. <laughs> uh, right, let's pop that one back and I'm going to pick up. Now, I've got to warn you, this is going to be popular because we all love the bees, whether that they're has on to your be cards. one of my favourite ones, <gasps> that one does. This is really, really, really perfect. You will, oh my goodness me, that's a definite framer, isn't it? Whether you want to keep it in that frame and just pop that onto a shelf, or you could hook that on the wall actually as it is, uh, or pop it into a box frame. Again, think about cards, think of using that on a little memory box. It's such a lovely design. A bit, a bit more detailed, that one. Yes. But, but still not, you know, no different, really, no, no different, different because they are wise. No different technique, and they are all full stitches. And again, they're quite, the colours together are quite compact, so you haven't got to necessarily have one bit in this corner and then another mm. bit in that corner, so you're not constantly having to unthread and re-thread your needle. Yeah. He is lovely. £12 and 99 pence. And I mean, just so many different um, sort of sentiments, I think, when we think mm. about the bees, actually. It's really lovely. And I don't know if you can see the, the little wings in there. That's actually kind of a bluey hue, isn't yes. it, on the wing? Really, really subtle. But the detail is absolutely gorgeous. You kind of feel his personality a little bit when you see that. I saved a bee at the weekend. It was trapped in my mum and dad's conservatory. So I, yeah, I got it. It wouldn't come out. So I grabbed a picture of me and my husband and then it wouldn't get off the picture. So it sat, sat outside for a while. My dad got home and went, why is there a picture of you and Richard on the patio? I went, oh, it had a bee on it. <laughs> it was a long story. Like, like, just like, don't ask dad. It's yeah, just easy not, not to ask sometimes. Yeah. It? It's just a normal thing you do. Uh, but honestly, you will be buzzing when you get that home, when you get your fabulous little bumblebee. And again, don't, you know, don't forget, 
If you are maybe a more advanced cross stitcher or even if you're just going to have a little look, there's lots of techniques on YouTube. You might want to add a date on there. It might be the birth of a new baby. Uh, it could be a name that you want to add on to that. Maybe someone's moved into a new, ha a new house, a new home. You might want to put the number of their house on there. There's so many different things you can do. Not the whole address because there's probably not room. Mobile number, inside leg measurement. Wi-Fi code. <laughs> yeah. I like, no, I actually, I actually like the Wi-Fi code yeah. on that because how many times can you not find the Wi-Fi code when someone comes well, around? This is, and it's a bit personal, isn't it? I you don't want to go great. to someone's house and say, hi, how are you? By oh, the way, can I please have your Wi-Fi code? <laughs> but how many times do you hear that? All the time. Hilarious. All hi, the please time. have the Wi-Fi. Uh, so £12.99. June, you've got a couple of those. Congratulations. And don't forget, you might be grabbing this for you right now to do and complete and to keep you might want to grab another one to give away as a gift maybe you've got a group of crafters maybe you love doing your cross stitch and this is an absolute dream of a show for you and you're thinking i need to grab a couple of these because i can absolutely think of lots of different ways of then using them whether it's home decor whether you're popping that into a little picture frame I can imagine that perhaps sitting in a little conservatory on the wall as well yeah. I think that would look really lovely and also um, if you are quite a seasoned cross stitcher if you do want to obviously turn it into and put someone's address on there or welcome to your new home there's nothing to say so yes that is a five inch frame mm -hmm. but there's nothing to say get some bigger aider yeah and then you can Absolutely. Make sure you've got room. So yes, although in the kit it does come with that size hoop and that size aider. If you've got mm. some aider at home, then you can put it on a bigger one and then it just expands Absolutely. what you can use it for then yeah. really. And again, like we said, you could do a couple of those yeah. on a particular design. You could do, make a border frame with a lot of them if you wanted to, uh, but really sweet. Oh, message coming in from Rosemary. Rosemary and Kent, hello to my lovely. Um, these would be lovely stitched and used on a baby blanket, on a yes. baby clothes. The B is super from Rosemary. Oh, thank you, Rosemary. I do like doing that one. That's a I'm really nice idea. It. But it's a fantastic Yeah, beauty. absolutely. Gorgeous. Uh, keep checking out on that, on your bumblebee. He's rather fabulous. If I can pop him back on there. Um, right. He's so much better than I would because half of them stands would be over by now. Trust me, that's normally what happens. <laughs> that's normally what happens. Um, <laughs> right. Uh, where's the rabbit? Oh, here he is, over here. Let me grab hold of this. This is cute because this is a really nice take on the rabbit yes. it's not your normal bunny rabbit as in you'd expect to see the face the whiskers and all the rest of it it's a little bit of a quirky take on it because when you look at the little rabbit he's made up of carrots he's made up of carrots that's a clever idea i do love i i love all of them hence to say why i've bought these ones yeah once on with me for the first show um but he is cute and i think because he is made up of carrots and that's the first thing that people do notice is that he does have the carrots yeah. um, and he is a six inch so his mm -hmm. box is slightly bigger than the three and four inches yeah. but still comes through as a large letter okay so perfect all the kits that I've got on display do go through as a large letter so nothing yeah. changes from that point of view if you are buying it as a gift brilliant for somebody it's, it's just gorgeous and that's quite ageless as well i think you could send that to absolutely yeah. anybody uh, so that's 11 pounds 99 because that's a little bit uh, a little bit larger but again that's two is that two colors two two colors so you've literally got the green and the orange brilliant. so you can't go wrong with it very very simple you've almost got that lovely little silhouette and of course the little rabbit any time of the year but again as we move around swoop around next year mm. to easter obviously rabbit's obviously very popular easter yes. uh, be a really lovely little easter treat it'll be here again before we know um but don't say that i, I know it's, it's flying, scary it? that we're already in may I know. Ignore that bit. Sorry. Uh, 11, yeah, we've got to get summer first. Yeah. Summer's not arrived yet. I need I need the sun first. Um, 11, and apparently 17 degrees in some places today. Yeah, I'm not rather lovely. Not in Redditch it isn't, I don't say. <laughs> sun always shines in the studio though, Sarah. It does. Uh, so £11.99 for your little bunny. And he's called Arthur. Arthur Rabbit. So what? R for Rabbit. Oh, R for Rabbit. Yes. I didn't get that earlier on when you said it, but we were quite busy. I started we going, Arthur. I didn't, I didn't. We were yeah. discussing knitted scarecrows. Well. This is quite true. That's a whole different yes. conversation. Uh, R for Rabbit. Arthur. Love it. Uh, so that is your bunny rabbit, which is always going to be very popular. Uh, we've got a peacock somewhere. Oh, the somewhere. big one. Now, this is awesome. I love, love, love the peacock. 
incredible detail on that one all of the detail you can see in the plumage so your peacock it's a great word that isn't it plumage uh, your peacock cross stitch seven inch counted cross stitch on that and again everything you need to complete your project wonderful colors that blue that kind of turquoise just hue. pops out at you doesn't it why is it you have to or is it just me i just have to touch them is that just is that just me no, i don't think it is just you They're quite i tactile. can't say that i've tried to stroke the a peacock. peacock don't try and stroke a peacock um, by the way um but no they are lovely aren't they um i have a friend that's terrified of peacocks oh. so whenever i see one i do send him in fact i will take a photograph up before i go and send it to him uh, 13 pounds there used to be a local peacock at the pub close to here actually oh. Yeah, quite terrifying when he's at the front door. Uh, but they are fabulous creatures. And you can see, again, wonderful, wonderful detail in there. But not too detailed to be frightened of it. No. Really simple. Everything's laid out for you. You get your gorgeous um, uh, detailed instructions. You've got words and you've got the pictures taking you through step by step. Where to start, how to start, how to keep working on that. As Sarah said, if you want to adjust it and you want to do your full cross stitch as you go along, you can. Or maybe you want to do your half and just go in kind of diagonals and then come back. Uh, it's up to you. There's, there's no zigs rule and on zags. that, really. Your zigs and your zags. Your zigs and your zags. There we go. Saying, I don't know the terminology. Well, I don't know that's um, correct terminology, but that's what but it works. Works. <laughs> it works. Um, I think we've got, oh, we have got one more. We have got one more. Now, this is totally different but it is completely exclusive to you. For all of us here today at Hobby Maker, just, not just for you, Laura, for everybody. And it says, count your rainbows, not your thunderstorms. Makes you think that for a little bit, doesn't it? It does. I mean, I'm terrible. I'm one of these people. You always get the people either the glass is half empty yeah. or it's half full. Mm -hmm. I'm terrible for it. And okay. I saw it and... I just liked it. Yeah, it's not one I've heard before. And it's just sort of, do you know what? You just need something just sometimes just to cheer you off. Yeah. Because, you know, life can get be a little bit hectic. It can be a little bit crazy. And, you know, in today's age, we are very much, certainly after what's happened in the last few mm. years, we are very much into our mindfulness and yeah. to think about things and just to stop and think, do you know what? Absolutely. No matter how bad a day it is, could be worse. Yep. But you know what? That's just quite inspiring. It, it just is. makes you smile when you look at it. And yep. the fact you've got the word rainbow in the rainbow colours. Yeah, it's really it cute. It makes it all nice. Uh, and it, it does. just... And that's what, that's what life's all about. We're going to have good parts, bad parts, yeah. you know, pretty ones, not so pretty ones. Uh, but it's about it's about collecting the wins, isn't it? It's about yes. having a little look. And I've started to do, to do this kind of at the, at the end of the day, writing a list of things I need to do the next day, but writing a list of things that have happened that day. Not so much a diary, but just what's happened today that I can say is a win. What, what have I been proud of today? What have I done today? What are the happy little things that have happened today? And it might be the really small things that actually you might not stop to think about, but actually when you write it down and look and you go, okay, that's not so bad. So all that little bit of a thunderstorm that's rumbling on. But I do think sometimes we do tend to look at more negative than we do positive. Yeah, it's kind of easier to do that, yeah. isn't it? But actually, let's all, all look at the happy things and that's, that's wonderful. And that'd be a lovely gift. That's £15.99. Yeah. And of course, if you you did i'm just thinking if you did want to grab hold of that because that is brand new and exclusive to hobby maker today you could potentially either keep that in the gift box and give it as a little bit of a gift or you could do it wrap it up and you could present that to a loved one in the gift bag now this gift bag is so gorgeous it says crafting makes everything better even Mondays and it's honestly the mo you, you'll love the quality of this bag when you get this home it's really really nice material it's not going to snag on anything there's nothing no. worse if you certainly as a woman if you've got a pair of tights on oh. there's nothing worse than snagging your tights you on don't want to be doing that you especially be not at the beginning of the day no but now, and also if you've got slightly dry hands and you get one of those yes. sort of hessian bags and it's like oh and um, it's really lovely and it's very very lightweight so you could pop that into maybe your handbag your normal bag for the day wrap it up it's going to take no space whatsoever but it's really lightweight so you could gift that or as sarah said at the start of the show if you are going around one of the big crafting exhibitions one of the big shows take that with you you know you get loads of little freebies 
gradually stuff yeah. it full with that one. I love oh. freebie. Every, oh, who doesn't? Everybody loves freebie. Exactly. Or if you're going on a camping holiday, yep. um, we'll sort of go to events um, yeah, and have stalls holiday. where it's a three-day event and we tend to get the wives yep. coming to find us. Um, it's really cute. Pop lunch in that you, as well. Yeah. So if, if you are starting a cross stitch kit, you can just pop it in your bag, and it's just yeah. it's just there. You haven't got to take a lot with you. You literally nope. just you know if you if you're short on space, if you know even if you're going on an airplane, then you've just got your little tiny box, so you can just spend. Yeah. I just knocked Felipe. That's all right. Um, no one you can Just spend. Yeah. I'll just ignore that bit. Um, so you can just spend your two weeks holiday. If you don't want to sit there reading, you can sit there doing yeah. your cross stitch. Excuse, isn't it? Really, really nice. Loads of you checking out on that. Um, and I can say at the moment, most popular at the moment is the bee. Not a surprise. The bumblebee is buzzing out of here. It's taken for light. So make sure if you do want to grab hold of that, you do it really, really quickly. I almost feel like we need to have a name for the bee. I don't feel he has much I justice do. being called bumblebee. We've had Barney and Barry, I was going to go Bertie. Now, yes, yeah. Mm, I've already got a Bertie. Oh, have you? Else. Yeah. Barney Courtney. Why Courtney? Who <laughs> said Courtney? Oh, it's it's Jimmy, but we never listen to anything Jimmy says. <laughs> I feel it's I feel like Dave. I feel like he's female for some reason. But I could be wrong on that. Barbara, have you got mm. I don't know. We'll we'll have a think on that for next time. Yeah. Sandra, everyone's just shouting random names. Quite. I was gonna say, we're not getting very sensible names, are we? No, Gary. Could be. Keith, oh, stop it. <laughs> Call it Liam. <laughs> Liam, oh don't, he'll love that. He'll love Liam, that. Liam I mean, the Bumblebee. Personally, I think the correct name for this is obviously Ruth. Oh, well, obviously. yes. How could I have not thought How that? How could you not have I'm gone sorry. there? It sounds like what? Ruth B. What's wrong with that? Ruthie? Ruth B. I think it's perfect. Uh, £12.99 <laughs> for the Bumblebee. We will work on that. Yeah, um, it, you know from the cameraman. Yes, <laughs> we've definitely not got that right so far. Yeah. Um, really cute. Oh, Kat, who was that? Sorry? Kathy in Buckinghamshire says Brenda. Brenda the Bren Bumblebee. I haven't got anything but, called Brenda. There you go. There you go. I quite like that. Uh, so £12.99, that is the most popular at the moment. Angela Caffin, you've just added that to your basket as well. I, I think we need a quick... Oh, that's his, that's his brother. I think we need a final <laughs> quick look at Philippe, not Felipe, uh, but a little final look at Philippe. So, yes, Philippe. I sort of gave up on Philippe. Didn't that's I? all right. Well, there's lots so, of things going on. but I that's know, it's so exciting. It's amazing how quickly that hour goes. Yeah. It is, very, it is very scary you. how quickly yeah. the hour goes. Time flies. So, um, so yes. Yeah, so, so my homework. Yeah. When I come back on, so back on the twenty first of June. Brilliant. Um, three o'clock again. Lovely. Um, so it's a Wednesday, just to confuse me even more. That's all right. Um, and we will have some more surprises for you oh, then. Oh, okay. So yes. Yeah, so so my task. Yes. So everybody else's task is to maybe pick up and learn how to cross stitch yes and send you photographs send you photos and i love seeing photos yeah so when um, so when sarah's back with us send all your photographs in get the, get all your projects done get them ready when was it again 21st, 21st of june. june so when we're back on the 21st of june i don't know who is on air that day that's miles away uh, but whoever's with you whether it's dave or rosie or xena um we'll, we'll make sure that you send your makes in on that day so we can oh busby the bee busby <gasps> bumblebee busby bumblebee there very fabulous. That's, that's going back a while. Or bit, isn't if you it? wanted to, you could pot send it in as your craft of the month, couldn't you? Exactly, exactly. But we need to see your to designs, see, see what you've done with them. Maybe you've thought outside the box a little bit as well, and you've popped your projects into cards, like the little sunflower name we had there. Maybe you put it into a journal. Maybe you put the little bee on a bag. Whatever you've done. Or baby blanket. Baby blanket. Baby we had that earlier. Yep. Get those ready because even on your socks, you can have some snazzy socks with these on, couldn't you? Need you? pretty big feet though, wouldn't you? Possibly, yeah, and, a, and stretchy it's material. A five inch. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, we can we can do it. Can we name the peacock Paul? Paul the peacock. Who came up with the idea, Paul? I don't. I, I don't know. As do I, I want? want to to, do I? I know. Do I want to know? I Probably think sometimes not. It's no. safer. <laughs> Not to know, is it? <laughs> but well done. Any of the cross-stitch projects you've checked out on today, 
enjoy them and love them. Have a quick swoop because we've had so many. Obviously, that lovely large one there. Count your rainbows, not your thorn thunderstorms. Uh, exclusive to us today. We had the amazing peacock. Uh, of course, we had gorgeous Hamish. That was the Highland cow that we absolutely loved sitting next to the bumblebee. Then we had Sally. Sally the sloth still hanging around for now. Then we've got your luscious little ladybird that's not flown away so far. Uh, and of course, every single one comes to you like this box. You've got all the instructions in there as well. I'm going for Lily. Lily the ladybird. Lily the ladybird. Lily, like the, lady Lily the ladybird. I like that. Uh, dinosaur, we don't have to worry about because he's got a name. Got Dippy. Uh, Dippy. Dippy Dino. Uh, then we move across. We've got the mushrooms in the jar, which are really sweet. That's a lovely image, that is. Not much shroom in there. We did that, didn't we? We did uh, do that. It was bad the first time. <laughs> I was going to say, it didn't work the first time. Yeah, no. Uh, sunflower, no. I think he's a Gary. Yeah, definitely. Uh, and then last but not least, we've got the beautiful rabbit, which is Arthur. Arthur. Arthur Rab R4 Rabbits. Rabbit, in case you were like me. Yeah. Well, he is called Arthur. He is called Arthur, but he's it's called... a play on the... It's a play on words. It's never, yeah. it's never so good when you have to explain it, is no. it, Sarah? No, it just doesn't. But... If you have to explain it, it doesn't work. No. And if there's designs that you'd like to see, um, then please just send yeah. me the messages in again as well, because I do do some... I do do. I, um, I will yeah. do designs. So um, some of them are inspired. So my, my niece is a sloth fan, which is yeah. why there had to be... A sloth, everyone loves a highland cow and cat, a please. Kitten, cats, yes, need a kitten mitten, yes, thank you. And a sausage dog for Laura, okay, not a sausage, not just don't do a banger. She wants a sausage it's dog, be a sp very specific type. <laughs> it's all about the words, isn't it? Uh, Sarah, thank you so You're much for welcome. joining us thank today. You so much it's been lovely, me. it's been an absolute pleasure and gone so quickly. Zoomed by. Join Zoom. Sarah again. You're back with us on the 21st of June yes. at three o'clock. We're going to have a little look on her website again. Uh, head to Crafty Creations and get doing your cross stitches. Please and we do. can't wait to and see And send them. them in. Definitely, definitely. And get checking out. Stay with us though. Have a quick cup of tea. Don't go anywhere because Natalie is back after this and we've got so much more to share with you. Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and p Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. My name is Anne-Marie and I am the Creative Manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier papercraft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our papercraft goodies back at home in Preston. We do lots of papercraft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, water brush pens. And we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations, which we just know the audience love. to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker.
Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gifts? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? Welcome back to Harvey Maker. Natalie from Hunky Dory is back I'm with us. Back. I don't know why I said that so aggressively. Natalie. Natalie. Just felt like I'm in that. I know. Natalie's time at the moment. Does it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we won't go there. We won't go there. Newly married Natalie. Yeah. How's married life, Natalie? It's brilliant. How's it going? <laughs> It's brilliant when DIY is not involved. Yeah, Natalie and husband, you've been doing DIY and it's, we have, um, yeah. it's quite stressful, isn't it? Yeah, it was crazy. We were talking about this the other day. It doesn't even feel like we've lived in that house for two years, but we have. But yeah, there's still rooms that we needed to do. Yeah. Um, so we've, we're, right, You're on we're it. right in the midst of yeah, a, a, right in the middle a of renovation. It. It's yeah. wonderful. Just as soon as, <laughs> as soon as he knows that you are always right, it will uh, everything. <laughs> all of our it'll problems will disappear. Yeah, it will be easier. <laughs> um, right, let's dive in. We've got two brand new deals, brand new bundles uh, to share with you. We are going to dive straight in because if you would love, now these, I've got to say, before I share them with you, I don't have hundreds no, of these. Don't. I, don't, I don't have no. triple figures. No. Can't get any more. Very limited. They are fabulous. Everybody's gone nuts for these. Um, they're just utterly gorgeous. I'm going to show them to you one by one, then I'll show you them on the boards, but you're going to fall in love with them. And I promise you now, I don't think you'll guess the price of this as a bundle. I don't think anyone is going to be able to guess this price. No, Maybe because... We'll do a little, um, a little giveaway if someone can because it's quite crazy well it's, it's, it's up to you now yeah. it's up to you we'll see uh 17.99 bear it is, is not your price okay absolutely not it's not your price this is for four four masks four masks okay but the love of masks so let's have a little look at your first one which they're all just beautiful they're absolutely gorgeous aren't they isn't that lovely um, it's the floral there's some beautiful designs within here that are um create the most beautiful backgrounds. And I mean, there's so many different oh things we can do with our inks and our, um, maybe you've got your um, glimmer mist or your gilding flakes, or mm. maybe you've got some um, of the uh, cosmic shimmer paste and nice. things like that from Creative Expressions. Yeah. These are gonna work gorgeously with that, but they give you such a, a beautiful design. They're I absolutely, absolutely lovely. Love them. And I actually really like, I know this is kind of a bit by the by, but I love the way you've got that as a background to show you what yeah, you can so potentially you can, create. Yeah, it looks really nice, doesn't it's it? It's gorgeous. In those color ways. Yeah, and also, just so you know, if you haven't seen the masks before, you've got the details on the back of how to use one. Which so is perfect, that, isn't brilliant. It? Yeah, really good. People are checking out already. Look at number two. <gasps> it's like 
kind of a vortex or a starburst or something on this one. Uh, really, really cute again. Uh, so this one is your Radiant Delights. Uh, totally different to the other one, but you can tell they're kind of from the same collection. Yeah, you got can, the same can't feel, you? Haven't they? Which is great because if you wanted to sort of layer them up and do sort of like some light um, inking with this one and then yeah. put a flower on top of that, you could mix and match the two um, the four that we have for you here today, but this one's really, really nice. I love them. Gives me a bit of like a, a Moroccan tile feel. Yeah, as well. I could that? go Moroccan tile. I could also kind of go a bit seventies vibe on yeah. this one as well. A little bit, you know. Don't know. It's very don't know. cool. We'll all see different things, to be perfectly honest. Then we move to uh, now the butterflies. This is when it's going to start to get a little bit crazy bonkers yes. because that kaleidoscope of butterflies that you're seeing there, yes. it's like they've just kind of gone and they're all kind of taking off. It's like you off. open a, the lid of a box and they're yes. all just flying. They're all escaping. It. Isn't that fabulous? That's the noun for Yeah, collective noun for, for a group of butterflies is a kaleidoscope. Uh, so your butter, butterfly burst, if I can say it. And it really does what it says on the, on the tin, it doesn't really it? It really does, yeah. But how nice, because you've got a really lovely collection of, I don't know if you look a bit close up, there's different, it's not the same butterfly. No, no, there's lots of different bits and pieces and we can be cutting into this, you know, we can be creating mm -hmm. panels for our cars. We can um, shape this mask so it's coming off the edge of our cardstock so those butterflies are sort of flying up from a corner as well. Um, there's lots of different ways in which you can use these, which I really, really like. It's gorgeous, isn't it? And then last, but certainly not least, we have one more for you. And this is, I love this, the Dazzling Dahlia. I adore this. It's I have to beautiful. say, I think that's one of my favourites. It's really nice. It's gorgeous. This one again, we could be inking through this. We could be cutting it out, layering it up as well. Um, there's lots of different ways in which we can do this. They're six by six as well, but if yeah. you wanted to, we can also tile some of these mm -hmm. um, so we could make those images bigger as well. They're gorgeous. Now, it does say uh, uh, you are getting all four. It's you the are. ultimate collection. And just look at those together. You've got that beautiful dahlia. Imagine butterflies coming from that. Then, you know, that you can really mix and match these. But I just think, and, and seeing that pop of colour again, I'd do it like that because I love pink, simple as. It's incredible, as. isn't it? Yeah, really wonderful. Imagine getting your prism inks and adding in sort of touches of blues and whites or going for your greens. Maybe you're adding in a bit of a shimmer effect. You'd be using your embossing yes. ink as well, going on top of certain areas, adding in sort That's of um, embossed sort of leaves of your flowers. Could you paper piece some of those? You, you could... You I guess could, it's not a die, so you're not cutting it yeah, out. Yeah, so. you could do, though, because you could... Um, you could ink through it and then you could sort of like hand cut out all of yeah. the different bits and then lay it over. It's fiddly um, bit. But you can definitely create so many different looks by inking in sort of like individual petals mm. if you wanted to, you could do it that way. Um, so it gives it that paper piece and feel. They're just fabulous. Look, there's loads of you there, loads in baskets. We are incredibly limited on these. I'm so, so sorry. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm sad we can't get more of these, but sometimes we don't get everything we need in life. Uh, but look at that, £12.99 for four. It's incredible. It's so good. Absolutely incredible for all of those. They look beautiful as well. When you start to have a little bit of a play with these, suddenly out the corner of my eye, it's like ding, ding, ding. Um, so get those home. Remember, you've got these four. You are getting all four. I have to stress that uh, because I know you look at them and think, what? Uh, so you're getting that beautiful dahlia. You'd expect you'd be getting two for this price. Yes. Not four for this price. Yeah, it's exactly. It's absolutely crazy. They are wonderful, aren't we? We should have, I wish we had more. Uh, there's your butterfly. I'm just going to try and show kidding. those. And um, if everybody checks out, they're all literally half gone, did you say? Right, wow. okie doke, Well, What are we going to do? Well, we're going to cry if we don't have them. That's what's going to happen, Nat. There we go. You'll have to do that disco dancing thing that you did the other day. Okay. Do those moves. Okay, I'll try. Okay, try that's, that's Pull what it out. Pull wow. It out the bag. Oh, Jimmy's we'll got just, the moves. We'll just, we'll just get Jimmy on. Just get Jimmy we'll on. just watch Jimmy. He's got wow. it. Look at that. He's I mean, he could put a bit more effort in, but it's it's not <laughs> bad. There we go. Oh, way up. Not that much. It's only four o'clock. Uh, Twelve pounds. It's all in the hips, apparently. Twelve pounds and ninety nine. Well done, June, Catherine, Jacqueline, Pauline, Michelle, Susan, Sylvia, Rosemary. I have so, so, so many of you uh, wanted to get those home and I am not surprised. Remember, you get the instructions on the back yes. if you haven't worked with your masks before. It tells you how to use them, how to place them, obviously, and then how to use those with the ink so step by step guide really really easy on those super can, super easy can you use these as, as almost like embossing folders or not 
Can you? you can. Am I one step ahead now? You are one step <gasps> ahead. Because I don't know you what that's actually going to do. But yes. oh, have I just um, ruined your she demo? Hasn't ruined it, no. But yeah, we can use these with our rubber mats. Um, and we can run these through our die cutting machines and it embosses through here to give you the most incredible effect. And I also think that if we're inking through these as well, it just gives it that next level for yeah. our card making because you've not only got that colour coming through, but we've also got that texture Wonderful. on our card as well. So it's phenomenal They're going to look that. amazing. Yeah. <gasps> My goodness me. Right, before we see a demo on those, I'm going to bring in the other bundle because oh. uh, we've got even more for you. We Another do. new bundle. Brand new today. Today, these are our um, sentiment dies. Um, wow. These are gorgeous. You right. are kidding. Uh, even, even more limited. Yeah, sorry. Wowzers. Even more limited than the mask. So we've so. got four different sentiments for you here. They're all in beautiful shapes. Um, what you actually get in they? one set is four dies. So we're going to give you um, the die that you see cut out of black, which has all your wording on. And then you're also going to get the, the matte, sort of like the layer that sits behind there. Oh, um, okay. So you get both of those. So you can choose to sort of cut out the words if you want to and have it mm -hmm. straight onto your cards, or we can layer that on to say maybe parchment or miri just to bring out the wording in there um, but they're beautiful Aww. you've got such lovely sentiments in here really nice artwork and shapes throughout them as well aren't they lovely sentiments so your friendship means the world to me thanks Ruth that's all right now and do you know what now always on my mind forever on my heart I know I know always always uh the other two let's see if the other two work for natalie as well uh the other two we've got have a blooming wonderful day i will and i used to like you but no oh no hold on <laughs> no so very grateful for you there we go so i read that wrong <laughs> <laughs> these are the lovely sort of um round shapes though you've got that beautiful scalloped circle and then that really nice bracket as well which is so detailed and different in that shape <laughs> see me trying to be all professional here me uh, well they took the second show <laughs> I told you they won't let us work together anymore. That's <laughs> why so we've not been together forever. <laughs> Banned, literally. We were That's allowed wild. one show today and I've just <laughs> ruined it all, Natalie. See, our last show together. Um, aren't they good? Should we do the deal price Let's on these? Let's do it. Because you are going to get them all and you will probably wow. notice if you have a little look, they should be 14 99 each. And you're going to get the whole kit and caboodle for £24.98. But look at the backgrounds on the cards. You've got that wonderful butterfly uh, mask that we saw earlier on. So your butterfly burst is on that one. And then you've got that gorgeous, dazzling dahlia on the other. They work so Such nicely on those. a match, those. isn't it? And when you've got gorgeous These masks like this, you just want dyes that are going to work so perfectly with them. Yeah absolutely they're fa I'd, I'd love to see some some uh, sentiments that were like i used to like you <laughs> i think they go think... really well i keep asking at the, the office tongue and cheek People collection just tell me we're not allowed it now not allowed to no. do them oh okay uh but for now 24 pounds <laughs> and 98 pence a brilliant deal on those as well <laughs> really really gorgeous uh, price points on these ones brand new to hobby i don't want that why went that high brand new. new um on the telephone lines 0800 double zero one double four double three oh well i've just started ellie's tea that's what it is it's sending <laughs> me over the edge trust me um they are fantastic Check out on those now. Make sure you get the masks because they won't be there for very long. We we have very few, less than half of the wow. stock remaining on the masks. So let's see these. Let's do it. Right so I'm going to use the beautiful Starburst one. Now the thing, masks and people will be thinking, what is a mask? It's it's very much the same as a stencil. We say, just choose to call them. Okay. Um, it's just the difference in what you what what we choose to call them. Um, when you're putting your mask down, though, you will see when you get it that you have a slight beveled edge on one of the layers. So that okay. is the way that you want to sort of lay it down on here, right. so it sits nice and flat on your card. And I'm actually going to offset this. So I've got a piece of um, cardstock here which is slightly smaller than. Um, this one and we're just going to lay it over our cardstock onto here and I'm just going to tape it down on there and then I'm also just going to tape it sort of on the back here and we're going to run it through mm -hmm. our die cut machine first of all so I've got my Gemporia I've got my two base plates and I've got my rubber mat and we're just going to sit this 
on that rubber mat and then run this through um, our Gemporia machine. So we're just gonna go once. You can do it twice if you want maximum. No, she hasn't. Is she saving the day? This is the best news ever. Oh, best news. Okay, we, we, we're trying it, to do we, something. Anne-Marie. Hi, Marie. Hi. Anne-Marie, you've always been my favorite. <laughs> and Marie's on the telephone lines trying to do something for us right now. <laughs> so now I'm going to show you from this side. Oh, Jimmy's gone. You can see oh, it from there. Right. You've got that beautiful um, beveled edge. So you could actually do it this way if you wanted that's debossed, or you can have it on the reverse, which is that works um, really has well. a really nice embossing. I'm going to leave it like this because I'm going to ink through this mm -hmm. now. Um, so we're going to start off with pink petal. Ruth's favourite colour. I love this. And we're just going to do like a really nice ombre on here. So I'm going in quite um, heavy with my pressure when I'm putting the colour through here. We want that to be quite heavy on there. And then what we're going to do is switch that out and we're going to go in for um, my favourite colour, tangerine. So let's pop that in and we're going to do sort of the middle and we're going to go up onto that one. That's really nice, isn't it? And then we're going to bring in our third colour, which is our buttercup. Mm -hmm. And we're going to mix that one in as well. So three really nice vibrant colours for this one. So I'm just going to put lots of ink on there. And then we're going to run that through as well and then mix those colours in as we move that further up on there so just and this popping. is really easy to do isn't it so so easy to do um this is probably using your masks in the simplest form if yeah if we're really talking about it so we're gonna peel this off here and then what i'm gonna do that's gonna reveal that gorgeous space on here but what i want to do is make this look even nicer mm -hmm. i'm gonna flip this over and now i'm gonna lightly go over this spacing with those three oh, colours nice. again. So we're going to bring in a lighter version of that right. colour and it's just going to give this um, this card such a beautiful look. So again in with your tangerine but really lightly over this space now. Just removing some of that mm -hmm. white space but you're still going to get that beautiful Excellent. lift because we've embossed this. I just, and then I just love watching this. It's like, you have know, the best the job. This is like just being a child again, isn't it? Yeah, we just play every day. It's lovely. Play every day. So we're going to pop that up and then look at how really cool. that lift is on there as well because we've got yeah. that embossing within that. It's really, really cool. So now we've done this, we are going to die cut um, our sentiment for this one. And I'm going to go in with... Um, so grateful for you. Mm -hmm. So let's swap out our rubber mat for our cutting plates. Ooh. Let's reach over for those ones. Yep. And then I'm just going to use my, pop my dies on there. I've got some spare cardstock that I can use to cut both of these out because we're also going to ink this as well. Okay. So let's just trim, run that through our die cutting machine. And these dies work so perfectly with like the designs that we've got on here. Yeah, um, they're such a, a great mix yeah. of colours and tones. Got lots of samples to show you in a second. So well. many incredible samples. Here's I mean, fact, there's so you. many different ways of so just um, to help that the team of crafted running around with the studio, these. Him. We're just Get making those. him work harder. Well, we're just making him work. <laughs> <laughs> just in general, <laughs> he's just not doing anything. <laughs> They're fab, aren't they? Look at it there with that gorgeous mirror. How amazing. That's, that's a Oops. really lovely card. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful with that embossing, isn't it? And oh. you can be doing that. You can grab our embossing ink. We've got it on the show. It is an incredible price. Yeah, we sold, sold out. Sold out in like 20 minutes, I think, last time. Yeah. It was man mental. These um, are gorgeous, aren't they? So oh. let's pop out all of these bits and pieces on here. And then I'm going to ink. Oh, go on, I'll just show you one more. Why not? Ink through this. There we are. So many different ways of using those. Those butterflies are gorgeous. So we're just going to do... I don't know why I whispered that. These are really nice. They're gorgeous now. So I'm just going to ink through on here, and I'm just using the remainder of my ink mm -hmm. from my tool for this, just to give you a beautiful look. Now, if you wanted to make sure that you weren't sort of like ruining 
um, this because if you if you press a little bit too hard, you could remove that um, gorgeous text away or rip your dye there. So mm. you can ink through it if you want to in the beginning, but um, it's obviously your choice on that one. Yep. And then where is my background? Here it is. So now let's use some of our white craft glue. This is a really good glue when we're popping this on. Oh, Denise, Ooh, Denise sneak peeks about whether we've got the Gemporia die cutting plates. I believe Saturday. I believe that Saturday is Easily your day. Here. I don't know what time, but yeah, Saturday. Do you know Ooh. what time you're on? Two or three o'clock. There just we mid go. Mid afternoon. Just turn your telly on. Superb. So I'm going to pop that now over there, and that's going to bring out that gorgeous colour. And now let's make up our card. So. What I've done is I've gone ahead and I've just cut the um, edge of my card off here and I'm going to place this onto a 5x7 with some foam pads just to lift it off because I've cut it slightly smaller now. Yeah. Um, so you're going to have a nice white edge on here. So I'm just going to pop this on, I'm trying to be careful not to get any of this leftover ink on here. I should have really moved my mixed media mat out of the way for building up my cards. That's the beauty of it, isn't it? That we can yeah. just lift it off here. So let's trim these bits away, move them off, pop this onto my card blank like so and then we're going to pop our die just over here like that. Cute. So it's going to hide some of that beautiful white space but mm -hmm. I think it gives you that really nice fresh look where you've got all yeah. of that colour happening and then you've got beautiful fresh white clean edges and that's my favorite way to sort of craft i think especially when i'm using color and stamping yeah. and inking i really like to create those really nice fresh um cards i mean that's so simple there you go so simple and if you've got the mask you've got those gorgeous dyes you're there really yeah, really super absolutely. easy absolutely obviously apart from your prism inks but we'll come to that we will. Um, but that fantastic mask that you're seeing there part of a collection of four Lots in baskets, not enough to go around. But you have the collection of four, which again, I'll, I've got them all in the Tisbos, but we'll, we'll show these to you again. That's all right, I'll find them all. So on the boards, you can see them there. So that is your first one that we're looking at, uh, which is the uh, Radiant Delight. Is that the Radiant Delight stat? What am I doing here? Hold which on. Which one? That one. Yeah. Yes, it is, isn't it? So your Radiant Delights uh, is your first one. Then we've got those gorgeous butterflies, your Butterfly Burst. Then you have this gorgeous Dixie Florals, which is wonderful. Again, you might choose to use the centre one on its own, or you might choose to use a couple of those. Even the little corners, just use those, perhaps on a design up to you. But last but certainly not least, that glorious Dahlia, which I love. Dazzling Dahlias. I love Dahlias. I love is it Dahlia or Dahlia? I would say Dahlia. I think, it's a, I think it's a Dahlia. I don't feel like, yeah... I know. I, I feel I, like I, it's like um, one of those words that you can say both ways. Possibly. You I've know, got friends. You know what that, people are talking about. I know what you mean. I've got friends that are called Dahlia. I think it's a lovely oh, name. Nice. Really gorgeous. Um, and of course, don't forget to take your sentiments, those beautiful dyes. And there is loads. Just very quickly flash you a couple more of these sample cards because they are so adorable. You need to send that lovely parchment coming across the top. Again, a really sort of simple. I've got two there. Have I got two there? Right. Oh, yeah, I have. There we are. Uh, a really sort of simple star. Very similar to actually what we just yeah. saw uh, from Nat. I'll squeeze a few more of these on for you. There we go. So lots of different Oh, that's uh, cool. Ways actually, doing that this. reverse of the mask, that gives you a really nice Cute, effect. isn't it? A bit yeah. more grungy. And then you can see just using... Using that on the edges. Yeah. Look how wonderful that is. They're all so different. Completely yeah. different styles to that one. This one's been cut out. So it's been inked and then cut out, which looks incredible. They're very cute. Oh, you're going to have to be really, really quick if you want these. I don't know why I'm moving quicker. Uh, they are absolutely disappearing. And you can see on that... Can you Gorgeous see Gorgeous glimmer mist on that. You've got bossy. a really... Oh. They're clever, aren't they? So clever. Oh, look at this, look at this one. I'm not cherry picking, but Kelly Lloyd. This is what we were talking about, though, about that Dahlia. How cute is Cutting that? it out, adding a little colours and layering it up gives you That's such a really beautiful really clever. Effect. Oh, this, honestly, I've got a whole box full here of different designs I can Gorgeous. share with you. Lots of different ways of using these. Uh, they're really quite fabulous. Mm, I love um, that one. Get them checked out. Linda, Hillary, Leslie, Amanda, Ali, Dorian, Teresa. I don't have enough for all of you, I'm so sorry. Oh, was that your elbow? 
Oh, my. Do you know what the bad news is, though? <laughs> that was a good clunk. That was so that loud. Was. The bad news is apparently it's bad luck unless you bang the other one. You have to give the other one a quick okay. nip and then you're OK. OK, well, well... Just a gentle... See, I feel I can't I can't leave you otherwise. I feel like I had to do it just for you. Yeah. I don't know who who's meant to do that, but anyway, probably the person that was embarrassed that banged their elbow in the first place. Right, the inks. We need to show the inks because they are gorgeous. Now, we didn't actually think we could get any stock of these, no. so very lucky if you get the opportunity to Crazy. own them. Oh, they're just they're just scrumptious. They, they are, aren't they? Oh my word! Really, really nice. You get so many colours included yeah. with this one and you're going to get a free handbook as well yeah. um, which gives you so it's many been colouring in there what has Lord happened sake. here don't know someone's going to get fired That's jimmy jimmy isn't it jimmy i've told you i love you. how jimmy always gets the blame uh, the the colours are good and you don't just so get a pink a blue no. a green There's no look at how different many different shades we've got there how those pinks move into those purples um to give you all of those different tones and shades of colour the same with the blues. Glorious. There's a gorgeous variety of me. those colours within there. And then again, you've got sort of nice. beautiful green shades, which move all the way through to sort of be gorgeous um, greys and browns. There's mm. so many um, gorgeous colours on here. They are fab. And there's 40 inks, is that correct? 40 altogether, yeah. yeah. We are very, very limited in the office on one particular colour. Yes. So this might be your last chance for quite a while to yeah. be able to grab your hands on this full collection, yeah. um, which gives you the best saving. And you do get the world of colouring handbook as well. Your crafting handbook. Now, this is volume seven. Yep. So you're basically getting this free of charge anyway. So many amazing things um, within here on techniques of how to use these inks. So there's some techniques on using them with masks. There's techniques for um, using them with dyes even, um, layering stamps, using them with bubbles. Um, some incredible techniques yeah, in here. Well, um, some really, really fun things. I mean, that. Card it's fab. It's amazing. There's loads, absolutely loads of ideas in there from your handbook. Um, it, it's just amazing. But would you like a better than half price deal? We always want a better than half price deal. Well, we do. Always. Whether we can always do it now is a different thing. This is true. This is but true. But today we are, it's not been with us for ages. So we're going to £59.80. In fact, I think it's exactly a month. But do you want it on split pay? Because we've done that as well. Oh. Yep. So £29.90 oh, today. Absolutely. Next month you pay exactly the same amount, £29.90. You won't get any interest added on, nothing like that. It's just that payment split into two. And there you go. But there are some of the most amazing, amazing colours. I'm just going to grab one or two of these. And if you haven't met the Prism Inks, you notice they've got a lovely wibbly wobbly edge because they're very, very, very uh, sort of ergonomically designed. Yes. So they fit into your fingers really, really nicely. I mean, look at that for a punch of colour as well. There's they are so much colour within them. So and we juicy. have an amazing um, sort of space within the yeah. reverse of here, which we tend to keep our ink, um, blending tools in. Yeah, you look um, so you'll see... In a lot of um, ours, we've got our blending sponges on with Velcro hooks. Yeah. Uh, we also, I don't, do we have the Velcro hooks as well, Laura? Um, they well, might be on the website, but we we have the Velcro hooks that allows you to pop those blending sponges on, but they are incredible. Yeah, the colours are phenomenal. They're fabulous, aren't they? I was almost the colour of my dress. Uh, they're wonderful, but £59 and £80. Do we? Do we? Do we do, we do, do it? Do we? Oh, load them in, I knew we cup. did. All right, we're going to load those in for you as well. Oh, I knew we Very did. exciting. Very exciting. Oh, I don't know what colour to pick up next. What was at the top there? Mustard. Ooh, they're just all... Right, 55, that is it. And they're but, perfect. You get enough on that Velcro dart that you can put Velcro onto every one of um, these amazing um, ink pads. And then you can also buy our blending sponges yes, as well. Absolutely. We've got a great got deal those. on those. So then you've got everything you need. You're ready to everything go. Everything you need. I need these inks in my life. The ultimate collection is not one you want to miss out on. Don't See, miss Velcro it. Velcro hook me to one pound fifty. Add it on. Crazy. Yeah, add Crazy it on. It makes price. life so much easier. You do only you. get the Velcro hook though. You don't get both sides for that. You no. do only get the hook because that's the side we need to be able to pop our blending sponges on the back. Yeah. Super job. Well done. Diving in for those. Carol, Theresa, Pembrokeshire, West Yorkshire, Leicestershire. Uh, very, very well done. £1.50 for a metre. Just pop it on. Crazy then you've prices. got all of that nicely organised, uh, which is rather gorgeous. Uh, very well done indeed on those ones. Uh, shall we bring the blending tools to you as well? Because you need those, obviously. Um, and it all. 
You do? Uh, we have a, a um, bundle on these for you as well, a bundle. Uh, so you have your um, tool and you actually get uh, the sponges as well. So you're going to get two of the tools and you're getting two packs of the sponges, 30 sponges, Incredible. 30 sponges in total there, which is Incredible. fabulous. Um, and they're just so easy to use. They've yeah. been really well designed as well, haven't they? They have, yeah, they are perfect. And of course, you've got your two blending tools as well. So everything mm. that you need. Um, so you can either do what we do and you can have one sponge for each color or you can use them across a variety of sponges. You can pop these, because these are water-based ink pads as well, you can pop your sponges into the washing machine if you want to, clean off those inks and then reuse them again. Oh, wow, amazing. A great price, £13.97. So that's your tools. Then you've got the Velcro um, hook. Yes. It was the hook, wasn't it? Yeah. And of course, your prism inks that you're, you're away, you've got your mask. This hour Everything really is need, quite self contained. Really. Absolutely. Is. Great to get. And this is playing, enjoying it. This is crafting. Yeah. You really, really need to be enjoying. Uh, I love them. So £13.97 on those ones to get checked out on. Um, should we have another demo? Yeah, Thank let's do it. So I'm actually going to use now. a colour from our um, limited edition collection. So this is our Air Force blue. It's a beautiful blue. And I'm going to do it a little bit different because we're going to go with craft card for this one. So okay. I've got one of our dye packages here um, and this works really well for sort of creating really nice smooshy backgrounds. So I'm just going to layer up my um, ink onto here and then we're going to spritz it with some water. So I'm just going to spray that on there. We don't. I have to get Anne-Marie back on the case. I'll have to get Anne-Marie Anne back on the case. See what got any. We need some more stock so I'm just going to layer... <laughs> I mean, to be fair, if you don't have this blue, then the Prussian blue is going to work really nicely. Yeah. It's very similar. The Air Force blue is a bit more grey than the Prussian blue. I think the Prussian Grazy. blue is just on the end. Um, but it's going to give you the same sort of effect on here. Yeah. So I'm just layering that onto there, and then we can pick that up. And it's going to give you that really nice sort of just splattered ink colour. Um, and then what you want to do is wait for this to dry. So I have already done that because you need this to be fully dry. Mm -hmm. Let's just switch that out. And I'm going to bring in one I made earlier. Um, so you can see here that that colour has really dried onto yeah. that ink. And it's giving you that gorgeous sort of spongy background. So then what we're going to do is going to bring in our mask. Um, now I'm going to use the Dahlia for this one. And again, I just want to make sure that I am using that flat side on here. So just making sure that um, that beveled edge is on the way we want it to. And then I'm going to stick this sort of over the corner. Um, but what I want to do with this one is I just want to have the flower detail. So I've got some of our masking sheet here. Um, and what I've done with this is I have... Um, cut this around now this is going to be fun because we need to find out where is it this one it is this one so i've i've what i've done is i've taken this off a sheet because it's double-sided um it sticks on here and then i have um oh, sorry if everybody checks out there's three bundles of the masks left no that is not. it okay i have a lot more that's of you crazy. so three left that's it so check those out oh my goodness sorry Dom. it's fine um, so I'm just going to stick this over the edge there. This one came in two when I've cut it. So how I created this was I stuck the full sheet down over the top because you can kind of see through where your mask is. So I stuck the full sheet down and then I used my knife and I've just cut away um, those edges to reveal that pattern on there. So that's one side done. And then we just need to do the other side, which I think is this one. No, it's the other one. <laughs> See, you try and speed, you try and speed your grafting, and then it, is it the other one? Have I just, oh yes it is, I just needed to move it along a little oh, bit there more. We go. There we go. So I can then peel this one away. And these are, if you keep the back ends on these, you're gonna be able to use these time and time again with this mask. So you're gonna be able to get sort of just that floral design instead of like the, the square um, sort of, of the mask, which okay. is gonna give you a lot more options for the way that we use this. So let's stick that now onto here. So that's just gonna go over there. And then I'm just gonna line that up around there. And once we've got that onto here, then I can stick this onto my card. So I'm just going to have this sort of coming over in the corner. So yeah. I'm going to use my tape now when I'm happy with the placement. 
just to stick that down. So I'm going to stick it on all four edges and then let's just make sure that this is properly stuck down. So I'm also going to just use a bit of tape on the back of there as well. And then we're going to bring in an embossing um, ink pad for the next bit. So let's pop this on here. Now these are really good because it's a clear embossing ink. Um, oh, do you know what I needed to do? I haven't done it. I needed to use my anti-static bag. Where is it? It's around somewhere. Have a oh, it's here. There it is. Here, and this here, sold here. out so many times, by the way. Lift this up. We'll put this on your screen. So this Pop is your embossing down. ink pad. Um, it's acid free and you'll see there it looks clear when it you does. see that. It looks it's clear, really but it's nice got a nice. really nice sort of sticky ink to yeah. it. Now, I don't think that I've got my Prism one with me. I've got a Versamark one, which does exactly the same job. Mm -hmm. um, but when I was packing yesterday, this one was to hand. So I've obviously not thought about that very well, have That's I? Right. I could have lent you mine. You, I know I should have used that one, actually. But you were showing it off so well that I didn't want to steal it from you. Thanks. <laughs> I didn't want to steal it. You were doing a really good job. <laughs> Wonderful hand model, though, with that. Thanks. Has. But they do exactly the same job. And it's such a good price, an incredible price. Don't encourage me, Adam. So I'm going to take this off now, off of here. And we're going to bring in some of our you can see kind of you can the, the see it you can see where that image is we're going to bring in some gold embossing powder <gasps> so i'm just going to pop this on here now and run that down my card to pick up all of that gorgeous detail Cute. and look at how that has embossed so nicely i've got a little bit here where that tape was stuck so we can yeah. just tap that off even more and then let's pop this back in our container and we can run this on with our heat gun. So I'll just get that out. This is where the magic happens. I love it. Never this gets This is going to give you such a phenomenal look. And because we um, masked off the edge of our mask as well, those petals are going to look like they're coming down. Okay. Look at this. Oh, wow. There it goes. My One of my honest favorite techniques ever um, and it just looks so well with this background just love it so the beauty of using this and using it with our mixed media mat as well is that our mixed media mat is a silicone mat so you can use it um, with your heat tool and it's not going to damage it at all Gosh, of course good. when we're messy crafting we want a space to messy craft on and um, so this is perfect especially if you're using with all of those ink pad colors because when you are sort of smooshing or doing fun techniques we can see all of those um, elements so I'm just making sure I've got full coverage on all areas here and then you've got that phenomenal design on there that so you've amazing. got such a beautiful finish on this one um, so what we're going to do to finish this off is I'm just going to um, die cut let's go with which one haven't we used um where's the other one let's go for this one have a blooming lovely day so i'm going to cut this out again we're just going to use let's go with i've got some more we'll do a craft card because i want it to look very similar so i'm just going to trim that craft card out from earlier on this is where all my plates need switching out again so let me get those ones isn't it so versatile though that you've got a machine here that you can use in so many different yeah, ways exactly it's so so good so popping that on there hoping that that doesn't move because there's very little paper in that bit we'll trim this out run okay. it through there and actually a huge quantity of the ultimate collection of prism inks have gone so very well wow. done if you've picked yours up because they are wow, they're wow, stunning wow. they're stunning um in fact less than 20 of Ooh. the prism ink bundle remaining so you That's need to get crazy. those again we don't know if we can do it again because that, that color it's loads it in baskets so well. wow i'm very envious they're amazing they are so let's pop this die out of here i'm just gonna run my um pieces through there it's gonna yep. stick on there and then i'm gonna pop this out so let's do that oh this looks so good and then because i want to show you how good our embossing um, ink is. Can you pass me that embossing pad, Ruth? 
Oh, I you had it earlier. Are we on I'm going to emboss the whole of this now with this ink pad. So just placing this on some cardstock. Oh, nice. To make sure that that is nice and sticky, making sure we've got as much as much on there as we possibly can do, and then let's hope that that ink pad, because it is open, I don't know if it will. I'm hoping. Yes, it will. Look at that. Look at the coverage on that. It's crazy. It's super, super sticky. It's. Lovely. That is a perfect amount on there. So I'm just mm -hmm. going to stick that on there, get rid of this so it doesn't all cure. And look at what you've got there. You've still got all of that that's going to sort of heat and boss if we yeah. um, use that with the ink. So I'm going to pop that on there. Let's bring this out and get that heat tool again. Pop this on high. And then I just want to hold this in place. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, it's going to look amazing, isn't it? Instant um, changing of colour there. And heat embossing your dyes like this give it such a, a wonderful um, effect. They yeah. kind of look like antique metal elements on your cards. We've got all of that now. So let's turn that off. And then we can place this on our card. So I'm going to pop that just on the bottom oh, there. Gorgeous. We're going to use our white craft glue again. I'm just going to dab a little bit on our hand here. And to just pat that out on there. Have a blooming, wonderful day. Mm -hmm. So just making sure we've got full coverage on that. We can place that in place on there, like so. And then we can stick this onto our card. So I'm going to do that with some tape. And again, really quick and easy. And to be able to bring that embossing powder in with the, 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 both the mask and obviously the dye as well, you've got that same colour that's going through. It's brilliant. Matches perfectly yeah. the whole way through, doesn't it? Well, it gives you total control as well, doesn't it? 100%, that, yeah. And think about how many embossing powders we've got or maybe like glitter paste we've got yeah. that we can be doing that technique with. Yeah. Um, uh, by the way, sorry to interrupt. We're massively, massively... Uh, overstocked on, uh, overstocked, oversubscribed on those masks now. Literally the last handful of those are remaining. Uh, all of those beautiful masks that you can see, not enough to go around. I'm so, so sorry. Uh, so please, if yours in your basket, check out uh, so looks you can make designs so that look as gorgeous. And as doing that, on, doing it on craft card as well, because you could create this card on white card stock and it would look phenomenal. Oh, it looks so good. But bringing in that extra colour with the craft yeah. card because it takes your um, ink pad so, so well. Um, it's just beautiful. Yeah, they look fabulous, don't they? As be, but as I said, Michelle, it could be yours, Beverly, Kath, uh, Beryl, Christine, Leslie. If just you check out, just there's not enough for you. And I've got plenty more of you there on the web as well. So fingers crossed, you're lucky enough to get those four fantastic masks. I'll give you a quick uh, sort of um, look at these again. So these are, let's do the one by one actually. Uh, so this is your butterfly, first of all. So you can see that's your actual mask and that's a, an idea of what it might look like when you actually perhaps stamp that as well. So it's your butterflies, uh, your butterfly burst. That's the word I couldn't remember. And as you can see, you've got different sizes. You've got different shapes of butterflies on there as well. You might choose to use them all. You might just want a little section. You might just want one of those little butterflies. Uh, but that is the first one in the collection. There's four in this for £12.99. And they are all six by six. Next up we're going to see the radiant delights <laughs> there we go uh, so that's your radiant delights uh, bear with me uh, so your radiant delights looks absolutely gorgeous we've seen this used a little bit earlier on again wonderful wonderful detail on that gives you kind of a 3d kind of a vortex but it kind of pulls you in and perfect pulls you for out. this deck today isn't it mm. with it being star wars day it's star wars day yeah is it yeah. oh may the oh. 4th of course may the 4th be with you forgot that Really? Oh, it is. And voting day in lots of different uh, yes, areas is, as well. Yeah. Maybe more importantly, <laughs> uh, we've also got, depends how you look at it, uh, Dazzling Dahlia, which is one of our favourites here. It is. It really gorgeous, is. Gorgeous, gorgeous, Love gorgeous. Love this one. 
Yeah, I love this one. £12.99. It's not like that it's that colour, just to show you. It's just got that colour behind it to give you a little bit of an idea of how wonderful that could look. And then last, but certainly not least, you have ditzy florals i love that there's three left that is it three Hooray. bundles <gasps> left and then they are gone dilly gone gone no i know i have more demos i know 12 pounds 99 jennifer wendy we're working on getting you more but i can't guarantee that we currently we haven't but Marie's on it don't let us down Marie. Uh, remember, you're my favourite. Uh, Karen, Avril, Hillary, uh, well done, Judith. Congratulations to you as well. 0800 001 4433 on the phone lines, on the web, get them checked out. Please do remember as well, though, uh, that um, with the bank holiday, you've got, um, there might be a little bit of a delay. There might be a little bit of a delay in postage and, and, and delivery, but True. might not be. Uh, right, there's three left now. There's three left. People have bought more than one. Paula's got two, Judy's got two. So if somebody else checks out on more than one, they're gone. Uh, so 12 pounds and 99 pence, 0800 and double zero one, double four and double three. Uh, the most gorgeous set of masks, actually. I'm sure you'll agree on those. They are incredible. Well done. Right, very, very quickly. Um, yeah, yes. let's bring these dyes to you individually. The two moonstone dyes. So we had... Um, does it say which is which? Yeah, at the top. So we've got friendship and love. Oh, we've yes. got grateful um, and wonderful. Right in front of my... Let's go grateful and wonderful first. Grateful and wonderful. Shall we? Um, so this one has that, your blooming lovely that we just used. There we um, are. And the um, wonderful one that says, so grateful for you. I think that's such a lovely sentiment lovely to send someone. Well. Yeah, really like are, that. Indeed. And they're all about gorgeous detail. Don't they look fantastic? Don't they look absolutely superb? They are gorgeous. £14.99. pence. The, even the detail around it, that decorative font. So gorgeous. See. Yeah, aren't they superb? You've got the little stars. You've got the little flowers on there as well. They're really, really pretty, aren't they? I love that as well. That looks totally different. Just the edging, just the framework yeah. that you've got to that looks beautiful. I love how it's all connected as well. But if you don't yeah. want to have it in that shaping, they, these dies are so easy to fussy cut out, so you could literally yeah. like trim out those wordings as well. They are gorgeous. Let's bring to you the other one, then we'll squeeze in another demo, I think. Uh, so then we've got friendship and love. So you've got all of these areas covered, and these were so beautiful. Your friendship means the world to me. And you've got, again, your little butterflies in there. Again, different butterflies. And then as we move down, the other die that you've got there says, always on my mind, forever in my heart. Remember that now? I will. Always on my mind. Always. Doesn't mean in a good way. Uh, 14 99 does with you, Nat. Always on of my course. mind. Uh, right, let's have another quick demo, shall we? Okay, so this time we're going to use that beautiful butterfly and we're going to do um, like a reverse mask. So I'm actually going to yeah. add my um, my inks onto my mask instead oh, okay. of put, popping it over. So right. I'm going to use my um, pink, first of all. Yeah. And let me just make sure we're doing this on the right side again, I think. Yep this side so I'm just going to use my blending tool instead of using um, my ink straight onto here because I want a very light sort of color on here so just going through on that and then we're going to go out in a circle sort of formation so uh -huh. next we're going to go in with our tangerine so I'm using some similar colors mm. that I used earlier actually but they are a really fun sort of selection that all work quite well together and then we're going to move into that beautiful buttercup. It's going to give us a really nice um, colourway here. Let's just yeah. add more of that ink onto there. And then we're going to go around again and blend these colours together. So we're going to pop that on there. And then we're going to go in with lily pads. So this is a really nice green. Um, super, super vibrant yeah, on this cool. one. Um, so then let's just pop that on. And I'm doing it really lightly in sort of like a a nice um, sort of mottly effect because you've not got full coverage on yep. that one. You've just got really light coverage. And then we're going to go in with our electric blue, which is our super vibrant blue. And I'm just going to pop that on these edges. So let's just add a little bit more color on that one because we do need that in there. Yeah. So just add in that color on. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to bring in our car blank. So 
we're going to just pop that to one side because I want to show you what you've been left behind. Oh, cute. You could actually pop some cardstock yeah. onto that and like pick up that colour if you wanted to. Um, I've got my um, paper ready to go um, and I'm just going to spritz that. I'm just using our Ink Me cardstock, lightly spritzing that and then we're going to place this onto here. So just making sure that's in place and then I'm going to tape it down so it doesn't move because we're going to run this back through the right. die cutting machine so that those butterflies stand up okay. off that background that we're going to create. So let's bring um, that back in, yep. popping this onto here and then just because I've added ink onto here, I don't want to ruin my place, I'm just going to go in with another piece of sort of cardstock on there. So let's run that back through. And we have managed to get the additional set of your ink pads as well. This was the tranquil moments, wasn't it? So a selection of six. It was a limited edition. So I'll show those to you in a second because there's some really, really lovely colours on those ones. So we have managed to grab hold of those. So I'm just going to take that now from this piece. Mm -hmm. And you can run this through a number of times, actually, because... Oh, wow. So you get the that looks amazing of the die now because of the mask sorry because we've not wow. inked into it we've inked on it and then ran it through the die cut machine it gives you That's this fab. absolutely stunning effect and again you could run that through back through because you can still see ink on there it's going to yeah. be a lot of a, a lighter version on there so let's just take our um trimmer because really cool, i'm it? actually going to cut this into a panel okay Oh, I'm by the way, this out of the way because I really like that design over there. there. Let's just pop that up there. And those tranquil moment ink pads, eleven pound ninety nine. They're on your screen, so we're just squeezing things in because we're running out of time. Uh, but they're available on your screen. The most amazing colours, honestly. We saw Nat using that Air Force blue a second or two ago, but they're honestly sea green, uh, chiffon. They're all in chiffon. there, and they are beautiful. There's the sea green. Look at that. They are glorious, really, really glorious. So, so grab hold of those. You can actually make this card twice because we're cutting it in half. So I've cut it into oh, right, three okay. just to give me that nice sort of burst of those florals. I've got a six by four, which we're going to work with. Yeah. Um, and what we're going to do is I've got some uh, black stamping card, which is really great for when you're doing designs like this because it mm. just allows all those colors to really pop. So let's um, put this onto there like so. Let's <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, Sorry. I've got it. I know. I've no time for A little bit that. longer. I apologise. Needed to just trim this down. So let's go to two notches below the three. Just needed to make it a tiny bit smaller so that we can lay that onto there. I think I'm going to layer it so we've just got the black coming in on one side of our piece there and we'll trim that away mm -hmm. like that. This is going to then go on with some foam pads so I'll get some chunky chunky foam pads. Oops. Yep, we had those on the show earlier didn't we? We did. We most of the time have a lot of our foam pads yeah. available on the website so you can always stock up on those. Yeah. Um, they do sometimes run out but they are um, essentials. We've got them in at the moment because we've obviously launched our fantastic decollage collection, mm -hmm. which we're going to look at <gasps> again up. at six. Yep. Um, so I'm going to pop that now onto here. So you've got that That's nice sweet. colour on there and that just stands up. And then I've repeated um, that pattern again wow. onto some of, onto one of the shapes there. Um, and then what we've done is I've cut out friendship means the world to me. I've still got onto white, but then I've actually cut around that bit so that yep. this now gives us that nice design, but actually okay. round the edge. So we'll pop that on with foam pads and then we'll stick it on again mm -hmm. onto foam pads. So let's just stick that on there like so. Are we going to do it that way or should we do it the other way around? So it looks like yeah. that colour is moving out. And then we're going to pop that onto here, down at the bottom. So let's add that onto there. And then there you go. So you've got the... What a cute card. It gives you a completely different look because you've Doesn't not got it? as much colour um, down on there. Yeah. But it also That's gives great. you the sort of like opposite effect of that mask. Yeah. So it's a really clever way of using it. It's sort of like, sort of like backwards. 
bow yeah. works. And that black almost it looks works. like a ribbon strip, doesn't it? Does. It does. It's really, really clever. That's really clever. Really clever. Uh, right, update on the masks then. Uh, currently, um, I've got about 25, 26 of you about to miss out because I've got one left. Oh, my goodness. That is you it. You need to be the quickest. You certainly do. Clicker of that button. You need to be speedies um, because they are going... Gone. Gone. Sold out. Sold out of the masks. Very well done. As I said, we are going to see what we can do on those. And Marie's go. working very so hard people. behind the scenes right now. So many people. There's a lot of you. Yeah, so Anne Marie will see what, what, what can happen really with hope those. We get some. If you can, at six o'clock, Rosie is with you, uh, back with Nat at six o'clock. So fingers crossed mm -hmm. on those. Uh, but whilst we are there, um, the tranquil moments, have a little look at these. I'll these show them are to a you. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous, aren't they? Colours. Oops. Right, let's show them to you, kind of. If I do that, you can make your way along. That works, doesn't it? That works. It works for me, Nat. <laughs> works for me. Um, there we are. And then I'll show you the little uh, the little sort of pad on that as well. So you've got the most gorgeous so colours. Nice. Air Force Blue, Sea Green, Leafy Green, Salmon, Toasted Oat and Chiffon. <gasps> Gorgeous. And that's what you're looking at there on the little board. But yeah. these are limited to this particular collection. These you won't find these in the collection. Ultimate with no, me. No, you won't get these colours in the Ultimate. You, if you want these colours, you have to buy them in this mini bundle. That's um, so lovely. But not, none of these colours are repeated. They all work perfectly. Yeah. Let me grab hold of that one because that one is Leafy open. Leafy green's really Leafy nice. green. I mean, look at it. Just so gorgeous. So beautiful. They are amazing. Absolutely amazing. So if you have got the Ultimate Collection and you want to extend it a little bit further with these hues, then absolutely go for it. Or perhaps you haven't tried the Prism Inks at all and you're not quite ready to go for the entire Ultimate it's, Collection. That's a really good point. You just point. want to grab yeah. a few. And also, if you're you, falling in love if with them. you um, have some of our sets as well, if you go on the website, um, we actually sell the big bundle in yep. little mini sets of, I think it's, is it six? eight i think two four is six eight, eight. eight yeah. isn't it? yeah sorry yes and so you can grab them individually as well so if you're someone who likes to um do sort of like vintage colors in your ink in or really mm -hmm. bright colors yeah. we have them all in mini sets yeah. as well so lots of different ways for many budgets yeah they split this. up into pastel bright mid tones vintage tones uh, vintage shades sorry and then you've got the essential yeah. colors but these are going to sell out in moments um i'm very envious alice you're on the phone lines you've, you've just been answered irene's just been answered uh roseanne beryl patricia if, if everybody checks out there are two left one for me one. and another one for another me is fair uh so 29 pounds and 90 pence on <laughs> on split bay uh, <laughs> uh 29 pounds 80 now we've just managed to get how many sorry 15 of the masks oh that my is goodness it. 15 extra of those, those masks. We're going to load them in. You are going to have to be as quick as I don't know those what. people that had it in um, their baskets and we're waiting. Yeah, this so is this to... is your chance. All those masks. You show them there, Jimmy. It's probably easier. There we go. Okay. So price straight down, not 17 99 All four masks, the Daily of the Butterflies, the Dazzling One, the Beautiful Flowers, 12 99 for all four six by four size masks. They are incredible. Uh, you'll have lots of different ways of using these. Obviously, when you get them home, you'll be able to see how really versatile these are as well to work with them. £12.99, quite incredible. And we've seen so many beautiful demos. You can always go back, of course, on hobbymaker.co.uk yeah. and watch the show again. Uh, if, if you'd like to watch myself and Nat again, People maybe just Nat's demos. <laughs> <laughs> or well, maybe just you, Ruth. Well, the, well you might never know now. There. there might be a couple of them. <laughs> <laughs> Not many. 0800 001 4433. And don't forget, Nat is back with the little Rosie. She's in the building. Bless her. Um, back with you at six o'clock tonight. These are going to go again. Sally Ann, Siobhan, Linda, Christine, Patricia, Becky. Pauline's checked out on hers in Merseyside. Oh, Pauline's not in Merseyside today, is she? She's um, on holiday soon, but I don't think oh, she's, oh, she's on, on, oh, she on a cruise. Oh, she is on a cruise, isn't she? going on a cruise. Oh, my word. She's going to have some stories when she gets back, she don't is. you think? She <laughs> really is. I bet she's propping up on the bar right now. I bet she is all dancing on the table. These are going to um, go so quickly look yeah at Val's just got hers. congratulations Dorset joining us there's about five left 
and that's it. That was on the mini restock. So, <gasps> fingers crossed. Right, six o'clock tonight. Yes. What is coming up? Remind us. Decollage. Um, it's our brand new collection, Hobbies and Sports. You are going to love it. Absolutely. Do not go anywhere. Rosie is back with you at the other side of this. Or she's with you at the other side. She's back and she's with you at the other side of this. Uh, she's here. That's all you need to know. Uh, thank goodness you haven't got me. Uh, Corinne's back with you as well from Crafters Companion. And I'll see you tomorrow. I'm sorry I'm back tomorrow again. Same time, same place. I'm tuning in. Are you tuning in? 100%. Well, that's one of us. So that's good. Uh, <laughs> It is an amazing show. We've got a huge, 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 huge bundle tomorrow. Uh, Carla's with me. I'm very excited. Uh, don't go anywhere. Corinne and Rosie back at the other side of this. See you tomorrow. Here at Hobby Maker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day you still will only be charged one p and p shopping made simple with hobby maker our call center is based in the uk and available 24 7. just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk My name is Anne-Marie and I am the Creative Manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier paper craft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our paper craft goodies back at home in Preston. We do lots of paper craft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, waterbrush pens and we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations which we just know the audience love. Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gifts? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value.
So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Hello, how are you doing? It's lovely to have you here with us at Hobby Maker. I'm Rosie Wells, and I am so excited to be joined by our gorgeous Karen. Hello. How are you? Hello. you okay? I'm really good, thank you. Yes. Oh my goodness! Well, I was watching from home earlier. Yeah, you and our gorgeous Ruth. You just went. You went to those samples, and you went. You've made this one today. I saw you <laughs> do this. Tell you. Yes. yes. But this, I mean, this is an incredible bundle it that is. you brought it's today. brilliant value. Really, really outstanding. Um, if you missed it earlier on, this is your chance to come and get it. Honestly, you're not believe. You, you basically have to come and get it because it's a no-brainer. Everything that you could possibly want to get crafting, to start crafting, to continue crafting, mm -hmm. it's all here. And we're not stopping at £20.98. pence. We're, so we've still got a way to go, actually, amazingly. Um, and when you consider everything you're getting, so you're getting this wonderful magazine. You are. Um, and this is all inspiration and so many different project ideas. So just to say, we, you're, we're going to show you the bits, the rest of the things that come in the box. But the majority of the projects that come in this magazine are made using the items that come in the bundle. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's a project based magazine. It's all about here are three sets of items. How can you use them? And then we're going to give you so much inspiration on how to use them. It's it's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, it's literally everything. I've never seen a magazine like it. And I mean, magazines are always lovely um, to get home, aren't they? Because yes. if you have a stuck for ideas, you open it up and there you go. But you literally have, um, you have the dies, you have the stamps, you've got the embossing folder, um, you've got the beautiful papers at the back as well. And do you know what? Um, what's remarkable as well, I mean, the papers, look at this. They're classic, aren't they? Crafter's Companion, absolutely yes. beautiful. Yeah. And really good quality. Oh, so, yes. So when you look at the magazine, obviously, when you look at the magazine, the magazine itself is magazine paper. Yes. But then when you get to the middle, to the, the, to the papers, you're going up to um, your print quality paper for these. So these are of a different quality. So they're about, I would say, about 120 GSM as opposed to your 80. Um, one. So they're still papers but they are what you would expect from crafters companion so they are double-sided so when you look at them you've got you've got your pat detail one and then you've got your planer one on the back and i love this so when you look at these i was showing this earlier so when you look at this you look and initially you see the flowers and you see everything but then look closer and you'll see the dream catcher mm -hmm. look closer and you're going to see the feathers you know look close and you'll see the the white sort of masked images every paper you okay. look at you're going to see depth and dimension crafters companion paper pads are so so special they and really just are, because these they? are in a magazine you're not going to be disappointed oh They're my god well i mean everyone's checking out already at 20 pounds and 98 pence it's sensational but there's a clock on your screen there you know what that means it means we're not stopping at 20 pounds and 98 pence and just look at the quality that you're getting there is so beautiful yes. um if you're missing at one o'clock if you're just tuning in this is your chance here today to come and get it and everything is so complimentary and it so really let's get is. this right We've got the magazine. Yep. We've got the embossing folder. Yeah, we haven't reached We've it. Got so you're going to get your all... feather embossing folder. Uh huh. Oh, you can see that there. You can see. And then you're also going to get your dies and you're also going to get your stamps as well. It's just extraordinary. And you're at 14 99 for all of this. And we've got an exclusive gift we for you today. Have. So, have a look. So, everyone that buys this, if you go uh -huh. and buy this from another retailer, from your newsstand, whatever you want, that's what you're going to get magazine with the papers with those three elements. Today, getting this from here 
we're giving you that Midas metallic ink pad. Now, it is a pigment ink pad. Okay, so what does that mean? It means the particles are bigger, the carrier is, um, is sort of stickier, so it doesn't dry as quickly. Ah, now, you say, well, I want my okay. ink pad dry. But that means that you can now heat emboss it. So you can stamp, and then it will stay wet enough, long enough for you to get your embossing powder on for you to then heat emboss with it. Beautiful. Oh, my gosh. I mean, it's incredible, isn't it? That loads and loads of you coming through. I think everyone's so excited yeah. to get started with this. I have to say, as well, I mean, all the feathers, the imagery that you yes. have in here is so perfect. And, you can, and actually... It's very grown up, but then there's also beautiful projects here you could do for your kids. There and is. Older there teenagers is. as well. Just, it suits everybody. Exactly. It? So if we show you with the, um, with the dies, if we look at these dies here, you've got all of these elements. But if yeah. you were to take this one here, which we said, some, um, uh, Ruth said earlier, oh, it's a mandala. Yeah, yeah it is a mandala. Like but then if you add this, you know, die cut this piece and put it there, and then you die cut the feathers and put them oh, down here. You're, you're, catch, you're yeah. making a dream catch. So you'd cut these feathers multiple times. Yeah. But now you've made a dream catcher. Beautiful. But if we'd have given you a die that was a dream catcher, it would have been very hard to then yeah. separate it out into those component parts. Because yeah. that top bit up, there... This one here. Yeah, you could almost repeat that again and again and again. It could make like a sunshine. Yeah, it could be, it, yep, it? yep. You could have these coming off if you wanted oh, to. Yeah, I would Absolutely. love that. That's amazing. Yeah, it's brilliant. By breaking it down and giving, you know, those feathers will work on their own and the mandala will work on its own. So it's, it's entirely up to so you. Gorgeous, so lovely. And then, of course, those feathers translate to the beautiful imagery in the embossing folder as yes, well. Because exactly. it's just all, it's all very fluid and dreamy it is. and ethereal. So especially if you look at this large one, I'm almost seeing, look, we've got it there. You can see that one there. You can see... That's the, the imagery in there, and it repeats itself on there. So that means it's going to be top and bottom, so you can yeah. use it together, which I absolutely love. So this is your larger feather, and mm. that's the one we were using this um, this earlier show. So, yeah, you've got your... It's a 2D embossing folder, so it's going to do... You can um, put it onto white cord... Um, white cord cardstock so you could sand it back yeah. you could put your ink onto here and then you could letter press with it yeah. put it onto your metallic cards it's going to oh, look amazing really good, black it? with your gilding waxes oh my god there are so many ways to do it and then to team it up as well with these a beautiful beautiful stamps mm. look at this moon isn't that absolutely that gorgeous so all the bits and the sentiment you're amazing radiate positive vibes i mean oh, it's how so good, perfect isn't it? is and that's that? what it's what we all need isn't it, it? Is, it's what we all it? sort of those little reminders it's just such a beautiful set and you know even and actually here it is you can see on the page in the um magazine there with that beautiful moon all yeah. these little jewel gemstones lovely, almost floating it? down Absolutely it's so pretty and so you can use this for your card making you can use it for wall art you wall can use art, it yep. I mean, it's just making. endless possibilities. Oh, absolutely. I love that. So stamping it and then cutting it and sort of separating it yeah. out a little bit. Looks oh, that's lovely, right. Do you know as well, for all of our beginners watching, if you're watching and you've never, ever crafted in your life before, this is an absolutely perfect place to start. Maybe you're wanting to gift this for somebody um, who has talked to you about crafting and maybe they've just not taken the plunge yet. They've not quite, they've not quite got to it yet. Um, this could be that little jump for them, that little step, which actually then will take them on this amazing journey of beautiful imagery, stunning papers, um, and you're good to go. I mean, you've got everything here, really, um, to get you started and more. And of course, if you're already a crafting professional, you've been doing it for years and you're away with it already, um, you know, Corinne is going to show you some beautiful techniques here as well today. Um, and you've got inspiration that you can do. In fact, you know what? Let me show you a couple of these. This is the one you did earlier, it wasn't is, it, yes. Corinne? Which is just stunning. Um, it was, so it was get... a bit strange using an orange, a pink and a green ink pad. Because I was thinking they just almost jar against each other. But when you put them against the paper, yeah. it just works, doesn't it? And is that what you were... So what you were suggesting earlier as well, that you, you always choose the paper I do, personally. Yeah. I personally yeah, yeah. always go for my paper first. So for the next demo I'm going to do, I picked 
this oh, paper out of, the, out of the magazine. I love That's that. just out of the magazine. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Yeah. So I went for that, and consequently, I'm going to be using my flame red oh. and my alpine green, um, my alpine green aqua pens. Yeah, gorgeous. Because I pick my paper and I can match my pens. Match now, if I pen. went and picked up two pens, I could be walking around my craft room for hours going, <laughs> what paper have I got that matches that? It's yeah. so much easier to match it the other Ellie, way Ellie, producer Ellie, very, very, very strong words indeed she said all the time she's been working with the crafters channels and the hobby maker here at um here so that's her favorite paper she's ever seen there you, there you go and you're going to get it absolutely free with your magazine in fact you're getting more than that i love as well i mean two completely different yeah. styles so you might have same dye in there isn't it yeah. the feathers the same feather in both that's of those it. completely different styles completely different color combinations but you're going it to get works. step by step instructions for yeah. every project in the magazine oh, so if you lovely. are a beginner if you've lost your mojo obviously you're not going to get mine in there because i'm trying to make things a little do ones that aren't in the magazine because you're going to get those when you get home and then you've got about extension haven't you exactly so with your skills whatever your skill set is at home yes. this is going to work yeah. for you isn't it exactly Brilliant. so that one's one where in the magazine to show you how to use our glitter paste because ah, that was a big thing recently we're launching our glitter paste that's amazing i love a bit of sparkle yeah. beautiful and then you got it on acetate as well so again completely different why not just, just different ways of cutting this is from sarah sarah is this your oh it's lovely that isn't yeah it? Beautiful. I I'll think just... this one is my favourite. It's really gorgeous. It is gorgeous, isn't You're it? You're amazing. A radiate positive vibe. And again, that one's in the magazine. If you do love that, you yeah. know, you can make that. And once you've maybe once you've maybe made that, you could then look around at what other dyes you've got, what other stamps yeah. you've got, and you go, okay, I like that style. Maybe that's a style that I like. And then you could just go and then, you know, make it with some different bits that you've yeah. got. It's so true, isn't it? And you could put, I mean, this one, I would happily put this in a beautiful box frame and pop this on my, you know, my daughter's wall, my, well. daughter, my wall. It's beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It's absolutely stunning. Here we go. I'm just going to get my little talk back out there. There we are. Thanking you. Um, and we've got loads and loads of people coming through, but let's let's have a little look and see what you can yes. do. Yes. Okay. So shall I show you what I will do? Again, this is... This is my demo, so it's completely, completely different. So, oh, I just need to move over that way. Oh, right. There we go. My left. That way? Is that all right? They're happy with that there? Right. They wanted me to move my, my mat. Okay. So, I've just I'm going to make the whole card with one stamp. So, I've taken my stamp and I'm going to put it on my rocker block. Now, when I first joined Crafters Companion, I was petrified of my rocker block. Absolutely. What's like, a rocker block then? So what? rocker block is a it's a um, stamping platform, you know, stamping block. Yeah. But can you see on there? Look, it rocks. Oh. So that's not. So you can see that's flat. Can you see that's not parallel? Yeah. So it means that you distribute your weight. Oh, that's really so clever. Oh. Why were you scared of it? What do you think? People I think are scared because of? I'd. I I'd I've been using stamping platforms for so long okay. and I knew I could get good results with those that I couldn't get with stamping blocks previously, but this one works ah. every time. So I'm using my waterproof ink pad and you'll see why in a few minutes. And I've just is that, got... Oh, sorry, Corinne. Is that available on the show today, the rocker block? They usually are. If, they're not, if it's not listed on the show, it'll, I'm sure it'll be on your website because okay. we have them. Right, now, I put this on my stamping mat because it gives me a good background, a ah. good cushion to work on. But I've actually just put some black card on. It could be black or white. If I was at home, I'd be doing it on white. I've only put it onto black so that you can see, so that you can see where the card runs out. And what I'm doing here is I'm just stamping onto here. But I'm just, can you just see, there we go. Look at that perfect oh, yeah. impression. But I put this underneath. You might not be able to see it because I'm stamping off my card. And I get a little bit possessive of my um, my stamping mat. And I don't want ink all over it. That's all. That's, that's, all. Fair, that's fair enough. I think that's okay. That's the only Normal reason. There we go. Can you see? Can you see? All I'm doing, I'll, I'll show you because I was not, not saying a great deal as I did that. All you need to do there is I just take my rock block. I bring it down, so I rest it on there, uh -huh. pop it on there, and then I just roll it. Roll it over. That's And then beautiful. you get a perfect impression. Oh, everyone's wanting this. So we've I'm not surprised. We've just popped a bundle on, actually. Um, we've only got 32 left. Um, well done, Roz. Uh, 31 now. Professor, uh, the pressure, <laughs> Professor? Professor? <laughs> The Professor of Rock. There we go. Um, <laughs> it's your professional stamping mat and your rocker block. Oh, you get the mat um, as well. There you balance. go. Oh, there you go. So it's brilliant. Bundle. Right. So this is 
you know, so I've just popped that onto there. And then what I'm going to do is I cut this out of our mask it tape. So this is just uh, a thin, okay. I think we've had this on before. It's just a thin um, adhesive sheet. And I've just stamped on there and then I've just roughly cut them out. And all it's doing is I'm just laying them over. You could do it out of any white scrap card and just spray it with... Um, uh, like a low adhesive? A low adhesive, or? thank you. Okay. I was thinking of a removable spray. So you could just do that over there. Oh, brilliant. So, oh, I got, it's I might, so clever. So I did it slightly different on the other one. I've got this one in two pieces. So I was doing the different version. Let me see, where did that go? That went just there. So what that's doing is it's protecting what's underneath. It means okay. that that will stay. So I could actually go in and stamp another one. Uh, so if I wanted to build up a scene, Ah. If I stamped one here, it yeah. would look like it was behind because okay. the bit that's stamped over there, I'll do that one. I'll do that just to show you. It's different to what I've done on oh, my finished yeah. one, but just to show you. So if I... Now you're rocking and rolling today, it's, like it. Is, it is. Let's go in just here. And if I stamp... Oh, that bit's come off. Let me just pop that back on. So just to show you. So you can do this with any bit of tape. So if okay. I now go, so can you see I'm over stamping? Yeah. Can you see? So if you show you, I've got that one there, that one there, and this is overlaying. Mm -hmm. So when I stamp right there, let uh -huh. me just show you. When I peel that off now, ah, can you you've see? you protected that original. I protected the original one. That's so clever. Yeah. That's brilliant. So it's, I love just it. it's a like a masking, masking yeah. um, tape, isn't it? Yeah. Just, we've, we've got less than 30 available now of the um, professional stamping mat and rocker blocks. OK, okay. Like, well done, Susan Ra's there as well. Kathleen coming through. Um, and if you haven't yet seen the gorgeous bundle, the magazine, the dies, the stamps, um, it's all here for you. Everybody is so excited okay. about this. Right. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my stamp and I'm going to colour it with my aqua pen. So I'm just going to touch. So, you know, we can stamp with our aqua pens. I don't ah. know if you've had, we've had aqua pens on the show so many times. I just wanted to show you a different way. And so I've gone in with the green and then I've gone in with the Oh, that's red. clever. So you can choose the different colours and kind of. Yes. Yeah, that's Pick really the bits. nice. There we go. So, yeah. Now, I wouldn't do this with things like my acrylic paint markers and all that because they would just attached to the stamp they're dry they're dry to okay. the stamp so i you know i picked this on purpose so then i can pop this on here just a minute. Oh, one thing i need to do you need to it's very technical you have to huff huh? <laughs> just to make sure <laughs> you've right is everyone it. huffing at home there you go i've activated it there we go so it's just a bit so, of steam a bit yeah. of steamy breath <laughs> exactly. So it just what does that is it moisture yeah it just it? adds a little bit of oh, moisture. okay yeah so it does so you've now got I've got that on to there. So there we go. So you can see. And then all I'm going to do now is, so I've stamped that with my watercolour and I've just got a wet brush here. Uh -huh. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to draw out that ink. Ah. And I'm actually going to just try and not go too wet. And I'm just going to colour. And I've not applied any more ink and I'm just using the ink that's already there. And because it's an aqua pen, because it's water-based, yes. you, can, you can draw yeah. it out in that so way. So you can do this with your sparkle pen. I think I probably did it with my sparkle pen before. So you can just do like that. Is this why? I mean, it's so lovely that, I mean, because any time you start a project, does your mind and your creativity just take you in yes. a completely different direction sometimes yeah. to when you started? Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh, yeah. yeah. I was saying earlier, I'm going to do it with the sparkle pen now. So you can just see, I can just draw out the green with my sparkle pen, just like that. I'm actually going to go over the red with my sparkle pen because that's what I meant to do earlier. No. So that makes it sparkle. Now, if you find there's any bits and you want to add shading, mm -hmm. all I'm going to go in is I'm just going to go in and add in a little bit more. Just say, actually, I'll just give that a bit of a dry so then we can do that. Yeah, I, if, I, if I went to the magazine and thought I'm going to make the third project, whatever it might be, yeah, I can guarantee you it wouldn't look like the third project yeah. because I would start doing something and then I might go, oh, actually, in the fifth project, there was another technique that I liked yeah. and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use a little bit of that. And you will yeah. just you know, mix and match them around. And I always find that that tends to happen with me is I find that I mix and match. So once you've got there, there we go. I can then go in where I know it's going to be shadowy and I can add in a little bit more ink. 
and then you can see it just brings it out. When you first do it, you think, oh, there's not much, you know, it's, it's a bit strange. But then you just add it and then you just work it in yeah. with your spark. I love this. I love doing things like that. Now, we've got that. And what I want to do now, I forgot to make sure I've got water in my Mr. Pen. I should have checked that. Oh, yes, it's nice and full. Right, now, this is where it gets really fun. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take this and I've got a water spray. Oh, yeah. On Mr. Pens. Oh, and I'm oh just they're going, brilliant. They are. And I'm just going to get this. Now, remember, this is a water base. So even though it's okay. dried a bit, I'm just going to squirt it. Can you see? And I've just made it ah, bleed a little bit. Ah, nice. I'm going to quickly dub it off. Oh, that's made a nice bit. Oh, that pattern. clever gives a little bit of texture there as well. So, yeah. It? So I can then pop that onto there, dry it. Yeah. Just like that. You have to just keep drying between. I like that with a cloth. That was good. I must have done it with like a, just a kitchen roll before. If ever you find it starts to, to cockle a bit, just come and dry a little bit on the back and it will okay. flatten out the card. So once we've done that, I can then grab my pen. So I'm just colouring. You might not be able to say, I'm just colouring on the mat at the side with my pens. So I'm just going to go like that. And then I'm just going to get my sparkle pen and I'm going to just put a little bit of sparkle down. Pick up that. Oh, nice. They can all work together. You can blend yep. them in as long as they're all water-based together. Exactly. But do you notice I haven't taken my masks off at all yet? Nice. So where those masks are, that's going to stay nice and white underneath. Fantastic. Let's clean that brush off. Then I'll come in with the green. So this is with the sparkle, so it will add a little bit of shimmer. So all I'm doing is I'm tapping the end of my sparkle pens but I know these are on all the time and you see it's water-based so it will work um, it will work really really well with your waterproof so once we've done that let's just give that one last quick blast now with that so with the little mister you just had there I think they, there's a deal on where they come you in a, can get two brushes and the mister is that right N normally the misters come in a pack with multiple is it a pack, in that? Multiple yes multiple pack they're just ah. called um, Spectrum Noir Misters. Well, we Mist might be able to get those up for you in a sec. We normally it's, have them here. Yeah. They're really good, aren't they? Because they're handy, just those little yeah. misters, because you can carry them with you as well, can't you? Exactly. Which is good. There you go. Oh, here four we go. Misters. Pack of four misters for you. Um, so you can get four. And it's handy then as well, because you can have them in different places. You could have different oh. colours in one, exactly. couldn't you? Exactly. Yeah. That's always handy to have more, so that you've just got more options okay. then as well. So what I've got now is this is more or less dry and I'm just going to pop it. I'm going on to my stamping platform now because I need to be able to do something quite exact. So okay, so is that the difference? When you're exact, when you need an exact copy with the die and with a stamp or in a With place, a stamp, yeah. You have to I use do, the platform. I use my platform. Okay. So I'm going to lay the, the stamp that's yeah. directly over the top. Yeah. So then when I put my platform on, and pick it up I know it's in the right place and this is why you definitely need your waterproof ink pad because I've I've applied okay. quite a bit of water products to this if I use my alcohol um, one it might bleed so okay. can you see it's gone a bit it's gone a bit blurry so what I can then do is go in with my black and I could do this as many times as I needed to because it's on my stamping platform. But I believe. But now oh, look at that. Nice. Look at how it's picked up that detail. It really does, doesn't it? It just bring. It just sort of lifts it from it, the page again. It does, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Um, so, the set of four misters is just on screen right now. MQ two zero nine five. Okay, so that's your product code there. Um, and you're getting four of them. Four ninety nine. That's good. That's isn't brilliant, it? isn't that's it? Amazing. Now wow. look at this. So remember where we had that white on there yeah so now Look. have i cleared them all off there we go so we've now got that you're feeling very right. romantic today Carl. i know i know very so i'm beautiful. just going to show you this one so it's just, it's it i just like this one because i've mounted it on the black so look oh, at yeah. that oh no wow yeah just really takes some time and it really really looks beautiful doesn't it there that we go. Lovely. Oh, must be, must be. Must the be. Weather, yeah. The weather's getting nicer. Roses are blooming. That's it. That's romance it. is in the air. <laughs> <laughs> right. So you remember that bit of paper I showed you? So uh -huh. that was my inspiration. Gorgeous. That paper, the yes. reds and the greens in there, and I've just and I do. I think black. Even when you're doing colours, 
looks really nice especially if you're doing um techniques yeah. it's really nice just to use your to use your black it looks make very sure my, smart doesn't it yeah and it also makes your colors pop it, it adds a differentiation between your colors doesn't it so they don't they don't um you know bleed into each other mm. so those are, that's out of my magazine i've just got some foam pads on the back of here and i'm going to pop that oh, on there gorgeous now in my magazine was uh sentiment mm -hmm. we showed that i've just cut it out and again i've just put it onto black so again i've got a couple of foam pads on the back of there so then you could put that one i just think that looks nice going over yeah and then the last little bit that i would do because it's not a corin card really unless it's got a bow. little bow and normally do you know what i would have always put my bows up at the top corner but now i'm going to pop it like there. that but how about like that oh sorry you want to do it that there way go. that's okay it's coming which way is it going gorgeous. there we go there we are Sorry. So lovely. There you are. How about that? Completely different. Completely no, there isn't different. one like that in the magazine, but I just yeah. wanted to show you. You can have such a different look. And if you compare that to the orange and pinks that I did yeah. earlier. Well, let again, me show you that again, actually. It's so different, isn't it? This is what is really exciting. And honestly, I've been flicking through the magazines by having a really good nose. I mean, good. I want this, you want this. It's honestly just beautiful. Such lovely imagery as well. You could have got that whole, I don't know, what's gorgeous is with the leaves that can be any season really yeah. it can take autumn with the fall and the leaves falling from the trees but it's also got that sort of almost whimsical magical summer vibe yep. just really positive really uplifting i think every every page actually in this magazine is uplifting it's it positive is. it's really really beautiful so he wanted that feel good factor as well and just get really stuck into some positive and beautiful projects this is an absolute must. Now, it all comes beautifully boxed for you as well, um, which is always handy, isn't it? So when, you're, when you start cutting your papers and things like that, it's all gonna, you can keep it all nice and neat and tidy. Um, you've got your dies in here. You've got your stamps in here. Um, you've got the embossing folder in here as well. They're all free. And um, because you're with Hobby Maker here today, um, you're gonna get an exclusive uh, free gift as well that you can buy just from coming in today through Hobby Maker. So we've got this wonderful metallic ink pad for you as well um which is really superb so you're getting all of this for 14.99 which frankly just seems absolutely bonkers um but it's really exciting and um, so do keep on coming through okay this is available i think over half the stock um has now completely gone um, and you don't, you won't repeat issues, will you, Corinne? Oh, no. So once they're gone, they're gone. they're gone. Yeah. Yeah. So it's really, really gorgeous. I mean, this is a perfect one. Again, like we said earlier, to get started, but also if you've been um, crafting for years and years and years, you're still going to learn something in here. You're still going to get new ideas. Um, and as Corinne said, you know, you'll never create the same thing twice. If I just show you the back page as well, because this is great. I love this little bag that's been created I know. here. So you've got 3D projects in here exactly. too. Exactly. It's not just about card making, is it? Yeah. Lovely. Oh, it's wonderful. Oh, there we go. Um, in fact, oh, there we go. That's all right. Here we go. Um, so you can see that lovely bag on there as well. So you've got gift box ideas, gift bag ideas. Um, really, really fabulous. And all those beautiful premium quality papers in here as well. Um, just stunning. Keep on coming through. Well done to every single one of you for adding it to your basket as well. Now we do have another fabulous bundle for you as well. Um, so we've got two magazines and both of yes. these have a die that comes completely Oh, they have free. much more than a die. Um, but they have more than that, yeah. Oh, yes. so there we go. Through. So should we have a look at, you're getting issue three and issue four. So it sounds a bit strange because <coughs> this is Crafters Inspiration issue three and four, but two is the new one. These okay. are the previous iteration of our okay. magazines. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so you've, you know, you've got these. So we're doing you them as a bundle. Mm -hmm. And what you get in here is you obviously get your magazine, beautifully printed magazine Good. with all of the inspiration. And I'm going to talk about that in just one minute. But on this side, you will get, oh, those ones come in the other one. I put them in the wrong way. I love so the papers this. you use. Yeah, you've got companion. all of your wow. papers uh -huh. and they're all in here. So absolutely gorgeous and then you've got your butterfly stencil uh -huh. which i think is the most oh, beautiful lovely. stencil you've got your border dies uh -huh. and you've so got nice. your springtime stamps oh look my at those gosh. there's a, a lot, lot of stamps isn't there? now you will get in so this is how these are different so this one you've got some 
projects at the beginning, just down here, you can see, I can show you that. You've got projects in the magazine, plenty of projects. I think I've stuck some pages together. There we go, all the way through. And again, on here and on here. So there's a quite a few pages. Oh, Ooh, and then nice I can see these ones just here. We've only so. got three of these left individually now, right, just to okay. let you know at home. The one that's on screen right now, three left. That's LN2036. But listen, do you know what? I'm going to say something a bit odd. I'm going to say don't buy it right now. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you're specifically looking just for issue four. Obviously, then, you know, we've got three left. We're nearly over allocated. Um, we've got two left, but we've actually got a bit of a bundle. We have. Coming up, haven't we? And then what I love about this is this magazine features on recent... Um, releases at crafters companion um. so this is our watercolor um, um collection then you're going to go into our easter box Ooh. then you've got some sewing ones and then you've got our modern edibles so if you've bought some of our collections recently um more than words ones um positive thoughts and you need a little bit of inspiration on how to use them then these are going to work for you so that was issue three the one that's been on the screen that we've nearly sold out is issue four so it's the same format you've got projects at the beginning using the three dies and stamps and everything like that and then once you get past there you're going to look we've got some of our nesting dies you've got our gorgeous um Oh, look. Beauty collection, yeah. showing you how to colour the hair, really <gasps> wow. going into detail. Oh. Our shaker cards. Oh, is that we a little perfume those. shaker bottle? How yeah. gorgeous is we've that? Got, we've had those on here quite recently. Mm. So if you bought that, then maybe this is going to give you some inspiration. Yeah. Our country lane collection, some more sewing ones, or our paper piecing ones. Now, individually, that they're has telling sold me. sold out now. Yeah, yeah. they're sold out. Um, so as long, as long as you've got those, you've also got your nesting stars die, dies you've got your stamps these are really good that's fun amazing stamps. goodness you've got so many there and you've got two yeah. stencils as well oh wow now as you've shown we've put them on and you can buy them individually yeah. so this is issue four this purple one the yellow one was issue three but Okay. You've got a better way to do it, haven't you? This is it. So issue three is now on your screen, MA2048. Mm -hmm. We've got five left, that's it. So if you're wanting issue three, if that's one that's missing for you, um, come and get it now. But we've got an even better way for you to get both issue three yep. and four together because you're going to get all of that, everything that Corinne's just shown you, you're also going to get an additional die. And this is absolutely beautiful, the isn't it? It's just here, yeah, yeah, here yeah. we go. So we've got the whole bundle here for you. And this is absolutely gorgeous. What have I just knocked over? Oh, dear. Can't this stop. is what I was doing the other day, wasn't <laughs> it? Um, now, the die, you can buy individually if you'd like to. We've only got five of them available as an individual piece. But it's a three-piece die, um, country lane, really beautiful. I mean, that's a mirror. It's a... Oh, it's frame. a portrait frame exactly. for painting. Exactly. Yeah, you could put pictures in there. Like you say, you could put mirror in there. Yeah. You could have an aperture looking through. You could make it as a yeah. shaker card. So many ways to use it. Oh, absolutely. Or you could put a picture of somebody you love. Have you ever done one of those photos? You know, you do like a Victorian photo or like. Um, have you ever done that? Well, you do. My friends and I did it recently because we're a bit sad like that. <laughs> We went to one of those Victorian oh, villages and we got all dressed up oh, in our, and then had our photos taken. <laughs> it wasn't the Black Country Museum, it was up in, um, where was it? It was in Shropshire near, oh, right. oh, lovely. what's it called, near Iron Bridge. Yeah. Really fun. Um, but you can imagine popping like an old, you know, a nice picture like yeah. that. Yeah, it'd just be lovely. Um, you're getting this absolutely free with your bundle, okay? And it's really, really exciting. So that was the individual um frame there the die and that was only 12.99 for all, all pieces wow wowzers so it should be 38 pounds 97 for all of that then yep yeah but there's a clock on your screen and you know what that means it means that we are not going to stop there um really when we bring you a bundle you know that you're going to make a big big saving okay so we've got the die that you've wanted you've got um you've got issue three and you've got issue four Issue four is completely sold out. Issue three is completely sold out. The die is very close to selling out individually. And really, the very best way, the best value way, the biggest saving is to come on in and get this incredible bundle here um, from Hobby Maker. You're getting it all. And honestly, 
Um, the saving that you're making is tremendous. We're basically going to be giving you the magazine for free. It's just extraordinary. Um, £38.97 is great value for all of this because you think about how many projects you've got. Do you know what I love as well about Crafters Companion, Corinne? Go for it, yeah. That in these beautiful magazines, in these issues, the way that you've packaged the dies and the stamps, you can use that paper as well. I mean, yeah. nothing is left that you're going to waste. You're going to use every single little bit. And there's Certainly no are. wasted pages on advertising or anything like that because it's all made in-house, it? is, it? yeah. So yeah. it's super. <gasps> Look at that deal, $24.99. That's your chance right now to come on in and get it. It's just superb. You have got so much that you're gonna enjoy um, with this today. Now, a quarter of the stock has already gone, okay? But that means you do have availability. You can dial through. 0800 001 4433. You might want to get this as a gift bundle for a friend or family member who you know just actually really wants to get crafting or maybe they're housebound right now or they might be stuck and just I don't know. It's, it, I think a lot of people find crafting that way, don't they? Oh, Corinne? they do. When they do. Just... It's so mindful. It's yeah. a brilliant community. It introduces you to other people. But yes, like you say, if you are struggling, then yeah, it's a brilliant way to get to meet people. Wonderful. And you have that, that sense of community is really wonderful, isn't it? Yes. You've got your crafters companion community. Yep. The yep. website's there. The Facebook page is there. So someone's going to hold your hand the whole way through. So if you ever got questions, if you're ever stuck, or if you're ever sort of thinking, well, how do I use this? Um, you've got all your YouTube videos as We've well. So many, yeah. so Ask many a resources. question on any of our Facebook pages. Yeah. If we can't answer, if we don't get in quickly enough, one of the people watching um, the shows yeah. often knows the answer. This our design it. team are there, so they're very familiar with the products and they're always there as yeah. well. This is it, it's just gorgeous. Lovely community to be part of. And then, of course, you're, you're coming up with projects that you feel really good about afterwards as well. You create yeah. something, you've made something really stunning. And then if you choose to gift it to somebody, you get oh, that joy exactly, again, exactly, don't you? Exactly. It's wonderful. Um, tons of you checking out here. Joy, Joyce, we've got Sue and Nadine, Carol, well done. Hi, Linda. Um, tell us when you found Craft what was it that do you remember your first project or what's the project you've been most proud of message in we'd love to hear from you um, and you know what Corinne who brings us loads of beautiful products and um, and projects she's going to show us some more inspiration I now am, I am yes I would love to show again this is another one now there is a resist technique demo in the magazine but I oh, thought okay. I'd show you mine is that like like um like batik and silk paint that kind of resist so, so, you're resisting so what you. we what we're doing Doing is we're going to stamp on here in a white ink and then I'm going to go ah. over it so I'm going to use the stamping platform because I like to when I'm using white and I'll show you why so all I've done is I've just taken this is um, like a washi masking tape you can get you can get these all of the time it's just a really lovely low tack tape oh that's good so I'm going to pop that onto my stamping platform um, and all I've done is it's just a piece of waterproof card and I've just, um, watercolour card, sorry, and I've just put the tape round the edge. I put it onto some black card to give the tape something to stick to. Oh, fun. And that's just going to give me a white border. So it's a bit like when I did the rose. If I put something mm. over it, nothing can, nothing can, can stick. Brilliant. And then I'm just going to get that lovely feather um, ah. stamp. So um, this is from the main bundle. It is from the main bundle, with, isn't it? Yes. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to stamp it a couple of times. Now, sometimes what I like to do is I like to go in first with my clear water um, translu watermark translucent. So I'm going to stamp on that. And I like to do that because it's nice and sticky. And it also primes your stamps really well. See, I can just see that's a little bit pink. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over it with my white now if you are using a white embossing powder you can use a clear ink you don't need to use um a white a white um ink pad but i just like it for the the depth of color yeah. i know it's white but you'll see in a minute what i mean it just it's like this magic happens yes. doesn't it so i'm going to pop that onto there Okay. Now, what I'll sometimes do is, because this is a pigment-based ink pad, but like we are saying about the silver one, it'll mm -hmm. stay wet for a while. So you don't oh. actually need to panic too much. So I can take that off of there, and then I can get my white um, ink um, embossing powder, and I can put that over. And what I'll often do is leave that one just like that. Then I will get my um, stamp. Don't need to clean it off, because I'm going to do exactly the same. Then okay. I'll get it, and I'll put it in a different place. And then I'll pick that up. I could have picked up that embossing powder, but because um, because I'm just 
Uh, I've got it taped down. I've just been a bit lazy, that's all. So well, it saves your time, doesn't it? You don't yeah. have to be taking it all off. So I can just pop that time. on there. Let's do another one. Just pop that onto there. No one could call you lazy, Corinne. <laughs> we were having a good chat before, weren't we, about, about cleaning and jobs around the house. And Corinne, you are busy, 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 bee. Well, keeps you out of mischief. Very I impressive. tend to do, once I've done two, I'll usually find, I usually like to pick it up after that. Otherwise, I've start to run out of space. Okay. And so all I'm going to do, oh, let's just take down there. There we go. And then, and then I'm just going to, you can tip that onto a piece of separate card or you can just tip it back. So can you see? Yeah. Can you see that down there? So what I'm going to do then, now I could leave, when you are, once that's on, that's uh -huh. on. You don't need to heat set it straight oh, okay. away. I could leave that and come back to it tomorrow. It wouldn't do oh, any okay. harm. Because the powder so is not going to brush off. It's no. not going to... Oh, so what I would... But I'm going to do it and do this. I tend to do, say, two and then heat set so that I don't smoke. I could knock it off if I brushed it. Okay. it's not held on that tight. So I usually do about two then heat set them, then yes. do some another two, and then heat set them. So it doesn't matter that it's gone onto my washi tape. It'll still, you know, I just just literally heat set it all. And I'll give you, I'll give it a little tilt in a minute. Um, and you can see the difference. There we go. So I like this one, it's gone right off one side to the other. There we go. So if I just show you that now, can you see? I know it's white on white. Can you see them just there? Oh, there, look. You can see. Just mm. there. You can see this one here, can't you? You can just yeah. see the white on white. I would com continue doing that until I've got it all over the card. Oh, gorgeous. Now, and just this feather stamp, just to clarify for you at home as well. So HB2020, this is the bundle with um, your issues three and four, the two magazines and the die. The feather that Corinne is just mm -hmm. using now, this is from the um, the main bundle. And you've got the embossing folder to go with this as well. You've got the dies, you've got the stamps, you've got so much in here. And it's just the most beautiful, beautiful magazine. It certainly um, is. And the details for that are on your screen right now. You're getting everything for $14.99. So it's a really, really brilliant deal. Um, so now what you're going to do, so you've got those beautiful sort of textured Feathers on there. Yes. So they're on there, and I'm just just brushing a little bit of water over there. I'm just literally using my Mister Spray just to. I don't want it soaking. I just want it a little bit wet on there. Yes. And then I put some ink on here. So I have got Ocean Blue, Water okay. Reactive, and Pink Tulip. Yes. So all I'm going to do, wet that. I don't want it too wet, but I'm going to pick that up, and then I'm just going. Now, can you see? Where there ah. is, can you see where the um, stamp is? I need a bit more ink there. It will resist because yes. it's got, it is. so these are my water reactive inks. Yeah. You could do this with your shimmer ink pads. I didn't okay. realise the shimmer were on. Your shimmer would, oh, they would look amazing Ooh, nice. with this. So just pop it on a couple of, of lots of here. There we go. Just picking that up. Just making. Wow. Good. Sorry, I've just realised what you're getting for that. Forty. You're getting ten ink pads. Yes. For Forty-four ninety-three. That's a mega save. It is, and they it? are five ninety-nine per ink pad. Yeah. Oh, that's so that is super. brilliant deal. Now look at this. So now, can you see? Can you see that feather? Oh, really yeah. starting to pop. Yes. So all I'm doing is brushing. The shimmer ink pads would look lovely because they react really well with water. Mm. So we can do that on there. There we go. Just. It's very angelic with those beautiful feathers and it these is, lovely it? calming colours. It's making me feel quite serene. Yeah, it's lovely. Let me just clean that brush off a little bit. I just want a little bit more pink. And then what I would do is just blend over where those colours just meet like that. Right, so once I've got to there, I would then, the other little bit I would do is, I'm trying to think, how did I do this? I'm looking at this. I think I did it with my sparkle pens again. I did, I did. Oh, I used my lovely. sparkle pens. Uh, you know, when you just look at something and think, how did I do that? <laughs> so I showed earlier, so it's just about 
Okay, see what pens you've got and see, see what you've got. you keep like a little technique book? Where do you, so if you try a little new technique, do you pop a little note on it and sort of... Not or do you always. Just I just to... try and remember what yeah. I've been doing. So I can just sprinkle a little bit of blue ink on there, just like that. So these have got sparkle in them. So, you, you know, they're just going to be absolutely gorgeous. I don't think I shook that one enough. Let's, be, let's do it the right. After I say to everybody, shake it up. You can tell it does need a shake. And then we can pop this on like that. And then sparks pop that over like that. It's amazing the many different techniques you can do just with one pen. I know. It's brilliant, isn't it? So yeah. You just grab all those techniques. And once that's dry, so you just give that a quick blast. But you can see the lovely resist yeah, coming through. Yeah, it's really gorgeous. There we go. And then I would just get my... Uh, Pokey tool and look at that. So it just gorgeous. Oh, look, off. lovely crisp border as well. Yes, I do like that to have yeah. that crisp border there. And then oops, look at that. You've made your own background papers. Now, all I'm okay. going to bring in one that I've already done. So you can see on here, I've just added some liquid pearls and I've just drawn a pen. Um, I've just drawn a pen border all the way around the oh, outside yeah. just for fun just to do yeah. it now again this still applies exactly what i was saying before this is about going and picking your papers first so what i have done is i've gone to my magazine and mm. i've come to here and you see this one here yeah. i have just that's not even stuck down i know that's not stuck down i have just cut that one out there you go, you can see I've just cut that one out of there. Yeah. So you're, you've got, and all I've done is I have just cut round it with a little bit of a border in the black. So I've just freehand oh, cut that. Oh, so let's stick that onto there. So Those can... pens that you just used, I'm just double checking. I think, well, so basically we've just popped on screen, Ellie's put there for you, really amazing bundle. Um, which is the aqua pens, but it's the metallic ones. I think. All right. So we've got a bit of a bundle on for you, but it's quite limited. So just to let you know, if you're wanting to get those gorgeous metallic, um, are the acrylic ones, did you say, um, Ellie? The paint marker. Oh, yeah, we had those so, on earlier. So ah, those, you could do okay. your flats with those as well. Fantastic. They would look absolutely beautiful. Yes. Beautiful. Right, now, quick quick technique with this let me just get my plate using some of those dies i'm going to take some of my dies and i've got the mandala bit and the feather and i'm going to pop them on some some craft card and i'm oh, just yeah. going to die cut those out let's hold them tight and we're going to do um, a couple of techniques with those so craft card looks brilliant yeah. but we can make craft card look even better as well so what i'm going to do now Gosh, I'm going to have to clear up at the end. So there we go. Look at this. Now, just because these are complementary dies, Ooh, don't think you're so going to get, it. you're going to, they're not going to cut. They are, you know, crafter's companion, crafter's companion name on them. So we're going to make sure that they're going to work. Yeah. So you've got the mandala and you've also got the little feather. It's so beautiful. They are, aren't they? I notice as well with your dies, they the little pieces in between always come out really easily, don't always, they? It really yes. does give you that crisp finish. It's yeah. gorgeous. So what I'm going to do with these is I'm going to take those. And you remember that clear ink pad that I used a few minutes ago? Yeah. I'm going to go all over that now. There we go. It just picks so I can just press it down. So that's, you can see, can you see it's changed colour? Oh, yeah. Because it's just yeah, yeah. wet. It's, it's covered in um, the uh, ink pad. So okay. once I've done that, now... And that's the clear ink pad. That's the clear ink pad. Let's put that on that side where there is none. And then, I know um, this is a Cosmic Shimmer one. So it's not a Crafter's Companion one, but I know Jamie. Um, oh, Jamie yes. normally sells those. And he did, he did this up at our place one time. He sold, brought these up. I, I was just blown away. So this is an embossing powder with little... It's called Jurassic because it's like little bits of rock in it. So when you put this on, I'm not going to get it everywhere, but I just want to pick up some of the little bits. Mm. Just pick up some of the little bits like that. I'm going to pick those up, and then I'm going to tr I'm going to heat set those. Good. Let me just put the lid on. Just to add, I'm just adding texture and dimension. So it's all about, you know, how can you create more from it? So I can put that onto there. Mm -hmm. 
and you'll see that goes uh, white and shiny and like enamel. Yeah. So look. Oh, there wasn't very much on there. I might need to put a little bit more on there. It's Just, nice, isn't it? I like the fact that it's not a completely solid colour. Yeah, I didn't want. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't want to put too much on. That's just there. That's. I just want. I still wanted to see some of the craft card there. There we go. That's better. And we can just get that one through. Whoop. <laughs> I had to move my pokey tools. Hey. There you go. So can you see now? Yeah. That is gone shiny. Yeah. And like enamel. Absolutely. It's so I love that. I think it's it's just incredible, isn't it? Yeah. Useful. So now I've got I've got a couple more that I've already cut. There we go. You can see like, I've got one with a little bit on. I've got one with oh, no. um, a lot on. But look at those. Don't they look lovely? That detail is just I know. And you're getting them free. You are. You get, I mean, honestly, if it has to be one. one of the most generous magazines with free gifts I've ever seen. You're getting so much with now this you'll day. And it's probably awesome. notice when I do make cards, I often make, I like my cards tenfold. By tenfold, we meant... We have the, the fold at the okay. top. Okay. I just, it's just it's a bit how of a I, signature, Corinne's signature. Yeah, I just find if you're putting things on the front, uh -huh. they stand, they often stand better. I just, yeah, I just like I what mean, I do. Because they become quite weighty, I guess, don't they? Yeah. So yeah. So I've just got some pearlescent card and some black again. And again, I picked the blue because I got it onto here. So I can then pop this one on. That's finished, we can pop this on. Again, I'm just using my all-purpose glue. It's my, it's my glue of choice where I can, because it just makes things a little bit more rigid. I know if you're watching Debbie Fisher, she will always go with the um, tacky glue. Okay. We all, we're all different, you're, we all yeah. like different. And that's what I was saying, why it's so lovely to watch yeah. everybody. So, so this is it, you'll find your own way at home, well, won't you? Yeah. You'll find your sort of, um, your way of doing now, things, which is great. This is just a stamp from our positivity one. And I know we've done this in a lot of stamping bundles that we've had here. So I just thought bring in some others. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop that onto here and then I'm going to just tuck. You never know. You never know how it's going to look till you've finished it. It's one of those. I don't plan them out too much. And then, yeah, it's, it very it's definitely boho. got a yeah, boho definitely. feel to it, hasn't it? And I just think something like that yeah. just looks really lovely. Um, and then we can... And do actually, just even seeing them like that, I mean, that's the gorgeous thing. Once you've created all those resist backgrounds, you could, you've then, you could just have the... Um, dream captures there or just yeah. feathers or you know exactly you've so many possibilities you? so I'm just I don't even need to glue down the feathers because what I've done is I've glued down the mandala element and laid them over the top sure. so yeah. it just holds them down a little bit of foam tape on the back of there and that one and then where am I going to pop that I've, I've changed my mind I was going to I was going to pop it down there I tell you what I'm just going to lift that up uh -huh. I'm going to lift one of those up and I'm going to move it across a little bit. That's another good tip, isn't it? With the tape, you don't have to press too hard in the no. beginning and then till you commit. Exactly. Don't commit. Exactly. <laughs> I'd forgotten I was going to leave a little gap down in the corner, which is why I'd put the pearls up in that side so that it um, balanced it out and put that down there. Lovely and that, time. again, is a completely different look. So the three yeah. that I've done today have created complete... Oh, sorry. Let me go that way. Sorry, I thought it was coming that, that is way. Just there you go. Isn't that lovely? Stunning. So we've used the die cuts and we've used the papers from there. We've used the stamps to create the background and then we've just made it... It's ourselves. absolutely gorgeous. And all of this, the papers, the stamps, the dies, the beautiful inspiration, it's all in here in this fantastic bundle as well. I mean, genuinely, I would get this just for the papers. Yes. Because actually, if you go to a craft shop and you try and get, I mean, how many sheets of the beautiful Crafters Companion papers have you got in here? The beautiful well, I quality. Think it's 14 plus 14 the two, plus, yeah. Um, two, four, sorry, um, toppers to cut out. It's, I mean, it's absolutely outstanding. Just that on its own for 14 99 is superb. Yeah. But you're getting the full magazine, all the inspiration, all the ideas, the whole community that you're part of then with Crafters Companion as well. Your dies, your beautiful stamps, your embossing folder, and of course, because you're shopping with Hobby Maker today, you're getting your free um, stamp there as well, which is your ink pad, which is beautiful. That's metallic yes. shimmer, isn't it? Yes. Really, really outstanding. Now, if you've already ordered today, um, your post and packaging is already taken care of, and it doesn't matter if you spend one pound or 
201 pounds it really doesn't matter it's still only one p and p so 395 no matter how big your package is how big your parcel is um but just look at the ideas and what you can create with this incredible set and you'll keep coming back to it won't you, you? certainly you're will fun. i think there's so much in there you know but again it's that inspiration we all have days mm. where we just can't think what we want to craft yes but you get the magazine out you have a little look and then you do but look at the different styles mm. there'll be something in there for everybody and you'll find something and then you'll just make it your own yeah it really is exceptional it's absolutely beautiful um do keep on coming through for this and actually on the website as well um if you have a little look at the website on Hobby Maker, everything that Corinne has brought to the show today is available there for you. So you've got all those beautiful pens and stamps um, and this other fantastic bundle as well, which we're just going to show you once again, because this is superb and it's very close to setting out actually as well. Really, really popular. Um, so this is for issue three is sold out and issue four is now completely sold out and they won't be made again. So the only way to buy it now is in the bundle. Um, so you've got issue um, three and issue four and you're getting your complimentary die, which is from the Country Lane collection. Three pieces, a lot of metal here. So basically you're getting a free magazine, whichever way, which is wonderful. And again, tons of inspiration, tons of card, tons of paper stock there as well. Really, really gorgeous. Um, so this is all here in available but very limited so do make sure you're checking out Corinne our gorgeous Corinne is going to be back here at seven o'clock with some more fabulous deals I'm looking gonna, forward to we're that. going to focus on stamps in we the are aren't hour. we yes yes and then we've got lots and lots and lots uh, to show you it's going to be really exciting and right now uh, we're going to be going over to our lovely Natalie from Hunky Dory so and do you know what I'm really really excited about this as well because I tell you what um your deco large I think this is one of the most exceptional de decolage collections we've ever had, actually. On Hobby, but it's wonderful. If you've not seen it yet, you are in for a massive treat. Um, and if you have seen it, if you got this on Tuesday, you're going to want to get more because it's absolutely outstanding. So Natalie's up next with Hunky Dory. See you in a moment. Here at Hobby Maker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. My name is Anne-Marie and I am the creative manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier paper craft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our paper craft goodies back at home in Preston. We do lots of paper craft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, waterbrush pens and we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations which we just know the audience love. Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, 
along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? Hey, for that is Natalia. Hello. Natalia. Uh, it's Hello. so lovely to have you back here. And uh, <laughs> welcome to Hobby Maker, if you're just tuning in. Um, I'm Rosie. This is Natalie. And oh my goodness, you are in for a massive treat. This hunky-dory bundle. We've just been it's chatting about isn't it again. It? I don't, I still don't really understand how it's possible because I know. there's so much in here. We literally jam-pack so much into these decollage collections. I mean, it's mind boggling yeah. sometimes. I mean, you you can make a minimum, and this is a minimum of 24 cards. And we wow. were talking about this back at the office the other day and we were, I was talking to um, Kat, our other demonstrator, and we were saying like, when you get these sets, like how many possible cards do you think you can make? If you want to make your full decollage up, that's why we say it's a minimum because you would make a minimum of these, but you can you can swap these because we can yeah. lay these up onto our base layers, we can lay them up onto our card stocks. So we were thinking, and Kat was saying that she thinks she could make four cards from each of that. Each so that of them, doubles wow. that up. So that's 48 cards oh that you can make up with this. It's just incredible. I and and they're cards. Down. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Well, that'd be the way there around. we go. But there we go. Shows where my brain's at today. Um, 12 beautiful. phenomenal designs in here. And I think it's so versatile with the hobbies and um, sort of sports that we've chosen to highlight with this collection. Yeah. Um, but truly something for everyone ages, genders. Um, I think it's perfect. We've got a real nice mixture. We've not just focused on those um, very common sports. They're still in there. Yeah. But, you know, we've looked at other hobbies and sports like gardening, um, playing the music. We've got skateboarding in there, yeah. which is so different. Um, it's amazing. I love it. They're peerless as well, aren't they? Because actually, it doesn't really matter what age you're making card for as well, who you're making the card for. Yeah. They're just... They are for everybody. They're so wonderful. They're That's so three dimensional. They quality. are absolutely oh. crazy. When you think about how many, how much dimension mm. is in these images when they're fully made up, it's crazy. It's really quite crazy. incredible. Um, right, what we're going to do, because there are so many elements to this bundle, what we're going to do is bring each one individually for you, okay? Um, what we, what tends to happen, I know yep. this happened on Tuesday, I mean, it just went completely bananas, and especially for your little book. Uh, the little book so is collectible. everyone's favourite. I mean, you can, there's people that have every single one of our little books. Yeah, and they never out. use them because they want to collect no, it and keep, keep it. we just keep them all together, but it's phenomenal. So in here, you're going to get six of the same design there's 24 in total so 144 sheets in here which we can just pop on a mat and layer make a card from right i'm just going to stop you right there because you just said with the toppers just with the toppers on their own yeah we can make around 44 cards 
48. 48 if cards. We really stretch out what we've got there. You've got 144 pages yeah. here, and they could be a card. This is each why of people them. love it as well because you can just pop that onto a little book, Miri Matt. You can yeah. pop it onto an A6 um, card blank, and you can add a sentiment. And especially if you're making for charity or big bulk card making, it's perfect oh for that. Oh my gosh, it's We obviously super. have the duplicates, so if you want to use your dies, you want to do some really fun things with dies. Or you want to create sort of like dioramas and have different layers. What's a diorama? We've got one just there with the little book actually. This one? Yeah, so we've oh. made that one. Um, and it's got lots of different acetate layers. So it's the same oh image, gosh. but it's like cut into it. Oh, so this is a diorama? Yeah, so it's got all of that dimension. A bit of drama with a diorama. It's a little bit crazy. Oh, yeah, this is cool, um, I like that. But you can... It's a great way of using That's your layers. And you can create this with your um, ultimate kit as well by stretching yeah. those bits and pieces out. It's amazing. Well, I'm going to come back to that, Ellie, in a moment. <laughs> I'm just going to... So, the little book is on screen and we've already got people multi-buying on this. Because yes. Now, you will get this in the big bundle. You will. But what most people like to do is they want to get yeah, this Yeah, they want to add in little extra bits yeah. and pieces, don't they? Because do you do this as well? Do you sort of buy a couple, have one to keep and one to use? Um, or do you I, use it all? I just, yeah, I just use it all. It's, it's worth using it all. You don't want yeah. to save these things. Oh, I don't know. There, you see, I'm a bit of a say. I like, I like the idea no, of. No, I have to, I have to have it, work with it. I just, do you know what? As well, I was thinking about this. I think because you could almost make these into little postcards and just send yeah, them as a post. Absolutely. You know, like just to send to somebody. Yeah, you can pop them you. onto some of your adorable Gorgeous. scoreable, yeah. and then you've got a really nice um, place to to yeah. write on, oh, and then just crazy. pop it in the post. Well, absolutely fantastic. Listen, so this is an individual. Remember, it's coming as part of the bundle as well, but keep yeah. on adding it to your order. We're going to bring you, the bundle is on pre-order. Oh, we were going to show the web, weren't we? Sorry, Ellie, that was my bad. Um, on the website, you can see everything is there available for you to pre-order. So, so the whole goodies. bundle is there. And oh my goodness, you will not believe the deal. Um, really, really exciting. But if you want to buy any individual parts as well, it's all here. You've got the adorable score, all the inserts, the toppers. You've got it all. So it's really, really fantastic. Now, what did you just say, Ellie? Who shaves their legs? <laughs> Jockeys do. Oh, and they say what well, swimmers do and oh, cyclists. To make, to make them more aerodynamic. Yeah, ah, oh, that makes sense. I didn't realise jockeys did that. It too. was a very um It was know, very random. It was very wasn't random. It? Yep. <laughs> but we appreciate that. Thanks, Ellie. <laughs> Give us a random fact. Oh, there was a there was a jockey there on the was card a in fairness. The card. Okay. There was. <laughs> Thanks, Ellie. There we go. Send us your random facts. We'd like to know. Um, right, this is your inserts. Oh, we only got eight of these. We only got eight sets of the inserts. Oh, no okay. Way. Oh. Well, you're gonna to have to get them in your bundle, then, aren't you? You certainly will. Absolutely. Just remind us as well. I mean, how? What are the different ways that we can use the inserts for? Well, I think these are really good because you can obviously pop them on the inside of your cards very traditionally. Mm. But because the artwork is so beautiful, you have that yeah. gorgeous muted d design. We can actually put these on the front of cards if you want oh, to. You yeah. can stamp onto these as well. Oh, that's um, good, we can yeah. pop these through our printers, so we can add like nice verses to them. Yeah. Um, it's a you could add your own sort of sentiment really onto that a really nice muted image tr tr uh, trim that out pop it on some mirror and then pop it on the front of your card oh, as well yeah. so you can use it as inserts or you can use them on the outside yeah. of your cards you love it to. and you're getting an awful lot of these it's about you, got 36 yeah. haven't you 36 there's 12 designs so there's a design for every single image we've got in the collection and you yeah. get three of each of those so good absolutely amazing and for 9.99 absolutely Crazy. superb um now remember it is part of the big decolage bundle as well yeah and um, so everything we're showing you is part of the bundle too but we know that lots of you like to get the individuals so you've got the extras as well right let's show you the toppers yes this is huge. Wow. What you get in here. Yes. So, you've got all of your base layers, um, which Rosie's got here. So, you've got 12 of those beautiful images. These are what we layer our decoupage onto. And you'll see on these, we've got corner edges, we've got um, extra border strips, we've got sentiments included in here. Some you'll have one, others you'll have three, like this one. It's Ooh, huge. Yeah. So, you get um, doubles of each of these because obviously we've got 12 designs. You're going to get two of each to make that 24. Um, decoupages so we've got all of those different designs and awesome. they are just They're wonderful. so lifelike I mean even that look at the background how it's blurred out it almost it's makes crazy, it real, isn't it? Isn't we can it? always we can use these as toppers as well so if you're wanting to make the most out of your decollage you could um, pop all your layers onto your cardstock 
and then you can pop those um, um, to just the fronts of your cards and use them as uh, toppers like you would do with any other cards. Mm. So there's lots of different ways in that you can use them, but they are designed um, to be the base layers, which we're then going to stick all of our elements onto. And yes. that's where we're going to come to next. Oh my, now this is all part of the topper yeah. set, isn't these it? These are all so part of those topper sets. So everything we're showing you here, here is going to be included for that price of $29.99. Um, all of these Im images are fully die cut accent foiled throughout God, so tiny bits you've made all those decisions so all you of those tiny elements it. everything is absolutely jam-packed on there um, so all you need to do is pop these out use your foam pads or you could use 3d glue gel um, and then lay them up onto those base layers we've just seen to create the stunning images that we started off the show with where we showed you those decoupages all made up. It's so outstanding. I mean, really, really phenomenal. Um, this is bringing that boat and the fishing trip is bringing back boating Ellie's, memories Ellie's for Ellie. Um, terrible Ellie's memories of, on Lake yeah, Windermere. She's never, they got stuck. Producer Ellie, we can show producer Ellie in a minute. the most funniest <laughs> story ever. When she told me, I was like, how, how did you do that? Like, there's actual boat, oh. like there's actual like things the whole way around <laughs> to show you where you should be driving your boats. Yeah. I still don't know to this day how she did that. No, so, so you produced producer Ellie managed to, to get lost on the boat and did you hear as well she's just, she also managed to crash her golf car I mean in Windermere there we go traumatised I think you should stay away from the lakes really, I think you should Ellie. stay away from anything yeah. that you have to drive just stay here <laughs> yeah. all the time <laughs> this is it these are gorgeous. And um, what's really lovely as well is we can see, if you were trying to do this from those main sort of images yourself, yeah. you'd have to use your dies, you'd have to cut it all out. It would take oh, you'd have to hours cut and hours these and elements. hours. It would oh, yeah. be absolutely crazy to do, but yeah. all of these are perfect. We just need to pop them out, um, layer them all up. The, the work's all be done for yeah. you here. And that's what's perfect about this. Um, collection really we don't have to do anything ourselves really they're done so we've got our toppers we've got our base layers and then we're going to include all oh of your gosh. hard stocks as well oh. so this is our um all printed onto our adorable scoreable so if you want to make your card blanks from this we can do if yeah. you want to be um cutting this out we can do if you want to do fancy folds with these cards we can do that as well even box making you could use these for the tops yeah. of your boxes Pop your decoupage on top of there. It's really good quality it's card. It's great isn't it? quality. Yeah, it's got that um, bendy ink technology on there. So you know that when we're scoring and um, sort of creasing our cards, that you're not going to get any of that white, white base showing no. through. So you got all of this and then all of, all of this. this that's it. Yeah, this is it. It's that's amazing. It. That's all your top. Oh my gosh. But in your bundle, that's everything you're going to yeah. get. So we're going to get the, the decollage collection, which is your base layers, those element sheets, and all those card stocks. Then you're going to get your 36 inserts, <laughs> and then you're going to get your 144 page look. It's, ex it's extraordinary. It's like 252 elements across the whole it's, that bundle. That's it's how many sheets we're going to be getting. With that in mind, right, because, I, and I still have to check this, I still have to double check this. But there's a clock on screen, okay, so many of these are flying out the door. If you've already ordered, if you came in on Tuesday, you want to get more of them because it's, it's just outstanding. It's crazy. You can, yeah. If you craft and you're in a craft club, this is a great way of sort of bulking out those That's and having all of the bits and pieces because you can share it out as well. So maybe there's images that you love and then there's a sport or a hobby that you know someone else loves. We can split this um, up, but it's going to be this price. Yeah. It's it's a huge saving. It's massive it's saving. Madness. Well, just so if you think about the fact that the top is set by itself, twenty nine ninety nine, which is superb because you've got all the everything's die cut, everything's foiled. You've got amazing quality card there as well. So just for this, okay, we're talking twenty nine ninety nine, which is absolutely outstanding. Crazy. Um, but for your little book and the inserts, um, what we're about to do, honestly, it's just. Oh. Ellie's just double Ellie checking Millie. again. <laughs> just double Ellie checking Millie again. Another disaster. <laughs> it could have been. Look. Oh my gosh. I don't. An extra ten pound more, yeah. and you can have everything. Literally everything. It it's... all coordinates yeah. so wonderful together. The only thing that I would suggest that you might want to get so that you can extend your crafting is probably the adorable scoreable. 
Okay, perfect. Um, and we can pop that. That's that on the web for you. It's going to be a match made in heaven because they are all perfect. Shall we see? That's what it. You've colour matched everything, haven't you? I yeah, know. show us what you're going to do. What yeah. sport or hobby are you going to go with? Yeah, for cricket. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Cricket one, first of all. So I'm going to show you. I don't you like cricket. How to make it. this up. Uh, what are we going to do? Let's do it this way around. So I'm going to pop out my base layer and we're going to leave the rest on the side. And then I'm going to take out all of these pieces. Now I've already laid some of them up just for speed. Um, but what I like to do is um, while they're already in mm -hmm. these amazing bases, I like to pop all my foam pads on. Nice. Already. See how so easy all it is to pop them on all there. Oh, I see. Um, so you did that before. Go. Did that before. Um, and then I'm just going to pop this out. It's so easy to just remove these from here. So let's take this piece out. And then they all, you can see that with every single one we're taking out here, it's removing other elements from that main topper image. Oh, yeah. So once I've got all my pieces out, then I like to pop them down on... Um, my sheet here and I like to go from like largest to smallest so obviously that's my base layer which is my largest and then this one comes in we've got a little bit of die cut in there so that one comes in mm -hmm. then we've got that and then is it this one next this one's the next one and then I'm just going to remove this one. So the pieces get smaller and smaller yeah. and smaller as you go see, along. You can see on the back sometimes that there's other elements that can be removed as well, which just gives yeah. it more depth. Um, so that's that one. Then we've got um, this one here. And then all of those sort of centers come out from the um, wicket, the posts. So let's remove I that. like a bit of cricket. And then... I find it quite relaxing. Do you know what? It's the one sport that I cannot actually get into. It's oh, really? Yeah, yeah I, lo I love all different types of sports. Mm. I'm a massive football fan. Oh, always yeah. Always have been. Um, we're not going to talk about it. Okay, team, Rosie. yeah, fair we enough. Can't, <laughs> we can't talk about football teams no, right we now. Can't. We Especially can't, can't not we? mine. Okay. Look, look as Dan just laughs across the room. <laughs> Thanks, Dan. They're winding you up. That's two Dans that have laughed at me today. Oh, no. Nice. It's really mean, isn't it, Jimmy? Uh, Jim, Jimmy, Jimmy, that's went, three. <laughs> Three people. Jimmy's being a little bit more Three people being emailed but. about tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Bullying in the workplace. <laughs> Go on, you're going to tell us who you support now. Um, I support Blackpool. It's my it's my home team club. We may have been relegated at the weekend, but you know oh, what? No, sorry I was, I was really that. proud of them. Well done then. Well done. And look at what happens in football. You just never know. Yeah. Come back. My husband sports Birmingham it's, City, so I mean... He, well, that's even worse. Well, but exactly. we won't talk about that. Our two, our two <laughs> kids absolutely rinse him for choosing to support Birmingham City. Yeah. Well, yeah. sometimes you don't have a choice. It's the way you brought exactly, up. Exactly, exactly. And it's good to stick with them. I think glory so. supporters. No. No. That's it. These guys are just all glory supporters, clearly. This is true. <laughs> so I'm going to pop okay. that on there. So I've gone from all of those different layers and built up that incredible detail. And look how wow. much dimension we have within Gosh. that. So it's now we can. So it's crazy, cool. isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely crazy. So That's let's quick, build too. up our card now. I'm going to make something a little bit crazy here. So let's add this on. We're going to make an 8x8, eight eight, really large okay. card. So I'm going to... What am I going to trim this to? Let's go to... Let's go to 8 and... 8 and a quarter is going to take us just to this lovely border here. And then we'll trim that out there. So we've got that really nice design. And then with this panel here, mm -hmm. I'm going to cut this to just below the 4. So let's go to... Four and three and three and three and three quarters. Mm. And then again, we're going to do that by seven and three quarters so that that fits really nice. Oh, beautiful. On there. Um, and then we're going to bring in the rest of our bits and pieces now. So I've got a piece of eight by eight um, cardstock. Mm -hmm. I've got my eight by eight Marie and I've got my four by eight. Um, uh, Miri slice as well. And then I've also got a piece of acetate. Mm. This acetate is um, eight by nine. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to score down one of those edges 
just by one inch there so we can make an acetate front for our card. It's just gonna add oh, lovely. a really nice point of difference. So let's pop that back in. We'll get our tape ready to go. The acetates work really well with, with your hunky-dory It does and I think when you've got beautiful imagery and artwork like this, it just allows it to give it even more depth to um, your card. So I'm gonna pop this onto my um, my eight by eight mirror, uh, eight by eight ink me here. So this is just from a, a sheet of A4, and I've just cut it down to be able to make my card base myself. Ah, let's nice. do that, and then we are going to stick this on the center. It's gorgeous. Um, if you're just, sorry, I'm transfixed because I love, I just love watching how it all comes together. Um, and I bet you do at home as well. It's gorgeous, isn't it? So if you're wanting to get this collection, and I'm sure that everybody watching the show wants to get this home, if you've already got this collection from the launch, you'll absolutely want to get some more. You don't want to run out of this because the finished results, what you're able to come up with, the cards and the beautiful works of art that you're able to create with this stock is just outstanding. Um, you're getting everything, the little book, the insert, all all of your toppers as well and um, the adorable scorable um, beautiful card stock there as well so you've just got everything at your fingertips ready to go you don't need a die you don't need to, it's all there ready to pop out and just so simple to use and it's here 39 pounds and 97 pence for everything i mean it's just all of exceptional it. all it's of crazy. it crazy so i'm going to place this in giving us a nice sort of gold edge on there Ooh, and then we are going to bring this back in let's get our image here um, so I'm going to place that onto our Miri again, giving that a nice matte and layer. So just lifting up that edging on there. We'll place this onto here. And then we are going to remove this piece and stick this onto the front of our card. Now, if you wanted to hide your workings, obviously, because it's on acetate, um, what we could have done is um, I could have stuck this Miri um, sort of like reverse, pop my mirror onto here and then put my ah, image on top. Okay. And that would have hidden sort of like my tape. Alternatively, we can obviously just go in um, with another piece mm. of cardstock. So I'm going to stick that on there. It looks pretty happy in the background. Ellie's wondering. I'm not sure where it is, Ellie. Might be, oh, might be Ellie. <laughs> Whereabouts this is. <laughs> but you know, hey ho. Um, and then we're going to place this on top. And obviously, I'm going to give myself some. Is this where you spend your It's your Abbey, Sundays? Abbey, Ellie, actually. Um, Tewksbury Abbey, not Cathedral. Oh, it's an Abbey. Yeah, there you go. You know. Let's get this right. <laughs> don't, don't be calling it uh, a, an ab a cathedral. It's an Abbey and a cathedral. That's a good point, actually. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I could tell you exactly what the difference is. Can you tell us the difference? What's the difference between Abbey and Cathedral? My sister-in-law was married at Tewksbury um, oh. Abbey. Yeah, yeah, very beautiful place. Um, listen, just to let you know as well, because we've got a lot of new crafters joining us today. Welcome to Hobby Maker. Um, I'm Rosie. This is Natalie Hello. from Hunky Dory. Um, and you've got a free number here to join us. It's 0800 001 4433. That's completely free. It doesn't matter whether you're ordering from your mobile or your landline, um, but you can dial through. Alternatively, if you want to look on the website, hobbymaker.co.uk, everything is there, good to go, and you can add it to your order. It's only one P&P for the whole day. But look there at what you There we go, we finished that. So oh we've my added gosh. that nice border on top with the acetate, yeah. so it pulls it off from that middle section. And then we've put our beautiful decoupage on there with that just um, really nice sentiment, which says, have a wicked day. Oh, I like it. We love a pun. We love a pun. Story. Yes, we you do. It's fabulous. And I see what you're saying as well. So earlier on, you were talking about those toppers. Yes. So if you wanted to, because you've got the adorable scorable, you could build all yeah. of that straight because on there and got, keep the topper. And that's what's great about our designers. We're thinking about how you can make the most out of your um, collection. So our, the images that are on our cardstock are exactly the same size as the uh, images of our toppers. So this would fit perfectly on there, meaning we can save this base layer. We can use that on another yeah. card. We're making so much out of this collection. Gosh, it's gorgeous. Now, you may do this already, but if you haven't thought, about doing it when you make all your cards you've got a full angel policy haven't full you angel just policy. What that yep. means so that well. means you can make and sell absolutely everything that you've bought from hunky dory um so for people that like make 
cards for craft fairs. You can sell absolutely everything that you okay. make with our products, which is fantastic really, yeah, isn't it? Because really good. you can be able to make um, amazing things, even for using them for charities and stuff like that. Yeah, no matter what you're doing, you're going to be able to make and sell absolutely everything. Oh, it's just incredible and everything you've seen for just 39 pounds and 97 pence which is incredible um think about the value that you're getting with that and how yeah. many different projects you'll be able to make you'll make your money back so quickly if you so, do sell so your quickly. cards especially um, with decoupage i mean um a lot of people who do make and sell always say to us that decoupage are cards that sell out the quickest uh, because they are so stunning they just draw people's eyes to them because of how much dimension is on yeah. the the main images they are phenomenal but this is it i mean look great. at this look at the tennis player just leaping you can it, honestly it looks like he's leaping over the net it it's amazing with that three-dimensional form i'll just show you a few so you can really get the idea because every card you make will be different as well yeah this um, one here uses the um image actually on the front of the card oh, stock so yes. that shows how you can um add it on straight onto the card if you want to i think your scrummies are oh, i like that like the scrum Rugby scrum. Um, Ellie was admiring their muscular legs. Of course she was. Earlier on, of course. Yeah. I'll say it's Adam. There we go. Um, <laughs> here we go. And you've got the football here as well. Man of the match. I like the fact that you've got sentiments like this as well because you don't see things like that. Very yeah, often, they really work perfectly together. And if you've got um, sort of like our essential book of sentiments or maybe some of our relative dies, you can then personalise these as well as using those sentiments. So maybe this is for like your dad who's retiring. Yeah. And that's a perfect way to personalise that by adding in those elements as well. It's gorgeous. A lovely peaceful walk lovely, there. Peaceful and I walk. just love that little touch of gold, you know, because everything's yep. foiled. Everything's it's accent foiled. Gorgeous. So every time that catches the light, imagine the sun moving through the house. Oh, because the cards on yeah. the mantelpiece. It's just going to shimmer and shine. Here's another idea with the cricket as well. So again, you can see just different ways of doing it. Um, absolutely stunning. Um, very good choice of Christmas movie. Ellie has started singing now. We're getting all sorts from the gallery yeah. today, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> She's going, Ellie is in the gallery right now just because of the sparkle going, sparkle and shine from Nativity, <laughs> in case you don't know. There she is. Very jolly today. She's, <laughs> she's always. Always uh, jolly. Do you have a favourite Christmas film? Do, um, in the I love of The Holiday. May. <laughs> The holiday. The hol love oh, the holiday. it is good. It is good. The Which one, the new one or the well. old one? The Jim Carrey, oh, so yeah, okay. The classic. The classic. The classic so I, quite, I do quite like the latest one, the I, cartoon I one. I can't think when it was. It was a couple of months back, actually. It definitely won't have them anymore. But they had, um, do you know the Max Horn that he creates? They had little ones for your dogs. And I oh, really wanted yeah. to buy it for Oscar, and I never did. Oh. So I'm going to have to find one. That's fine. They'll be on, e they'll be on that. They will, that, won't they? It, it, yeah, that I internet site. <laughs> I'm sure. These are just gorgeous. You're gonna have, you have to come and get this, genuinely, yeah. because it's one of those things. You'll be sat at home. And you'll be going, oh, such and such loves. Oh, and if you don't have this at home ready to go, you'll ready be gutted yeah, because it just really you've will. got so much here. And oh, can I just show you the shed oh, this as well? One's incredible, isn't this. it? Yeah. Such a great shape um, that's been created with this, and I think. Oh. It's beautiful. Fussy cut from that cardstock. Oh, yeah. And then no. the card blanks made to fit that shape as well. And that's really uh, clever. He's just living the dream. I know. Hey. Sat in the sun. Having a snooze. I imagine he's got something very, um, he's probably very listening nice to the in cricket. that mug. Yeah. yeah. He might be listening to the cricket on the radio, having a snooze in the sun. I think absolutely gorgeous perfect weekend so lovely i'm getting totally carried away here because i absolutely love this but we do have more for you we i know do. i mean we've brought you so much already um bar ellie my darling which would you like to show next my darling the colored one. Oh, the colors yes. here we go yes so this is go. um a selection that we put together for you guys which we think the colors work perfectly with yeah. this collection You've got so much included in here. We've got 12 colours for you, and you're going to get two of each colour. So that's a whopping 24 sheet pack. Whoa. This is our adorable scrubble. So again, perfect for all of our construction projects, um, but in such a, an amazing shade. I mean, that purple and that red are going to oh, work yeah. perfectly with the um, both the uh, uh, 
football one, your rugby one, and yeah. the horse racing as well. So um, all the colours pick out, don't they? they? Do, so you've yeah. just done it beautifully. It's incredible. Tell us as well, so the adorable score, I mean, you'll know this, if you've used Hunky Dory Adorable Scorable before, you'll know that it is superb. It's perfect. It doesn't crack, why is that? No. What do you manage so, to do? Um, when we were designing this product, we wanted something that you could card make with and you could make fancy folds with, but when you scored it, it didn't sort of like break the card stock, so um, there wasn't any sort of like core colour because obviously this is all white on the base there's no core white cardstock coming through so we developed this um, technology called bendy ink technology uh, which means it gives it that sort of stretch so when we score that cardstock instead of it cracking it's like flexible on top so it then bends and curves around those mm. scores meaning that you get a perfect sort of shop bought finish every single time you use it's this gorgeous product. and this again is what is so special about hunky dory is everything that you create yeah it's it's finished it's ready to go and it's got that really professional finish yeah every time, absolutely it? it's wonderful um it's only 9.99 and that's for um 24 and if sheets you think about it you're saving 10 pounds on your bundle anyway oh yeah so if you're going to buy the bundle at the original price then you may as might as well add this one in it makes sense treat yourself you're it, gonna yeah. be able to make more cards certainly we're true. already getting to oh my gosh because that's like sheets so yeah think about it you can use it alongside your little book to make cards mats and layers with yeah. that um, you're going to be able to use it with your card stock, especially if we're making more from these kits. So like we said before, you can make four cards if you push yourself and use different layers with different things or save mm -hmm. one of your base layers. So you can use this alongside whatever's left from your card stock to make more bigger cards with it. It's just fantastic, isn't it? And I love the choice of colours. You can build colours a bit as well. Um, you can emboss with this as well, can't you? Yeah, yeah, we can run this through our embossing folders. You can use it with the masks we had on earlier in the oh, show as okay. well. So you can run that through and it'll emboss the card stock as well. There's so yeah. many oh. really nice things. It's just amazing. And um, keep on coming through for it you've got it here until the end of the show today as well and don't forget it's only one p and p um when you add through as well now we've got another amazing bundle we for do. you now the big and fabulous thing about the decollage is obviously yeah. you've got these superb three-dimensional images yeah. so you've come up with an amazing solution for we the boxes have to so we've you. got the um we're going to start off with our frames okay. so in this selection you are going to have the ability to make 12 frames okay. um, so we've got squares and rectangles so you're going to get um gold and silver here we've got them for you sorry i'm on a different camera um we've got your rectangles there you're going to get frames you're going to get um sentiments you've got a little stand for your frame to go on as well oh, these are all die cut too so we just pop them out and yeah. um, so we've got them in um gold and silver you're going to get three of each um, wow. and then we also have the square versions as well so our rectangles are five by seven these ones are six by six so you've got them in gold yeah. and silver as well three of each and it's probably a silly question and but then, then do all of the images from your bundle they'll fit onto those sizes, yeah yeah they? they will and they'll fit in really ne neatly and then what you're going to get is these um box frames this one's just been folded together it's not been put together properly i don't think but Amory did show you how to make them up on Tuesday's show if you want to watch that back um, but you get these frames and they basically fold together like this and then you can place these um, beautiful foil borders over the top oh, if you wish nice. so you get all of the the base layers to be able to make those up That's as well so, so we've got your squares and your rectangle um, sort of like base frames and then you get the beautiful um, sort of frames foiled and die cut to go on top of it with coordinating sentiments and stands. It's just a great oh way goodness. to be able to make something. We've got um, so one cool. made up there oh, with yeah. some deco decollage in it, actually. Oh, oh yeah. Really, really nice look. just to show it how um, that works. So that's the box frame. Best and fishes. Then, I know, it's great. Like it? it, like it. Um, it's just superb, isn't it? It's brilliant. And then we've got the boxes And then uh, boxes we've got the box too. envelopes, which is perfect. Ooh. So whether you're making cards or whether you're wanting to, once you've made these, whether you're wanting to then post them and you're thinking, well, how am I going to do that? It's a box. Then we've got these fantastic boxes that fit them absolutely perfectly. Again, square and rectangle. You're going to get 12 of each. You've got 12 frames, perfect amount, match up perfectly. So and again, good. they are so easy to put together £8.99 for these um what was the price of the well the, the frames as well £12.99 um so what are we looking at there nearly £20 for both 20, of them 22 over 20 22 pounds I think but um, yeah we're gonna put this we're gonna do an amazing deal for you um because you can have 
both of them and save some money. Oh, yes, we love yeah, that. They're the an music essential. Paris. And sometimes when we have these in, they're not in for that long. They sort of come and then they yeah. go up dory. So when we have them, you should always, always get them because Definitely. you don't know when you're going to want to use them. They're and they go with all your deco large, don't they? All the deco large you're going to be able to use these with. Yeah, yeah they fit all of yeah. the designs in perfectly. Oh, do you know what? Ellie, Ellie's just saying, yeah, she's, she's got a bit of a dare for you right now. Um, the more of you that put these in your basket, she's not going to drop that price until she can see you there on the phone. We've got lots of you in already. Pauline's there, Jen, Karen, Northamptonshire, Merseyside and Derbyshire. Well done to every single one of you. This deal is bananas genuinely Crazy. ridiculous Crazy. to get all of the boxes there we go um six oh my gosh. saving on that one that's massive that's, that's absolutely huge. mega huge yeah that is so so incredible it is, you're gonna it? get those deals and all of your decolage collections you'll be able to use these with yeah and also i guess if you just so want to more yeah. toppers with your little books to mm. be able to create home decor projects um, not just card makes but it's incredible that yeah. both of the products work together so well you're going to get them both save yourself some money yeah. and they're so handy to use with your decollage too that's it well the box the envelopes I mean they're handy for the cards and then if you ever wanted yeah. to put a gift in with the card yeah. you know like sometimes if you're putting a little I don't know a bit of jewellery or something in yeah, there as well and it just gives that dimension fit that in. we should um, have a little look and see how you do it so this time we are going to make a card and I was thinking of challenging myself actually to be able to Ooh. use the little little book with some of my elements as well so we're oh, going to nice. go with the um skateboarding one and i think somewhere we've got some and there we go we've got some cardstock as well so i've got i have a little bit of cardstock left over that we're going to use okay we've got this image here and i have all i've got um some of our adorable scrubble that we've cut down because this is from the collection but it works so well with these so what my plan is is i want to stick this and i've got two of them but i'm not sure what, which ones we're going to use i want to stick this on here let me just make sure that we've got enough there i think i love the movement in the skater gonna work. isn't it amazing it's incredible. It just like flows yeah. so well. Here we go. I knew I had another piece. So I've got a piece of um, blue um, and this is slightly smaller. It's six and a half by six and a half. Mm -hmm. um, and then I've also got a smaller piece of um, gold mirror, which I think is six by six because this is slightly smaller than six when we are crafting. So I'm just going to stick stick this down first of all so let's pop this out here details on screen right now are for your main bundle okay so if you're wanting to come in and get the sports and hobbies designer deco large ultimate collection and it really is ultimate i mean you've got everything Crazy. um you need here today 39 pounds and 97 pence it's awesome tons and tons of you coming through well done to alexandra rita vivian margaret crafter there as well we've got raymond nita linda lisa jan um we've got jean and jen as well hertfordshire loads and loads of you coming through and listen if you are someone who has crafted lots with hunky dory products before and you absolutely love them message in because yeah. we've got loads of new people watching today as well who perhaps are just sort of thinking oh i don't know i've, I've not used hunky dory before no. you know what's so amazing about it and obviously we're seeing how incredible it is, it's but let's hear from you so as well. so good. So yeah. I'm going to pop, I've just fussy cut out that um, skater there, and then I'm going to go around um, this skateboard because we want to fussy cut this out as well. So I'm going to just add a little bit of um, dimension mm -hmm. on this one. That was a very evil laugh. That was, wasn't you. it? What was that cackle? Was that Adam cackling in there? It, well, that was 100% Liam. Is that Liam in there? If you oh, not, Liam is meant to be on holiday. 100% Liam. Do you know that Liam's not even meant to be in work today? Well, he's a, he's a workaholic. What have you, is that silly strange? What are you going to do? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what, have you had in, what have you had in your tea this afternoon? <laughs> It's all over my card, Liam. He's meant to be. You're meant to be on holiday. Go on, back. <laughs> Go on holiday. Always cause him mischief. <laughs> always, always. I around. mean, that's how fun hobby maker is. Liam was meant to be on holiday yesterday <laughs> and today and tomorrow. And he's been in every day that he's meant to be on holiday. And he's coming in tomorrow as well. 
Insane. Just to throw silly. And he's the manager. He's meant to be the serious one. <laughs> So we managed to get it off. He's not ruined your card. He's not ruined your card. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> you can come and have another go in a minute. Let me make it first. Um, so we're going to pop that on. I need a super, super, Good. super thin foam pad for that skateboard. I think this is going to work really well. Oh, that's nice. Skinny foam pads, aren't they? Perfect. They're really handy. All of our foam pads are available on the website as Ooh, well. So very good. If you want to get your hands on those, you can do. So let's pop this on. So we've created our own like decoupage there with those elements. I think nice. I just need a little bit <laughs> underneath um, here. You're eating silly string now. Don't do that. It's really not. It's not foamy cream. So then we're <laughs> going to take our cardstock and I'm actually going to fussy cut out this um, element here. So I'm just going to go around all of the tall pieces. Oh, nice. In this image, and then I'm going to go all around the other elements. So let's just trim just this out. Just because so many different ways of using this it. This is going to give you the um, really nice skyline. Mm. So just had a little bit more to pop out of there. And then... What city do you think this is? We've had Chooksbury Abbey, we reckon, in the cricket ground. Um, I'm not sure it's quite built up, isn't it? So I'm going to yeah. say somewhere in America, maybe like Chicago or yeah. um, Ellie says New York. I was going to go there. Maybe is that the Chrysler building? Quite, I don't know, yeah, maybe. It's very maybe. similar, actually, isn't it, with that the point on the top? Could be London, maybe. So no, it's that not London. now is going to fit sort of like over here oh, to give us even wow. more dimension in that sort of town. So let's just work out where we need to cut this down. And we can just mark that. I'll mark it with my knife as to where I need to cut that. And then we can bring our trimmer in and sort of layer that up. I might lift that skateboard up ever so slightly so it sits over the top of this now. Because um. I'm going to pop. Let's see if we can lift it off. We should be able to because we placed that quite neatly on there. So let's get my really big foam pads. You can just see as well, you must... It's so easy to just lose yourself in crafting. Oh, I, all the time. I'm just blown away by the the different bits and pieces I can use mm. and how I can craft with this. So that's going to fit on there. And now I can just stick my skateboard oh, over the top wow. there. So it looks like he's skating over that city. Um, oh. And then let's build this up. So I'll pop this onto some, I'll pop some tape onto that. And then we'll stick this onto some adorable scoreboard. So let's pop that onto that blue that we'd cut out before. That's going to sit really nicely on there and just bring in all of those colours. Mm. And then we're still going to put, put some elements on from our main collection as well, nice. just to bring this to life even further. So let's pop that onto some more Miri, just to bring in... Oh, we did. It's so reflective. We it's just like a thought, mirror. Yeah. Mirror okay. finish. You don't need mirrors in your house. Nice. Just buy loads of gold and silver mirror and just stick it on your walls. Wall, you? It would be perfect. Fabulous. Yeah, see yourself all the time. So this is going to go onto a 7x7. Seven seven, so let's stick that on there. And I've cut this slightly smaller because there's quite a lot of white space in here. So it just brings it together having all of those borders going on. And then let's look at this. So I'm going to take the happy birthday sentiment mm. from here. And then I, I love the choice of sentiments. It was just all those different shapes you're getting as well within the it's collection. It's really good, isn't it? I and the speak of the boom box. Yeah. Let's take, I'm going to take a few elements. I think what I'm going to do is layer this up so it still looks like he's Gosh. coming off the edge there. So let's take our second layer, which I think is that one. I missed a layer out there, so I'm building that up every time. And then we're going to go with our sort of like big speaker there. But look how many elements I'm saving. Yeah, so you've I've got those for brought in that um, wonderful mm. image from here. So let's okay. lie these on. We'll go in with our foam pads. Stick this onto that top section. So many really good ways of being able to use this. Has Adam just ordered himself a set of the Miri card, did you say? He quite likes the idea of popping it all around his house and well, seeing. Well, yeah. Seeing his reflection as he moves. Well, you would, wouldn't you? <laughs> so, 
There we Whoa. go. Look at that. That's amazing. I really, really love that. Really fun way of utilising what you have left from like your stash, some elements from the decollage, and then using the little book in a completely different yeah. way to how you would normally see it. This is it, it's super. I really like that. And it's perfect for, you know, your teenage, teenager who loves skating, but equally, if you're of the path, if your partner um, yeah. used to skate back in the day, they still do it every now and then. One of one of my friends at the house still goes down the skate park by <laughs> ours, and he's he's 50, bless him. So, <laughs> I know, well, he's very, he does. I'm very, so I mean, very it's very impressive. I think it's one of those things that once you do it, you're always going to yeah. be, it's always going to be with you, isn't it? This is and it. And you're always exactly. going to be good at it as well. Well, yeah, once you've mastered that skill, yeah. I've never been able to stand on a skateboard. It's just it's something I cannot do. Yeah, it's the, it's, it's the leg and trying is that to do balance? two things at once. I can roll a skate. I can roll a skate, I can roll yeah. a skate and I can ice skate, but yeah. skateboard. No. Just can't do that. I, I, no. I just don't have the, yeah. I, I just, my, my legs go underneath it. me, so it's sort of, you know, you yeah. just, yeah, yeah. Are you a skateboarder? Anyway, Let's um, <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? And just to see the different way of using the little book, remember the little book is still available as well. Um, so if you'd like to add this to your order and get multiples of this, a lot of you have done just that, actually. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, it's just extraordinary. 144, was it 144, 144 sheets? 144 sheets, yeah. Wow, I mean, that's it's just incredible, isn't it? Amazing. Incredible. Yeah, this is why people are buying multiples um, of the little book because you might want to have one to keep, one to use, one to gift. You might want to have them for different projects. Yeah. Um, really handy to take away with you as well. Yeah, if you it? want to craft on the go, you absolutely can yeah. do as well. Absolutely. They're just gorgeous. Um, keep on coming through for this as well. Now, we've got another little bundle. Is that right? Oh, I see. Oh, Sorry. Right. Okay. Yeah. Got you. Got you. Um, we're going to recap exactly what is in the main bundle that we brought to you in the show today. And it is extraordinary. So we've looked at the little book. That's part of the bundle. Um, we're going to bring you the toppers as well. So here are the toppers. Okay. Individually, they are really, really limited. So if you're wanting to get the toppers on their own, um, they are very, very limited now on the web. Um, and there's 29 99 you're getting an awful lot here because they're all foiled, you've got all the different elements, you've got all the different parts to deco uh, page on as well. Um, and they're just, I mean, look at that. The fishermen, it all comes to life, doesn't it? The details are extraordinary. It's crazy how much really you beautiful. have within these images. It's got a good swing, hasn't it? It has. There we go. Perfect stance, there we go. Really fantastic. I like crazy golf. And I don't, get, I don't mind going to a golf range, actually. You know, when you just go and oh, yeah, yeah, pick yeah. the balls. Just Yeah, it's quite fun. Why does it hurt you? It's what, quite strange. What are you doing? If you, don't do it, if, if you don't do it all the time, I can yeah, see no, where you're coming true. from, Ellie. No, it's true. That's true. <laughs> um, I love the barbecue. Have you had your first barbecue of the year yet? We haven't yet. Oh, we haven't, no. Could this weekend be the weekend? Quite possibly. Quite possibly. Have you had a barbecue yet? I love, there's a really gorgeous um, example of this, actually. You can see it come to life she says try not to knock them all over here we go um so you can see how then it translates oh can, yeah this is really amazing good, isn't it? there's so much dimension within wow that. you've got all the little um burger buns all of the um all of those small sort of like food elements yeah. are all decoupaged as well the dimension in this one is crazy so cool. even the smoke coming off the barbecue it just is fantastic i mean gosh what are you going to sell that for in a craft fair i as know well? isn't yeah. it then that's the thing there's so much time and all of those elements that yeah. go into this kit it's amazing i've even shown you everything gosh you've got so much here and that's not all because you've also got the incredible adorable scorer ball yeah um, coordinated to go with all of those images fabulous. got all of that and then you insert oh here we go which is the best way there we are you can see all of the details in there as well Crazy everything amount. um just superb that's 29.99 you want to get extras of this as well, really, don't oh, you? Oh, yeah. Because then you've yeah, got... And you can do, you can do yeah. that. That's it. Um, but then the final piece of the puzzle with this bundle is your inserts. That's it. 36 of these. Um, one design for each 12 of your toppers. And they're beautifully muted. And you're going to get three of each. So when we're talking about being able to make loads of cards with these, then you've got one for each on here. 
There we go. They're just wonderful. Um, oh, gorgeous. Um, was that a lovely message from Rosemary and Kent? Anita, Kathleen, Greater London, Pembrokeshire's there as well. Lots and lots of you coming through. So you've got three of each design there, all for 9 99 and it's just absolutely brilliant. Again, I think insert's another one, isn't it? You want to have yeah, you want to have extras in there, really. More of that. Um, so for just £10 more than your toppers, okay, you can get everything. So the little book, the inserts, the toppers, the adorable scorable. Um, and I'm missing something. No, that's it. That's it, isn't it? It's you amazing. Your it's and your full absolutely topper fantastic. But I feel like because it, the topper it's collection is massive, that's why. It's you've huge. got your inserts, you've got all yeah. of that cardstock, you've got 24 sheets of cardstock, you've got 12, uh, 24 base layers, and then you've got um, 24 element sheets. So if you yeah. think about it that way, there's a huge amount that you're getting huge in this collection. Huge amount, yeah. It's madness. Absolutely phenomenal. Um, we've got loads and loads of you still coming through. I mean, the elements that you're getting within this is extraordinary. And then, of course, you've got your little book with 144, 144 elements in here anyway. In. It's just superb. Um, it works out at around 252, I think, because wow. your base layers are on one sheet each. So yeah. you've got 12 of those. Then you've got your 24 elements, 24 card stocks, 36 oh inserts, 144 pages in your little book. I'm sure it's about 252. That's quite positive. For 39 pounds and 97 pence. That's sheets yeah. worth of card making. That's it is. crazy. It's sheets and sheets and sheets of, of cards, of wall art. I mean, gosh, it's so yeah. exciting. So it's down to you then what you do with it and it how is. much you can make with them. Now we've got, and I know you like a challenge, okay. so we have seven minutes Let's and we, you can do a card in that time, can't you? I'm sure I can. No problem. So we've got a six by six. Um, we gave, you gave me like a, oh, yeah, a storage box. Yeah, yeah, it's a storage box. But do you know what? You raised the challenge and I you did, did it marvellously. I, I tried my very best. Yeah, you did it super. So perfectly. we've got, um, I've taken one and a quarter, uh, one and a half off the edge of our card there, which gives us that nice section. And then I'm going to bring in my card stock here. Mm -hmm. And I'm just going to cut this ever so slightly smaller. So we're going to go two notches under the five, uh, under the four and a half. Um, and then we're going to trim this out here as well. I should have taken my um, my full piece off there first, but then we're going to also trim our border because we want to take this out. If you'd have done this first, you would have wasted less. So if you trim your border okay. and then you trim your other panel, you'll waste less of this, so you'll be okay. able to use more of it up. Um, so let's just cut that down there as well. People are multi-buying this bundle. I'm not it's surprised. worth noting. I mean, it's superb, isn't it? And you will use it. This is the thing. You're going to use it and keep coming back to it. And so it is a good idea to get a couple. If you're able to do that, I think it's really wise, actually. I know. And I mean, all of these different sports and hobbies, we all know people who love yeah. these crafted... Uh, love doing these sports, don't we? I mean... Absolutely. Father's Day is nice. Father's Day is around the corner well. as well. Yeah. So you've got something... If you're making to sell, I mean, get when you've got this at home... Craft to your heart's content and then, you know, you've still got time to sell all of your amazing products before Father's Day comes around. Yeah. Oh, it's so let's great. trim, take this off. We're going to stick this onto our lovely little panel here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to stick this on the inside of our card. Oh. So we're going to stick this into that um, piece that we've just cut away. So let's pop that in there. You've got that gorgeous um, sort of argyle pattern. If you oh, grabbed our magazine as well that we sold yes, on Tuesday, you've got the embossing folder. folder, which matches that pattern. So you oh, I loved um, the effect with, with the this. embossing with the card as well. It's really good, isn't Sanding it? Sanding it off. It just brings it to life. So we'll pop that on here like so and then we're not going to use a base layer for this card we're actually just going to use some of these smaller elements so okay let's take him out of here so we want the elements that don't have the green sort of areas on okay. so we'll add that one there we'll take this large section here with the the t let's try and get that out without bending it and then the golf buggy as well so let's take that out you can really see the benefit as well of putting those foam pads on the back no. first and just and you can so build speedy. it onto the page it is it's super quick isn't it super super speedy it's so a good one to take if you're going away actually isn't it probably you know, is yeah because there's trip. not that much more that you need apart yeah. from like your collection foam pads scissors yeah um and you're 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 away so let's just stick that on we'll make sure that it's straight and we're going to go directly onto our cardstock here so let's pop 
that on there and then we're going to stick this one on. Add that on there. And oh, then look at that. We'll go in Just with the depth it gives us. This. And that foiling, so that foiling mm. is incredible. I say it makes it so easy because you're not having to cut anything out. You're not having nope. to worry about that. Everything's it's all done die cut for you. So we're not having to like worry about if we can cut these elements or if we've got time to do this because we absolutely know that we can. So many happy returns is going to go up there and we're just going to finish that off with some gemstones. So oh, I'm going to nice. go with my gold because that is um, the top colour on all of the foiling. Obviously, Beautiful. if you wanted to, with your cards that you're going to make with your little book, we could do those with silver mirror. We could use our coloured mirror. Oh, We've got an incredible mirror show um, coming up over the weekend um, on oh, Sunday. Nice. Um, I mean, we're talking brand new sizes of mirror, <gasps> extra large sizes of mirror. Sizes of mirror we've never seen before. That is a very exciting indeed, very exciting. So. That looks awesome. So simple, yeah. we've not used all of those layers, so we've still got these layers that we can add onto our base yeah. layer, and that's another card there, and then we've got our other another base couple of layer cards, isn't that it? we can use for with other card stock, so yeah. at least three more cards we can make out yeah. of that kit. It's absolutely incredible. I mean, this is, it's got to be one of the best value bundles. Oh, I think so, ever. It's, ever. it's madness. It is. It's, a, it's amazing. So when are you back, Natalie, on um, Sunday? I'm back on Tuesday. You're back on Tuesday? Yeah, I'm back on Tuesday. Kat's here on Sunday. I'm back on Tuesday and Thursday next week. Amazing. Well, we should look forward to seeing yeah, you then. I'll Thanks you so then. much for all of this and your amazing demos. Um, and do you know what? It's just been the most exciting day all around, hasn't it? And we've got a brilliant show. Keep on checking out on this fantastic bundle. But if it's bundles you love, um, and Corin has got some incredible things coming up for you right now from Crafters Companion as well. And do you know what? Some things actually I've never seen before. You're going to be in for a treat. You're yeah. love some of these. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. It's really cool. Are you going to stay and watch as well? I and absolutely have a go. love these stamps and dies. I think they're the best. The little wheel surprise ones yes. are my favourite. It's really, really good, isn't they it? They are really, so really good. There. Um, <laughs> <laughs> right, we've got the Crafters Companion um, Super Show coming up right now as well with lovely Corrin. So we'll see you. I'll see you on Tuesday. Yes, and will. I'll see you right after this. Here at Hobby Maker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. My name is Anne-Marie and I am the creative manager at Hunky Dory Crafts. Hunky Dory are the UK's premier paper craft manufacturer and we design and manufacture all of our paper craft goodies back at home in Preston. We do lots of paper craft products as well as Moonstone dyes. We have our prism range of colouring mediums like watercolour pencils, alcohol markers, water brush pens and we also have our very own range of stamps called For the Love of Stamps. We're really looking forward to bringing you all of our brand new product launches as well as our inspirational demonstrations which we just know the audience love. Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. 
Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? Welcome to Hobby Maker. I'm literally so excited about this collection, Karen. I've never seen anything no, like it before. It's absolutely amazing, isn't it? It's our, yeah. our wheel dies. They are brilliant, aren't they? It's absolutely so good. fantastic. What we're going to do, yeah. we're going to bring in the graphics track because these hours just fly by. So we're going to get stuck straight in. Okay, so you've got two smaller bundles. We're going to bring in the top bundle, not at fourteen ninety seven, which is amazing actually because these are really impressive dies. Um, so you've got three dies, the three dies on the top here. Okay, all three of them for nine pounds ninety eight. Oh. Cool. Three pounds thirty a set. Right. You wait till for what twenty-eight you see. elements. Yeah, you wait till what you see. Are you going to get loads? Oof, that's brilliant. It is. Oh my it goodness is. me. Yeah. Now you can come in for that smaller bundle at nine pound ninety-eight, and you're getting a superb deal. It's absolutely brilliant. And um, so you're going to get the speech bubbles. You're getting sweet delights. And from the heart as well. So you've got these gorgeous sentiments um, to go with them. Just really, really beautiful. Um, we've got another bundle um, of three sets for you as well. So we're going to match that same incredible deal for the bottom three here as well. I mean, look at the elements. You're getting 29 elements all together here. And this is for Absolute Star, Dreamy Cloud and Festive Balloon as well. They're gorgeous, they aren't are. they? They are. There's loads of lovely stamps and dyes to go with them as well. It's now, really if you want, I'm going to go oh. this way and say, if you want to make the reveal the wheel yeah. and you don't already have it, then you need the dice set you've got on the end this, this one, one here okay yes so, so the that main is going to is in. A, that is going to be the one that make, makes it all work for you everybody is so excited about this because this wheel this reveal wheel is just awesome yes. um because so you if you've have ever so wondered fun. how to make no. reveal wheel cards uh -huh. i'm going to show you and it really is super simple is it because it i just do you know what? I just you look at it because it looks so professional. It looks yeah. so fun and so brilliant. You just think at home, oh, I could never do that. Yeah. But this, you can yeah. really do it. You really you? can. You really can. And we're going to make it make it really simple as well. Oh, I'm so excited! And guess what? Right, forty nine pounds and ninety three pence. Bearing in mind, you're going to get all six of those amazing dies that we've just shown you. Okay. And you're also getting this absolutely essential part of the kit. You're getting the die for the wheel. Well done, Eddie. That's exactly what you need to do. Come in quick and quick, um, quick as you like, because I tell you what, the deal on this is superb. 
0800 001 0433 is your free number. So do make sure you dial it through quickly. And of course, if you've already opened up your order here today, 3.95 for your postage packaging. You're not having to pay any more, which is wonderful. Um, £49.93, superb deal, but we are not stopping there. Uh, well done, Eddie. Christine's there, Patricia's in, Jessica's. Oh, this is going to absolutely fly out the door, Corinne. Everybody's loving is. this. Um, oh my gosh, I'm just... Right, look, the Christmas wheel, you've got balloons, you've got... Oh, it's wonderful. <gasps> look at the fun. This is just great. Look at the colours as well, the polka dots. Oh my goodness, you're going to have endless fun. Should we spin the wheel? Here we go. Oh, terrific. Have a terrific, have a terrific birthday. Have a great birthday. Great. Have a brilliant birthday or have a fabulous birthday. Oh, Isn't that amazing. absolutely lovely? How have we just done that with the price? We've literally half the price. We've slashed that price in half. It's That's, brilliant value. It's, it's, it's incredible. amazing value. What's it say? 72, 72. bundle. Oh, wow. Okay. That's extraordinary. Um, in fact, it's so good. People are now multi-buying. Eddie's just gone for two. I don't blame you. It's such a brilliant opportunity. So this is the way to get all six and the big die for your spin the wheel as well. Um, and it really is. Corinne, you're telling us this is easy to do. It is. I trust you. Thank you. Um, and we're going to have a watch and we see are, what we you are. do. Right. I'll just quickly show you what you're going to get so everyone knows. This is the, the bigger, the big die set. So this is the one, and I can't... That it's been travel there we go because they've been squashed this is the one that turns so you're going to get the die that's going to cut the aperture out and the the finger notch so to speak you're going to get the die that's going to cut the wheel you're going to get all of these lovely stamps as well you're going to get little you know arrow stamps and everything like that so that's in that sentiment one then in the other ones you're going to get the die that's going to cut a balloon aperture if you'd rather so you yeah. can have those and then you can you know you've got this and i love these sentiments so what they've done is what can you see they they fit the shape of the aperture so for this oh, one can you see yeah. how it's slightly curved so it works really really well it does do it these are just being um there we go i can't do that there we go fantastic and everything so you get in all of those so that is in the festive balloon then you've got the dreamy cloud. So look at that, isn't that lovely? Oh, so you it's can see. Gorgeous. And again, it works exactly the same. The star, which is absolute star. So you've got all of those. You've got all the sentiments, the star aperture. Don't worry, I'm going to show you how this little piece works in a minute. Okay. You've got the from the heart. And again, it still works in exactly the same way. And oh. you're not going to make a mistake on where to put your stamping. It's really, really easy. Then you've got your sweet delight. Now, I might not have these boards in the size, in the way of the bundles, but don't worry about that. But again, look at that. You've got the sweet aperture and look at how the sentiment fits Just really, perfect. really perfect. The fonts are great as well, aren't yeah. they? You've got so much choice. And speech like, bubble. Yeah. But there is no reason why you can't mix and match the sentiments. Ah, with oh, the so they'll all work together. I think, yeah, I think, yeah, with injuries. I would just say try it on a piece of copy of paper first. Yeah, yeah. But I think most of them will mix and match around. So don't worry about that. Isn't it fantastic as well, do you know? Because look at how special these cards look. If you're selling at a craft fair, or oh. you, I mean, it's just going to make your cards stand out, it is. isn't it? It really Perfect. is. It really is. Right, so let's crack on really quickly because I want to do this and I've got some other ones I want to show you. Oh, yeah. So I have got a piece of multi-purpose card. Mm -hmm. Where's my step? Here they are. And I'm going to cut oh. out my... Sorry, I just saw a little butterfly on here. It's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, oh. <laughs> It's just that they're so many surprises. There are. This is what's gorgeous. There are. Right, so I'm going to cut out this large wheel and the small wheel and we need both of those cutting out like that and i'm just going to put a tiny little piece of tape right. okay do you know what i thought i'd just been and washed all the ink off my hands now normally you would put magnetic shims on but i find if i don't want my card to, the, the pressure in the gemini is so strong my machine okay. at home i take my magnetic shim out most of the uh, time okay because then you don't put as much pressure on your card stop okay. i find i get a crisper i'm going to look through that apps i mean there's nothing wrong oh, with that cut, that. is there? Yeah, but I've not got any wrinkling. Right you know, sometimes when you um, you say, oh, I'm getting the imprints of your mats, or you get a little bit uh, of pressure. Yes. It's just because the pressure is so intense, which is okay. what we give you so that you can oh. do those delicate. Sorry, Corinne. Um, look at the multi-buying situation oh, going yes. on here. 
Eddie's bought four here. Um, I think there's a lot of gifting going on. I think so there is. If you know a card maker, if you know somebody who loves to craft, this is literally going to make their day. It's like best gift ever. Because it really it is. Because it just stands out so It really much. is. Okay, and so the next thing I need to do is I need to do my top layer where I'm going to have all the elements in it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my ruler and I'm going to get my... Um, my pencil and I'm just you can do it either way so this is uh, just shy of five inches so I can pop this like here and I can mark the two I want to do it down the side so let's just mark the two and a half inch down the side mm -hmm. so there is two and a half inches just there don't worry that piece is going to be cut out That's so all I'm going to oh this is our color mark. your world so all I'm going to do is put that in there and can you see there's a little mark it's just oh, tiny yeah. in there. So it's going to be, like I say, it's going to be cut away. So you don't need to worry about that. And that's just going to give me my finger notch. And then the other thing I need to do is to put this one in the centre. And I'm going to do this with pencil so that I can rub it out at the end. And I'm just going to go across there and I'm going to put a little mark just there. Let's hope I've marked it in the right place. And a little mark. Oh, I might just, oh, not quite, just a minute. I just need to, I'm trying to be careful and I'm doing it a little bit too light. There we go, so that, so there's my centre, just okay. there. And I've got a rubber, and when I've finished, let's just rub out most of that. There we go. I just want to keep the least in. So all I'm going to do is I've got the aperture. So this is out of the sentiment one, but I could use any of the others and they all work the same. There's okay. your die, and there, there's no die on there. Ah. So you've got those little lips, and I'm going to put that on that center point. Can you see on there? So that's that little center point that I marked. Now, so that's not gonna cut no, that that's card, not gonna is cut. it? What I meant to say to you as well, and I forgot is, on the back of here, look, it says there are full instructions. Ah. And what you're gonna get is this. Oh, you get all of that with it as well? Yeah. Well, this is what you download. Yeah. I downloaded okay. mine and printed it off so you can oh, that's see. Good. And those are your full instructions. So you're going to be able to... Oh, go the right way. You're going to have full instructions. That's like having me or one of our other crafters with you yeah. showing you exactly what to do. So it tells you what size you need. You know, it tells you everything you need to do. So, you, it? you know, there might be, we might do it slight little tweaks depending on who's doing it. But, you know, and again, I'm not even putting my magnetic shim in because I don't want to risk crease. That's, that is the very yeah. top piece of my paper. It's like the top layer. I don't okay. want to risk creasing it by no, putting a lot of pressure in. And I can almost guarantee that... Yep, straight through, look. Straight through. Straight through, and it's not left any marks. It's not pushed my tape in. You know, sometimes when we use low-tack yeah. tape, you think, gosh, that's low-tack tape. But it's still really pushing down yeah. onto the card. But no. Did you get to know your machine then with that? So you sort of do a bit of trial and error, yeah. and you'll get to know what works with your machine. Yeah. and exactly. What like. Exactly. It, it? The more, and is it one of those things, is the more you practice? Yeah. Again, the better yeah. 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 So what I'm going to do Practice. then is, oops, I'm going to take the, I can't pick it up, silly TV nails that we have on. So I'm going to take that circle that I die cut with it, you know, because I've got a large one and a small. Oh, and yeah. I'm just going to put a couple of foam pads on the back of there. Now, the only thing you're going to have, apart from your cardstock, the only thing you need to make sure you've got is some split pins. Ah, okay. Yeah, Gosh, make sure you've got some split pins. have seen those for years. Don't you? Oh, I remember brands, using them in, in Brads, we call them, or split pins. Split pins. I think oh, in crafting, the they're now called brads. Brads. Yeah. As in Brad Pitt, brads. Brad. Well, it's not after Brad Pitt. Not but, after Brad yeah. Pitt, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know. But split pins. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, I have to always have to think this through. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and I'm going to put it through that way. So from the foam pad out. Nice. That is a fancy split pin. It's like got a nice little pastel colour. Yeah. They just used to be brass, didn't they? Yeah. I remember making a little Santa one year in school. Yeah. Little dangly legs. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn that over. There's my centre point. I'm going to put my... Brad, just that. No, what have I done wrong? I know what I've done wrong. I should have put it. Just a minute. This is where I always have to make sure I'm going the right way. So that goes on. Has that cut that out? That's cut that out at the right place. Why am I not sticking that on in the right place? Because I'm not doing it on the wrong right one. It should be 
on my cardstock in the centre. There you I go. I see, I like this. Yeah, there you go. That's why we like those instructions as well. I'm going in the wrong one. And do you know, I, we make these. Now, I don't have to worry about this not showing. So that's going to go on there. Oh, I didn't need to draw that quite so far, did I? Think it through, can't right, there we go. So that's going to go on there. I'm going to do exactly what I was about to do before. I'm going to put it on this side, split pin in the center, and then I'm going to pop that on to there. So uh -huh. all that's doing is it's elevating. So what I'm going to do then is when I put, once I've stamped on this, I'm going to put that through there. So yeah. that this effectively is attached to there. Okay. And that's anchoring it down to the base. But because it's on a split pin, it'll you can still move rotate. It. So can you see that's all I've done? I don't need I can do that early because that's not coming out. Yes. It's fo this foam pad's under there. So oh, just perfect. get that bit done as soon as you can. Gotcha. Sorry about that. I just had a no, it, do you moment know what, actually. I think it's really helpful to see that, to be honest, because we all do it. Can you see my we? brain going <gasps> quick, 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 quick? Yeah, but you did it yeah, and you very calmly then just popped it right. And I mean, you can do something for years and years oh. and years, and then suddenly, you know. Yeah. So it's, it's helpful, isn't it? It is. Okay, so, okay. so the next bit I'm going to do is I'm going to stamp my sentiments. So now I need to make sure that when I put this through, they're going to line up with there. No. Now, I don't attach it and then stamp through the aperture because that's what I would do. I would put it on and then stamp through the aperture. Then I know it's going to be. But we've got a simpler way of doing that. Oh, OK. So I'm going to pop this onto here mm -hmm. and I'm just going to pop my I'm just going to put my um, magnets right on the outside. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these and I've got my now these are my sentiments. Now, can you see they're on little cheeses? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Can you see the stamps? Now, there's Ooh. a definite reason for that. So what you do is you take that one, you line it up to the centre, yeah. and then you make it parallel with that little notch. Okay. So everything is there oh. for a reason. Yeah. I mean, this is what's incredible with, with Crafters Companion. You know, everything is designed by crafters. So anybody who's getting into crafting for the first time or um, joining in after years of experience, everything's thought out. Yeah. You've thought of everything. Exactly. So you put these on in any order. So again, basically, I'm lining it up with there and then I'm just dropping it down to the center. So the point of my cheese is at the center point. Yep. Yeah? And that's all you need to do. And so all I do is line it up to there and then take it down to the center. Do you know what? <laughs> the chat in, right? <laughs> <laughs> I was I like, should we, should we talk about this or shall we just carry on and say, right? Ellie is, is, <laughs> she is, she is beautiful. She is so wonderful, but, isn't oh, she? She's, she's, I think it's, <laughs> how many cheeses can Ellie name? I know. Well, as soon as she said cheese, she was off. And then, then we've had three. Three camembert, camembert <laughs> blue cheese. Do you like blue cheese? Oh, no, not? that's the one cheese. That I want. Oh, same as Ellie, you see. No, I love blue. blue cheese. Blue cheese yeah. and a um, bit of Stilton on a, on a digestive biscuit. And a little glass of port. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Gorgeous. The thoughts we have when we're crafting. <laughs> right, I'm going to pick up those. I can pick them all up. You don't have to do If you're going to do it this way, you don't have to do them individually. Oh, dear. You are. Never change, Ellie. Please. Never change. Never she's, change. She's wonderful, isn't she? She's never super. change. There we go. Right, so I'm going to ink girl. that up. And then I'm going to pop that back. Make sure I put it back the same way as I did it. There we go. That's perfect. And then all I need to do is pop that down. And in theory, because I actually put mine in the centre, if I had put it in the centre correctly, I could have turned that anyway round and it uh, shouldn't have lined okay. up. Yeah. So there, I can pop that on. I'm doing it on the stamping platform, so if I haven't printed anything, there you go. Look at nice. that. There we go. So that now has stamped all of my sentiments. I'm so excited to see this. I, honestly, I think this is one of my favourite ever die and stamp sets. Is it? Yes, because it because it, you're doing so. I love yeah. cards where you get to do so something. So we're going to drop have that play. on there. You know, it's good. Just like that. Mm -hmm. Sorry, can you see? Just drop oh, that yeah. on there. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And then I'm going to do it now. If I could give anybody a top tip, it oh, would yeah. be don't don't do don't do the split pin so tight you know if okay. you're doing it on a document you do yeah, it so what we need we need to make sure it's got we need to make sure it's not going to wobble too so much give it a spin yeah so give it a spin you... and make sure it still spins round so you, you can see me right what you've done for now <laughs> no. so you can see it's elevated oh let me go the right way oh, it's yeah. elevated off the card with that i'm sorry i just turned that and it just did it there you go you can see it's it's never going to touch the back so it's always going to spin 
Beautiful. Just above there. It's like a little there record go. player at the moment. It is, isn't it? it? Let me just rub off those. There we go. Right. So then this other one that I have just done here, this one is going to go just there. Now, I did one. Ah, I've done it this one here. There we go. I have put my foam tape on. Now, okay. again, it shows you exactly where to put your foam tape. Look. Oh, brilliant. So, so we've gone gonna... to that level of detail. I've put mine slightly okay. different. I've just put mine... So it's going around the edges. As long as it's far enough away from the wheel. Yes. So it's not you don't want it to be the catching the wheel, do you? Okay. So this is going to go on here. Now, People are this, checking out left, right and centre here. It's th so popular. This bit is the same for whichever one you're doing. Okay. So obviously the thing that would change would be the sentiments on your wheel and the aperture shape. Sure. Okay. So, yep. Yeah, but what I've done here... But the process. That process okay. will apply... For them all. So oh, well, that makes exactly life easier same. as well, yeah. doesn't it? And then all I need to do is I just need to make sure I've lined, I've got a little mark in the centre, make sure that's lined up, and then I can put that on it. So I've just put my foam tape on so that that now will still. There we go. Can you see? That's there we go. brilliant. Now, then once you've got to that point, what are you going to put it on? Are you going to put it on a card? Is this going to be on the top of a box? Oh, is it going to be? You know what I mean? Is yeah. it going to be whatever? This. Yeah. So effectively, I've made a topper. I've made a spinning wheel topper, and then you can just have lots of fun with it. Yeah. So I've got some tent fold it's cards just again. The best card, isn't it? It I is. Just, it's so much gorgeous. fun, isn't it? Some yeah. more papers from um, from your. Um, Colour Your World collection. Yeah. So I'm just doing this. Look at the lime green. It's beautiful. It's so so vivid, zesty isn't it? and bright, isn't it? It's yeah. Lovely. So you can do... Doesn't it make it... Do you know what? It really does make a difference to how you feel as well, doesn't yes. it? Yes. Colour is everything. It is, isn't it? Gorgeous. You can't look at that and not smile. You, you can't, just, no. Just feel good. There we go. This is... Oh, what's that fancy little one? Um, it's not, it's just a brayer. It's just a regular brayer. But anybody that's watched me yeah. on Crafters TV will see that when I do my mats and layers, I often brayer them. Good idea. It smooches out the glue underneath. Yeah. And it just makes them stick. Sorry. I've, I like I actually, them. I, I just, use those for, um, what's it, it called? It's an inking for, brayer. Yeah. That's what it is. Yeah, but good. I just like to... It's a really good tip. I do it all the time, especially when I'm at home, always. Yeah, now, somebody that. has just asked, where yes. do you get the instructions? If you buy... When you buy it, it's printed on the back of your pack. So rather than giving it... You, know, okay. you just go to the, the address that's on the back of your pack. It's on every pack. So if you buy in the big bundle with yep. all seven in, you're going to get seven. You're going to find it on there. there. So you're never um, going to lose it. So, brilliant. yeah, so just so it's on the Crafters Companion website and the full address is on there. Nice. So Thanks gonna, for your question, Corinne. That's, yeah, really important. There we go. There we go. So, yes, it's, it's there. No one... You know, I'm not... It's not that... You're not going to get it, but you're going to find yeah. it when you get there. So once we've got that, I can open that up and pop that one onto my card. So it's look, it's oh, still turning. Fabulous. Now, the other thing I have done, just for a bit of speed, so we can get through a couple of demos, is from this set... Uh-huh. No, it's from... Oh, I... We're going to go... To, so from the main set, I've, yeah. t I've stamped out the Have A... Birth. And then we're going to look at this in a minute, but we're going to, from our reve other reveal set, we've got Reveal the Gift, which has got some balloons in. Oh, yeah. So I've just stamped them, and all you get in this one, we'll go to this one in a minute, is you've got the stamp here, and then you've got the die there as well. So you've, oh, you've got those. So just to show you, this is what I would do for this. So I'm going to put have a, and I love how it's split so that you can then put it to whatever you want it to be. You have this one here, and you have that one there. And then I'm gonna get my lovely balloon, give it a little bit of a shape. Just colored it with my alcohol pens, just to give it a bit it's of shading. Gorgeous. There we go, and how about just like that one? Isn't that easy? It is absolutely beautiful. It's having the right it. tools, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, that's it. And it just, it makes your cards yeah. even more of a gift and yeah. just so much 
fun. Yeah, that just turns like that. Oh, now, you could it. do it. There's another way you can do it. So you can have the brad at the front. But I wanted to do it. I thought I'd do it as the instruction showed us and have the brad hidden. I love it. I just think it's so beautiful. And I love as well, I mean, all the examples you've brought with you, Corinne. Can I do this lovely one from Christmas, which is really cute. It's showing yeah. you some stamped little pictures in there as well. Have a look at this like, little surprise. If you go round, hugs. Love. Santa! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I just love these little surprises. You can have some. I mean, we're giving fun. you stamps. Yeah. But they, so you remember what I said about doing um, stamping onto it. So what you could do uh -huh. is you could mark the centre. I've got my centre point here. Uh -huh. So what you could do is mark your centre point put it onto here yeah. and whichever window you're using. So that's my center point. Yeah. I you, any stamp that you've got that fits through the aperture of your choosing. So put a brad in, you know, your, your little split pin in to hold it. And then as, if it fits in there, yeah. it'll, then turn it a bit further and put another one in. And you're good to go. So, oh. I mean, we put four in, one in each quarter, but you could easily get six in. Yeah, you Easily could, get you? six in. You and like you say, it, um, it could be, um, it, you could make, oh, wouldn't it be lovely? Um, like a little birthday gift. Oh. You could put, you've, you know, your gift is, and then we could. Oh, that's could nice. You could around. reveal a little bit of a surprise. Yeah. yeah, I love that idea. And yeah. um, we've got a gorgeous message. Oh, I can't wait for this to arrive. My granddaughter will love it. And that's Elaine in Chile. Oh, I'm glad, Elaine. We'd oh. love to see what you make with your granddaughter. Absolutely. Share your makes. Well, you share your makes with us and let us know. I mean, it's just beautiful, isn't it? Listen, if you'd like to come on in for this, CB2006, okay, that's your product number. Make sure you're dining quickly. It's hugely popular. We've got people multi buying as well. Karen's gone for two, Craft has gone for two as well. There's a lot of gifting going on. Um, I think what you said there, Elaine, as well, about crafting with your granddaughter. I mean, it's just such an amazingly fun and exciting project to get into. And you're going to come up with all these wonderful ideas. And of course, you've got Corin, you've got Crafters Companion um, for inspiration as well. There's tons of ideas on their website. Right. We've got a little bit of a crazy deal about to happen. And I need to just explain what's because this is Basically, this set, okay, and this type of window, um, this window reveal was massively popular. Um, it was a huge sellout. And in fact, the window reveal has actually sold out, hasn't it? It has, um, Corinne. But what Corinne has done with Crafters is they've made all of these amazing sentiments and dyes, which you absolutely loved with the window reveal. Um, they've given you all of this today. And genuinely, I've never seen anything like it. The deal is extraordinary um ellie is now triple checking <laughs> she double checked it before we came to her today and she's about to check it again because she doesn't quite believe what does it say on the paper i mean it is ridiculous and she's just checking it again she doesn't believe you're not sure do you want to come out and double check do you want to come and run it back <laughs> got 40 she's she does well, check it on the system. Put it here. this way: everybody's gone home. I have seen Liam leave. I've seen Andy leave. Well, this is true. So whatever you do, Ellie, it's fine. Your secret's it's fine. safe with us. Your secret's safe with us. Yeah, We're not telling you won't tell, will you? No. no, they've gone home because they've all. Been, we've been chatting do and talking, and they've all gone home. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Go on, Ellie. She's not doing it. She's not doing it. She's gone. You've got to do it. Go on. That's ridiculous. That's absolutely phenomenal. £17.48 and you've got one, two, three, four, five, six incredible die and stamp sets, okay? Amazing, amazing deal. Um, really, really fantastic. Um, the phones have gone berserk, so <laughs> <laughs> I mean, probably is completely wrong that we've done it, but you know what? We've done it now. Yeah. No going back. So just come and enjoy it. Um, I'm just going to show you some of these examples. And I know to the window reveal, obviously, if you have the window reveal already, this is just going to fit in perfectly with everything. But the thing is, is each set was so popular on their own. So these beautiful images, the balloons, the gifts, the bunting, all of this um, has been so popular on its own that crafters have given you a bundle uh, to go with but also they work on their own don't they they certainly do so yes yeah, so the as you were saying the reveal window unfortunate mechanism was unfortunately 
sold out. Uh -huh. But <gasps> what you've got to do is it, I don't want it to take away from the amazing um, stamp sets that we've got. Well, this is it. So, you know, I don't, let me just turn this one around. So this one is the Reveal the Mighty Oak. And you've got the gorgeous tree, you've got the leaves, you've got the squirrel, you've got some lovely sentiments, and you've got the dyes that go with it. Yeah. So it's, it would be such a shame to miss out on yeah. all of those. Well, because the those. If, if that didn't say pull me, Corinne, yeah. um, sounded like an invitation then, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> that came out before you thought it through. It did, it, it did. <laughs> you got to Oh dear. Think crazy, think before you speak. Um, but if oh. you didn't have the little tag on there, um, they're beautiful images, aren't they? They really they're just are. Gorgeous. Yes, they yeah. really are. They're really beautiful. Oh, I love them. Thank you for bringing... Oh, look at this little cute caterpillar. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. You see, they are stunning, aren't they? They're but can beautiful. Can I show you? Nice. With the stamps, look at that. Look at how big those stamps are. Yeah. I mean, oh all of those stamps, that's just one set. There are so many. I love these little ones down here with the wellies, with the sunshine, oh. with the rainbow. Aren't they absolutely gorgeous? So forget the fact that it, it calls them reveal the, the rainbow. This is just a lovely rainbow set of stamps. That's it. Yeah. It just seems such a shame, like you say, that the reveal... Um, the reveal element has sold out, but why can't we just use it anyway? Look at the little squirrel. I love squirrels so much. Where my mum and dad live, Corinne, we can see the red squirrels from there. <gasps> red window. squirrels. Yeah, oh, yeah, you said they're Scotland. up in Scotland. Yeah. Yes. So lovely. They're just gorgeous. Did you? Oh, I'm not sure you're allowed to do that, Ellie. <laughs> The conversations we've had today. Ellie, Ellie, I don't think she meant to. Um, a cheeky squirrel stole one of Ellie's triangular shaped cheesy crisps. Other brands are available. <laughs> um, oh, well, I love the peacock as well. Isn't that? He's lovely, lovely, isn't he? Yeah. He's a beauty. It wasn't a chilly heat wave, surely not. No, that poor squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted it. <laughs> They're my squirrel's fault. Actually. Squirrel's fault. He should have just <laughs> taken it. That's it. That's my favourite flavour, actually. Is it? So, yeah, it's good. Um, the congratulations, they're bubbly there as well. The bottom, they're such fun and such lovely images, aren't they? They're beautiful. There we go. I've taken them all off their beautiful stands. I don't know why I did that, really. Could you? <laughs> Sorry, Dan. Um, they just show you. Well, I love this little caterpillar. Really, really gorgeous. Um, the, the phones have gone absolutely wild again. Everybody's loving these. Um, so thank you for bringing us such a tremendous deal. So you're going to show us how to use these without the reveal. I am. I am. I'm you? just so can... making sure I've got all my pens ready. We can do that. Right. So what I'm going to do is we can do that. Let's do this with our rocker block. Like I say, rocker blocks they they scared me when i first got them and that's just because i was i was scared of failing with them but there is absolutely no reason why you should so look at this so i love this little stamp the whole scene is there on the stamp come on stick that's the details actually for the stamping mat and the rocker block you got five elements in this bundle for 12.98 it's great isn't it Okay, right, so all I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, oh, perhaps I should have done this on the platform because I need it quite exact, but we'll get there, we'll get there, right. So I'm going to ink onto there, make sure it's inked all over, and then I've already cut my little square, so all I want to do is centre that one up. There we go, I can do this with a rocker block, and I don't need a safety harness either. There we go, and look at that. Isn't that so oh, cute? Love it. So we're gonna take the next Very one sweet. of my stamps. I'm gonna take that gorgeous sunshine. Let's then just get a little bit. Now I'm stamping these onto Nina card okay. because Nina card is the perfect card for, um, with your al al alcohol pen. Sorry, it's not uh, sticking. Okay. Can't see why it's not sticking to my my, my, stab, my rocker. What block. is it about the Nina card again? Is that it's, it's, it's the one with the longer fibres to it. That's right. And because it's got the longer fibres, the ink can wick down it. There we go. Do you see? Just literally yeah. rock and away, oh, and it's gorgeous. absolutely 
perfect. Now I've already cut a couple of the little clouds out and they're from um, one of the other ones. So I've just picked that one out. That one is from there. They're just from one of the other sets with the little clouds on. So that's perfect. And then we've got these. And then it's just about colouring them. So just doing simple things like coming in here. Let's come in here. I'll go in with my paler colour. Because this is an... Oh, let's do it on this one. This is um, um, alcohol. I've done it with my alcohol proof ink okay. and we can just come in first. So I'm going in with my CT1, which is my citrus blend. And we can Ooh. just come over here. It's just such a beautiful image, isn't it? It's it is. Gorgeous. So once you've done that, we're then just going to go just round the edges, just in nice little circular movements with the um, CT2, just to add in that definition. And then we're just going to go with the dark colour around the edge and just little circular movement. So it's nice, it, it blends it as it's yeah. going. It sort of just blends. It's and such a professional finish. It does. It? If you want to just go back in, just to blend all those colours together, just go over it with your darker one. And that's the alcohol pens that yes. you're using there, yeah. isn't it? These are, our, yeah, our tri-blends. That's right. So we can go on there. Actually, I might just go with the middle one, I think. They'll show, they'll show up a little bit more so just come across here now i want to i might have a bit darker gray let's see if i can find if i brought a paler gray with me i've got my pale one there i brought so many bits you know and you have to bring so much with you right i have a my gray might be hopefully what's this one bg5 so what i'm going to do instead of because you've got a white clouds yeah you don't you you don't need to colour them. Yeah. But you they're... want them to have dimension. Uh -huh. So all I'm going to do is go round the edges of them. Really, I could do with a bit paler grey. I'll show you one that I've already done. I've brought the wrong grey, but you'll get the gist. So you can come round the edges just to add that little bit of definition. Beautiful. And then, want... so I'm not trying to do straight lines. Can you see? Just sort yeah. of... Jiggly it's giving that. it a bit of texture. It's making it look more fluffy, isn't it? It is. And then I'm going to go, yeah, blue turquoise. And then I'm going to come round with my blue turquoise. I'll do it round the um, rainbow oh. and my palest one. And then that will make it look like it's lifting up. That's such a clever tip. That's amazing. Can you see how that's yeah. now? Does that now look like it looks like it's coming off the page it does doesn't it it's lifted and yeah. i would come round here with this and i would come round there and i'd go all the way around the bottom just here and then do it round there so i'd carry on like that wow. until i'd got that one colored oh, and then so i'd get that good. now that little sun uh -huh. just cut out with the dye so Brilliant. you don't have to f even you don't even have to fussy cut it out so it makes it really, really easy. So once I've got those, so I've got a topper, I've got an extra little bit, I've got a couple of little clouds, and I've also stamped from here, you are my sunshine. Ah. So I've got my you are my sunshine just there. There you go. Beautiful. So all of that's just come from this set of stamps. That's, that's one of the sets of stamps. Oh one gosh, of the sets of stamps. Six sets like that that yep. you're getting for less than £18. It's exactly. crazy. So 51 elements you're getting in this bundle. Um, the details are just on screen. NY2025, okay? 51 elements and you're getting all of this, okay? So six incredible sets with the dies, with the stamps for so much fun and just beautiful beautiful um, ideas it's just gorgeous right so all i'm going to i'm actually going back in with my color your world paper pad you will notice we all are loving this paper pad um at work it is such such a fun one isn't it it's yeah the colors are beautiful and what i like about this 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 sheet itself is it's not a white background so it's really uh, nice yeah. so it's like not too perfect if that makes yeah. sense which is really nice i'm just doing all of this with my um um multi-purpose glue i forgot some of those all purpose um, glue that's that's on the website isn't it i think if you haven't got that tacky glue would work just as well but then so again would finger lift tape red liner tape yeah. all the mats and layers that i've done all the building of the card 
all of those could be done with any of those mediums. And again, just like we were doing earlier, I'm using black card to really make those colours pop. Because you'd think, oh, I've got some bright colours here. I really need to, you know, to match it up to one of the mm. colours, but um, make make it match. So you could either use, we say, Ellie Sandwich glue. I said, I said this is the all purpose or the tacky glue. It okay. really doesn't matter. I just like. I think we might have some of the tacky glue on, actually. All right. Bit, we've got that a bit of a perfect. deal, actually, I think, Corinne. There we go. Um, so the tacky glue, you can use in much the same way, can you? Yeah, Just exactly. Use it for all yeah. your projects. It's coming on. There we go. So I'm going to pop those on there. I've then got... That's lovely. Just it's so it? bright, isn't so it? It's lovely. There we go. Oh, and then that. I've got some foam pads. Where's my foam pads gone? There we go. I've got some foam pads just here. I'm just going to lift this up just here. There we go. Thanks, yeah. Dan. They find everything for you. They, they do, quick, don't they? they? They just get everything. There Honestly, are. they're just on it, these guys. They're absolutely super. Um, oh, it's quick dry as well, I see, with the tacky yep. Oh, it's very clever. There we go. Mm. Is it the three bottles? Three for two. You're going oh. to get a triple pack and it should be £14.97. pence. But it looks like we're going to do a bit of a cheeky deal. Three for two, should be £9.98. £9.98 yeah. for three bottles. Um, and a bottle like this is going to last you a long time. Oh, it's going to last ages. Yeah. I, yeah. I mean, I'm, use, use much, I'm using them all the time. No, you don't want to use too much. This no. doesn't warp your card, but if you soak your card, it would. Okay. So, you know... You, the less is more. Oh, yeah. And the yeah. Th point is, it's tacky glue. Oh, I'll show you. I'll show you something. Yeah. If I've just got one minute. I'll stick this on and I'll show you. Hopefully, I... Yep, well, it's got I've a got good it. little twisty nozzle as well that yeah. doesn't get... Um... Now, don't think Ooh. it's just a paper glue. Okay. Well, I see this. I'm going to pass you something. Pass you something. I started carrying this in my bag. Right. So, this is something... I went round my craft room. Oh, yeah. And I stuck things to a board with tacky glue. There you go. Oh, look. To show you. Oh, my gosh. I love this. Wow. Just to show you how gosh. versatile... Tacky glue is. Now, this oh, is just so really good, rough and ready. That's brilliant. So, this is just things from my car. Ribbons, metal. We've got metal br um, metal cogs on there. Little glass stone on there. We've here got glass well. stones on there. We've got oh. sizal. We've got glitter. All your little got... pegs for your pegboards yeah. and things. Oh, All of that has been stuck on using tacky glue. That's great. Because once it's stuck, it's one of the strongest glues. That you're that that you're gonna you know you're gonna you're gonna find. Yeah. So it's absolutely brilliant. That's absolutely yeah. superb, isn't it? Right, it's we've got it. loads of people coming in for the tacky glue as well. Oh, um, okay, we've got less than fifty opportunities for the bundle, so we are quite limited actually. Remember, you're getting three for the price of two, so nine pound ninety eight for three bottles of your tacky glue. It's gonna last for ages and Is ages. It 100 mil, 100 I think. 100 mil, it's 106 grams. And I like the fact you've got the twisty nozzle there as well. Yes. It's a nice thin nozzle as yeah. well, isn't it? So all, all you do is detailed. twist it shut as soon as you can. And if you, when you come back to it, if you feel it's not it's not flowing straight away, then just you might see there's just a little bit of uh, uh, glue over okay. the top and just yes. unstick it. Pull right, it. and there we go. Let's How see. about oh. like that? Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? So you can see, all right, these were initially oh. labelled with the reveal, the window, but Love they are that. just a beautiful yeah. collection of stamps. That is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. So beautiful. That could be for a new baby. It could be for a birthday. Yeah, just anything. Before, you know, have a bright day, have a good day. It could yeah, be so anything, many things, yeah. couldn't it? It's stunning. Um, oh, my gosh. You have to come in for this bundle once again. I mean, these two bundles, actually, that you've brought in this hour, Corinne, are just fantastic. The details coming up on your screen right now are for the, um, the six that you're seeing right now. Loads of you have come through um, for this. NY2025 um, is your product details there. And if you want to dial through, 0800 001 4433. Um, but do you know the quickest and easiest thing to do, to be honest, is to just go on the website, um, hobbymaker.co.uk, and they also see on the website, you'll see everything that's been here on the show today as well. So you can still shop, you can still come in for things. Um, there's the tacky glue deal there. Um, you've got 
tons and tons to come in for here as well which is just really really wonderful so that's all available and doesn't matter how much of it you buy you could buy one of everything from the whole show today and it's still only one p and p so isn't that wonderful does it anyone is. else do that 3.95 for a whole i don't know of anybody that does no constantly yeah one price p, &P. That's it. they might do it as a one-off yes for a special occasion like a birthday we do it every single day different sizes different weight it really doesn't matter you could have bought a machine you could have got our joy you could have got um one of the amazing die cutting machines it really doesn't matter it's still only one p and p um now we've got another fantastic i'm so to glad you. we've got time oh, for this because yes. this is super you did exciting. a little skip then i know i know because so i love scratch and reveal <laughs> i mean yeah, who cool. if you were given a project a card a present uh a anything with scratch and reveal element i defy you not to have a scratch yeah it's just so so much fun oh i love it i know there is something about it isn't there it's there always is. is it is it because we associate it with that hope as well of maybe winning the lottery is I it, think gonna... it probably is, isn't it? <laughs> it's just that excitement but it is it's fun and it's interactive yes. and anything that's interactive just makes us excited of yeah, it doesn't it and exactly. again it makes your cards stand out yep doesn't it yep mm. yeah absolutely so shall we have a look so what you're getting is it's oh, a yeah. double pack so you've got oh um, <laughs> i did i was so excited you know, we're not gonna say, yeah you've got go. two kits you've got oh baby and birthday treats oh, and in cool. each one of these you're going to get a set of stamps and a set of your foil Revealed. I don't know what the true word. What is the word for them? I don't know. I don't know. They're, I'll show you. These are them. Scratch, scratch revealed. These cards. are the scratchable bits. So if you think on your lottery and everything. Oh yeah. These are what these are. So you're getting. You've got one of each for each design. So you've got the lovely heart, the circle, the tags. So uh -huh. you've, got, you've got it in gold, silver, and that rose gold. Then you've got different size hearts ones again in the gold, silver, wow. and. The, and then you've got like the speech bubbles oh. and stars. So basically what you're doing is whatever you want to reveal uh -huh. goes behind the, you need to be, you pick, okay. a, you pick a reveal the size of what you want, whether it's a picture, whether it's a I message. See. And then you put that behind it. Yeah. Um, my brain is not computing with what's okay. going on because there are 164 elements yep. in this. And there's a clock on screen. We're already at an amazing deal. I know. So. You're going to get one pack of those in the um, Oh Baby, and you're yes. going to get another pack of nine sheets in your oh, birthday treat. Gosh. So you're going to be able to make so many projects yeah. with this. Oh, Never my. Th this is incredible. Seriously, seriously amazing. You could put a pound coin in the card as well, so they've got something. Yep. To, you know, it's like, it's like when you give someone a purse, you're meant to put a... You're not putting a clock on again. You're not, are you? Ellie. She's got, you're putting in, we're not stopping at 9.99. Is she serious? Oh, I thought Sorry. we were. I thought oh. we were as well. For two sets. For two whole sets, you've got 164 elements of scratchable okay. shapes and wonderful sentiments. This is amazing. And uh, gosh, the fun you're going to have making. Yeah. And you're going to show us how it works, I am. It, aren't you? Because I'm still sort of thinking, so hold on, what goes under? And Oh my, okay, it's getting very, very, very busy. Um, do make sure, at the moment, um, we're already giving you a crazy it's deal like at 9 99 Buy right one, now, get one half price. It is, isn't it? Or is it buy one, get one free? Because it's meant to be 14 99 I think. Wow. It? That is superb. Um, they're 15 98 So they're £8, it, what, £7.99 each? And you've got the two for £7.99? Yeah, that's ridiculous. So even if you've bought one of these before, the, are you going to get another set of stamps? And look at how many stamps you're going to get. Oh this gosh, is just in the baby it? one. Wow. This is just in the baby one. Look at how many Whoa. stamps you're getting. That is unbelievable. I mean, just for that one sheet of stamps, seven ninety nine is a brilliant deal, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. But you get to, it's really, really exciting. Um, loads of you coming through. Teresa, Elizabeth, Ali's there, Lynette, well done, Linda and Catherine, Amy, Eddie's back as well. Great to have you here. Tyler, where Mersey's side. The phones have gone bonkers. Um, so how does it work? So what do right. you do first? What's okay, so I'm going to use my stamp. So you've got loads of stamps. So I'm just going to alternate between some of the... I'm just going to put some on here and I'll show you one. So I'm actually going to use my flagstone ink pad, which is just a little bit paler 
than my um, black. Okay. So I'm just going to go in and I'm just going to stamp. <gasps> Oh, this. aren't they cutely? I mean, I you could, could use those anyway, couldn't you? You could use these anywhere. Yeah. Uh, how about a new baby card? Um, um, uh, what's the word I'm thinking for? A baby shower. Oh, do you know what? To oh, say I speak for lovely. a living today, my words. I don't know where they've gone. I think they've gone on holiday. I think they're oh, ready for the bank holiday, I aren't have they? That all the time, but my my words disappear constantly. I know. I think I, know. I think you're doing all right. <laughs> <laughs> I think my husband would <laughs> say. <laughs> Wishful thinking on Colin's part, bless him. No, there we are. So you just pop these all the way. And this is what we're going to do for this one. Just put them wherever you want. Look at that. A perfect print every single time. Oh. So I've got this one and then let's go with, oh, I want to do the heart. I like the heart. So we can put the heart on and then we can pop this on. So a um, rough pattern doesn't have to be a perfect pattern. So I can just pop these on. These are so transferable to all your other projects yeah. though, aren't they? Oh, yes. All the stamps here you yeah. can use, whether you use them with the, um, the I was about to say scratch and sniff then. <laughs> well, if you want to spray no. it with some perfume, we were talking perfume we earlier. Were. Do you remember those though? Remember the oh, yeah. scratch and sniff stickers yeah. in the 90s? Yep. Yeah, they were good. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, because you used to be able to get scented ink pens as well. Do you remember? Oh, yeah, yeah. I think you still can sometimes. The little gel, the little, yeah, little um, snowy gel pens. Gel yes. So yeah. the last one I'm going to do is just to do the little safety pin. I think the, these are just the most gorgeous little stamps. Oh, Look at these, I aren't love they? These. Beautiful. That's They're gorgeous. just so much fun. Beautiful. Let's come on here. There we go. How much? I'm just making my background at the moment. Just popping these. On. I cannot believe how many stamps you're getting for 7 99 I know. Never mind the scratching element, just the fact that you're getting all these stamps for life. Mm. They're amazing quality as well. They're from Crafters Companion, so obviously the quality is superb. Um, and they're going to last forever if you look yeah. after them. And you can use them for so many different... Oh, my gosh, you've got, you've got to come in for this because I just... I don't think I've ever seen anything like it. You've got 164 elements for 7 99 in what world does that make sense? I know, I know. <laughs> it's wonderful. So I've done that as my background, and then I've got a little circle, and I've got, here it says, we're excited to say. Oh, so, so we're excited to say yes. So I'm going to take that, and I'm just going to pop this one on to this piece of, there we go, so you can put that on there. And then I've got this one here. So we're excited to say, so you've, you've got to stamp your message. Okay. So our message is, it's a girl, um, which is, there's boy, there's his, there, it's a girl. Now, what oh, you'll notice... You your gender reveals and everything. Yep. Oh, this is mega. So do that, and I'm going to do another circle, and I'm going to pop that one on there. There we go. So, we're, so there's my message. But at the moment, if I put that on the front of my card, everyone's going to see what my card is. So I've because it's dry. I've stuck that one onto just a little disc, mm -hmm. just a little silver disc, and then I'm going to get my scratch and reveal disc. Okay. So all I'm going to do is peel it. Now, can you see how shiny that is yeah. on the back? So what I'm doing is I've actually peeled off the foil and a clear sheet ah, of adhesive. Ah, okay. So I'm going to take that and I'm yeah. going to just cover up Oh, so it's like sentiment. a double layer. It's like a double layer. Oh, that's so clever. Okay, so we've got, we're excited to say, that could be you're invited to a party. That could be we're moving house. It could be whatever yeah. you want it to be. So what I've got is I've got a little card here and I've got that element that oh, I've just stamped. So is it weird this is making me, actually I can't say that out loud because just in case my husband's watching, you'll panic. <laughs> Be broody. <laughs> How's that for a long time? <laughs> you say, don't you remember how many times you were woken up by the kids last night? <laughs> yes, uh, yes, very true, very true, Corin. Bring me back to her. <laughs> Are you really after last night? No, no, <laughs> no. I was children early. early. Yeah, she's children. Eight. Yeah, Hazel was awake in the night. Bless her. She's having a little, a little she's... sleep regression. <laughs> you oh. thought you'd be past sleep regression at eight, didn't you? Yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. Poor little thing. She'll hopefully be all right tonight. Because... <laughs> Fingers, Fingers crossed, crossed this, <laughs> Mum. Right, so we're just going to pop this one onto here. So we've just got a little banner. And then I've got a, um, 
a little disc that I'm going to pop in the centre. Now, the other things, look at this. So you've got a little, lovely little vet baby vest. I've got a dummy and a bottle. And I've just oh. cut these out already because we're going to go over time already. I've cut these out and coloured them so we can just give them a little shape. So a little bit of a clue because we've done it in pink. So there we go. We can pop this onto here. If you wanted to colour all of um, these, then you, you can. Oh, mm. I lost my little baby's bottle. I don't know where it's gone. I'll find it in a minute. And then I need another... Uh, um, after a foam pad. Oh, I, I was very tidy and I put them away. <laughs> I would just... You're too efficient, Karen. I was there, yeah, wasn't I? Yeah. So I'm going to put one on, on the back of here that says, we're excited to say... And put that there then uh -huh. i'm going to put a let's put this one on next and then i'll put the arrow on so i've got another little foam pad just there so this is the one where we've got the reveal if you remember this is our secret and it could be anything anything you want oh, at all so, lovely. so you can do that and i've got a little a little arrow just to sort of direct everybody where to go just in case they weren't sure See, Come that's on. a gorgeous touch as well, isn't it? There we so. are. So I can put my little arrow just there. I'm gonna I'm gonna put a little bow just here. So this is my card as I would send it. Okay. I should have a little baby's bottle, but it's blown away. Oh, it's there. Look, I thought. What's I'd going got on it. over there? So could you hear that noise then? Is Jimmy hoovering up? Is it? Yeah, I thought he was for a minute there. I was thinking you can wait five minutes, Jimmy. <laughs> Okay, so look at this. So this is my card. How that is super cute gorgeous. is that? I mean, that is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I but think that is beautiful. If I turn it round, I'm going to turn it round so you can see uh -huh. it from overhead. So if I receive that card, a pound coin or a what yeah. have you. So we're excited to say, and then all they would do ah. is they would take this and then... They would scratch. Oh, and I've not put it quite straight, but there we go. There oh, we go. Yeah, that's yeah, a... Yeah, that's a, nice to say we're getting married. Yeah, or, that's a top um, tip is mark the back of your um, thing before you stick it down of which way up you've stamped it. <gasps> I forgot to mention that bit and I... Oh, that. There that we go. is so amazing. Take that off neatly, but there you go. That's your reveal. And you've Love got... It all of these oh to reveal gosh. with so you can get some quite big you messages can, in there can't you? how about know. that the time's go. just gone i can't I believe it it's amazing. i'm glad we got that one in i'm Listen, glad we got that one in you can still buy it just make sure you get it because that deal is crazy corinne you're back next wednesday, wednesday. wednesday. yes you're back on wednesday it'll be wonderful we'll see you then you've got a big day tomorrow too see you soon <laughs> okay. want to know what's going on in the next show then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk.